Hello everyone, and welcome to a special little video. As you can tell, this video is super long. Anyways, this is my unabridged full stream of Side Night and Happiness's Freak Apocalypse, brought to you by Explosum, of course, and Serenity Forge. I got to stream this as a pre-launch event. As you know, the game drops today, so how do I already have like three hours of game footage? Because I got to play it early. Yeah, all right, that's cool. Anyways, the game releases today. Go check it out. I will be linking it in the, the description below because I didn't do everything there is to do in this game because, once again, I will do that on my own time. I want you to go check out the game for yourself and leave something for your imagination. Anyways, thank you for being here. We'll be doing a regular cut-up version of this later, but here is the unabridged stream of Side Night and Happiness's Freak Apocalypse. Enjoy. So let's uh, let, let's go ahead and fire this thing up. What do you say? Yo, 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 you want to fire this thing up? You want to you, you wanna do this? You want to do this? Because I want to do this. Enter username. Wait. There we go. I rib. <gasps> hey. Thank you for that, Sodium. I appreciate that sub, friendo. Four months. Really? Already? Already? Look at that epic beard. Oh, thanks. I'm going to go get me a new wooden comb today so that way I can, like, really get it. Mm. But here till the oh you gotta get you gotta get ready for work don't you dude or you got you got plans you got plan you got plans without the off the audacity. Nah, I appreciate you being here, Chris. And like I said, I'll do. You don't have to like necessarily be here by the end of stream as long as you enter the raffle. Hey, what up, lunchbox? How you doing? Hey, lunch. How, how you how you doing, boo boo? Uh, they moved you to tools. Hey, I work. It got loud. It got loud. It got a, it got loud and aggressive. Hold on, hold on. Let's we'll do a thing here in a minute. We're gonna we're gonna enjoy this. All pass to hell. <laughs> yes, destroy everything educational. Uh, I uh, can't remember uh, what AP Bio. Uh. Soon, everything educational will be destroyed thanks to Dr. Dropout! <laughs> You'll never get away with this, Dr. Dropout! There'll be no brain drains on my watch! <laughs> Your nerd powers won't work on me, Psionic Steve! I removed <laughs> my brain long ago! I won't be oh, the only brainless him. moron in this school once I dip everyone in my patented stupid goop. <laughs> ah, get your hands off me! I'm gonna kick your ass! Get Zooks! I gotta <gasps> it's save us. him! But I can't do it when I'm dressed as a mild-mannered everyday coop. This looks like a job for Super Coop! Super Coop, let's go. Super Coop, my favorite protege. You are here to save us all. Per usual. Ha-ha! I am speaking to you using my telepathic powers! Which he won't have for long. I just realized, look at his name. It's Psionic Steve with a P. Psionic Steve, my very close personal friend. I can hear you using my <laughs> telepathic powers. Listen, Coop. It's Super Coop. Not it's not random. Many droogs from destroying Shoot. Education. But first, you need to use your super walking powers to reach them. Okay. I will walk you through the steps of this walking walkthrough with you. Walk this way. Slightly to the left. Hurry, Super Coop. Okay. Welcome to Free Apocalypse. You play as our reluctant hero, Coop. Help him navigate all sorts of terrible, horrible, no good, very bad situations by pointing at and clicking on everything you see. We'll show you the basics. Okay. God, you did it. I love point and clicks. Be done for before the day is done. All in a day's work. I hear somebody getting the shit kicked out of them. <laughs> Rightly so, my clever comedic companion. Now, onward to the gymnasium. Not so fast, Super Coop. He's just One kicking the, the shit out of this kid. Deadly droogs. Droogs. If only there was a way to disable and dispose of that dastardly dum-dum. Direct your attention in his direction. Let's beat his ass. Sight, psionic Steve. Please call me Steve on account of how close we are as friends. <laughs> Sea dog. Uh, no. He's beating the education out of that fellow student. If only there was a way to stop him. Perhaps 
perhaps a precarious punishment is perched in proximity to that perverse villager. That would be super convenient. Please, peruse. Perceptively peruse. Peruse. Aha. He's allergic to nuts. You never cease to amaze. The teachers back in the old days. But wait. Look to the left. Help him. Oh wait, the shotgun. Grab the shotgun. Guns when I have powers of the mind. Oh, we're not gonna get the gun. Okay. Looks like he still has his wits about him. Good. Do we need to help him up? Don't worry, citizen. Those head injuries are nothing a little studying can't fix. Raven, did you just invite me to play Apex Legends? <laughs> I'll save the high fives for when Doctor Dropout is defeated. Okay. All right, I want to I want to do a little bit of volume. Uh where, where where's the where's the audio? There it is. So we're going to drop the music down just a tad. Dialogue's good, but with dialogue up, we can go ahead and move master back up and boom. Okay, look to the left. Let's see. We can click on just about anything, right? <gasps> Ain't no smarty brains getting in here or they'll get their smart brains blown out. <laughs> yeah. Dumb people only. Yeah, especially me, because I'm dumb. <laughs> yeah, but I'm stupider. That's why the boss <laughs> likes me best. Okay, that's fair. Ooh, okay. I love the horses <laughs> at the fair. Oh, yeah, and the cotton candies. <laughs> the fair. I, there stands a deadly it's a good question. <laughs> arms are armed with deadly bullet dispensing danger. If only there was a way to disarm the armaments from their arms. Quickly, think. Time is of the essence. Let's see here. Coop, I just remembered your oh. super lit backpack. All the guys covet, and all the girls love it. I think it is neat. What up, XP? How you doing? You collect in it, like an inventory of sorts. This so feels like a dream. So cool. Hey, thanks, Steve. It's my favorite. I wonder how you could possibly trap those terrible transgressors. Say, what do you keep in such a super cool backpack anyway? I have always wondered. Let's find out, shall we? <gasps> a Chinese finger trap. Hey, get <laughs> your gun off my gun. Uh -oh, our guns are in love. Let go. No, you. Got him. What up, Polar? How you doing? Super cool. You confounded those criminals with a culturally appropriate Confucian contraption of ancient Chinese confusion. Confusion. Congrats. Now to successfully the caffeine high. Oh God. I'm still working on coming down from that so by supplementing it with more I caffeine. I can't believe we pulled it off. Pull harder. No, pull softer. Okay, wait, you pull, uh, and then I pull. Oh, sneeze. Okay, on your count of three. That's not how that works. Ready? One. <sighs> uh, uh, <laughs> they can't count to three. Maybe we should use our mouths on the guns. Maybe you should. How about your service dog in a doctor's Super office? Super we're safe! Good. Scoop, scoop. Yeah, well, good. Well, Fuck that guy. Well, if it isn't Super Coop, which I'm pretty sure it is, isn't it? You bet your brainless belfry, Doctor Dropout. Well, you'll lose that bet because I don't even know what a belfry is, and soon neither will you. Once I've destroyed every book, every brain, and every school, you will be just another drooling dummy on this big flat Earth. Just like me. <laughs> the only thing flat on this earth will be your face once I'm done with you. Better get a move on. Your friends will be stupefied by then. What up, Titan? Allow me to demonstrate. Coop, help me, man. Sorry for all the bullying, but you gotta, you gotta help me out. My favorite color is applesauce. <laughs> oh no! This is just the beginning. But enough talk. How about you? So you fools! Get him! Get him! Now is your chance, Super Coop. Give me just one second. 
Okay, real quick, I was gonna let you know. So I have stream element set up just to clarify that a raffle has been happened. If you hit it and it doesn't show, you're still entered. But if you want to double tap, if you want to go ahead and double tap it just to be safe, go for it. <gasps> Wait, I see a thing. I know the more powerful I become soon I'll be the most stupidest most powerful being in the universe is that a college degree can I grab that it's sitting too high atop this flaming pile of knowledge nothing my super coup powers couldn't handle oh use your brain use your super coup powers then Brilliant. what up CC of the galaxy welcome in friendo to graduation. Enjoy your student debt, Dr. Dropout. Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna defeat him. What's this? Congratulations, Dr. Dropout. You're now a high school graduate. And you're the valedictorian. Way to go! What? Now that's sticking it to him. No! This can't be possible! I don't want to be smart! A transformation of this magnitude to my cerebellum is only possible through- Oh my god! Wow. Boss should look smart. But Boss said we're supposed to destroy everything smart. Yeah, you're right. Let's get him. No! <laughs> no, you don't. Get them, not me. Cease your incessant locomotion. Stop! You saved us, Super Coop. As a matter of Will fact. you go to prom with me? I do. You saved us all, Super Coop. Way to put your mind to it. Now you are my hero. Cooper? Is that you, Mom? I, I fuck, I knew it. I, I thought you were dead. Yes, oh. Coop, we are dead. And we're so proud of you. It was a day it was all a daydream. It was all a daydream. Cooper! Mr. McCarthy! Huh? What? Y yes, Mr. Murphy. Were you paying attention? Uh What did I just say? Um something about obtuse angles? Uh Right? Wrong! Everyone, point and laugh! <laughs> <laughs> well, 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 look what we have here. Uh, wait, give that back. What was that? Couldn't hear you, Cooper. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Do us a favor and try not to waste all of our time. You suck, Coop. Let's shove him into a locker, and then shove that locker up his ass. Now, now. Nobody chastised Coop until I've had a chance to chastise him first. What I was saying, if you'll be so kind as to join yeah, us, Coop. What up, Pinata? The word of the day is exposition. As you all know, graduation is just around the corner, so today you'll all be filling out your career aptitude tests. These tests will help determine what careers you might excel at, if any. Oh no! I did Hi, sir. I was How are you doing? And look where it got me. Ginger, true or false, fill in the dots, yada, yada. Just fill these out so we can all go home. Think you can handle that coop? Or is the fate of your future too boring? Yes, sir. I mean, no, sir. Yes, sir. No, sir. <laughs> Pussy. Fuck Don't that guy. Uh, Mr. Murphy, <laughs> will this affect any of our college applications? Maybe, maybe not. If you just fill it out honestly, you really won't have to worry about it. Now, will you, Sawyer? Uh, come on. I already filled this out last year. Oh, shit! Tavor! Yes, Thank you for that sub, boo-boo. Thank you. Think just because you were held back a grade that you get special privileges? Well, yeah. Wait. Hmm, you're right. You don't need to waste your time filling this out again. Just sit there and be handsome. And take off that crown. <laughs> Thank you. All right, class. What? You know the drill. No talking, no cheating, no questions. Heads down. What up, Doom? Just fill out the damn form and hand it in when you're done. Jesus Christ, Summer can't get here fast enough. That teacher's a fucking mood, dude. Oh, oh wow, that is that was a girthy boy. Career aptitude test. All right, wait, we get to fill this out on our own? Oh, okay, wait. Cooper McCarthy, Teacher Murphy. Successful people always establish career goals. I can't, I can't change them. I, okay, I can just start down here. Pillows are for muffling cries. Oh, wait, do I not get to mark this one? Okay, I guess we're just doing half the test. Hmm. 
Is Koop a total penis sexual? I'm gonna mark this one as true. I'm, <laughs> yeah. I'm doing good. Wait, I'm doing good. Hmm. Koop will make it to graduation alive? That's a false right there. <laughs> uh, eat a dick, Kent. I'll eat your dick, you gulch muncher. <sighs> what have I told you about standing up for yourself, Poop Koop? Hi, Eliza. Can color my eyeballs in with markers? Uh, again? That's right, Taint Tickler. Don't think for a second. It goes, that I'll eat your dick. It's almost over. Yeah, let's hold him down and tickle his taint for being so gay. What's all this ruckus? I said heads down. We're trying to concentrate on our aptitude test, and Coop won't stop hitting on us. Yeah, what? Coop, I told you, I'm not emotionally available to get into a physical relationship right now. Quit pressuring me, nut stump. No means no, Coop. Now quit being a creepy sex pest and finish your task! But... Yeah, but, uh, and I totally saw Coop trying to copy off Chet's test, too. What? But he's the one cheating! Yeah, well, he's the fucking time, idiot! I don't care if Kent is cheating on you! He's a beautiful free bird that no one can chain down! Just look into those deep, gorgeous eyes of his! Now get your test done, or else! Final warning! What a queefing, cheating, cheater queef! I'm gonna use a five point palm exploding heart technique on your tiny balls if you don't stop copying off me. That is it, Mr. Ooh, Cooper. I want soup. Since soup sounds good. Let these precious students focus on their tasks without cheating or pressuring them into premarital intercourse. Get your lecherous behind to the principal's office now. What the fuck? Right now, mister. <laughs> Sayonara, dipshit dick turd. <laughs> Now, God damn it! Okay, chore acquired, impermanent record, and oh, I got. Wait, what is this? Can I? That's Sawyer. She's my oldest friend. Oh. Well, my only friend. At least I think she's my friend, or she's just being polite. Can we? Can we? Quit gossiping, Coop. She's out of your league. Everyone is. Okay, you can go fuck yourself. Okay, uh, American schools are a hundred percent like this. Titan, a hundred percent. Time to head to the principal's office. Down the hallway to the red door of doom. Why is my why is my locker shitty? Damn it! It's jammed shut from all the times I was smashed into it by bullies. I could pop it open if I had a pencil. Do I have a pencil? Of course not. Of course I don't have a pencil. Oh, let's go into the janitor's closet. Damn, the door's oh. locked. I've always wondered what creepy stuff the janitor keeps in there. Oh, oh wait, hold on. That's the faculty office. I, I don't. Go to the principal's office first. Oh, I can't go. I can't go do things. Can I do? Can I do things? Now's not the time for hydration. Okay, I do got to go do the thing. Let's five minutes in a British school. I know, too polite. God. Come on in, Coop. Have a seat. We both know why you're here. Wait, why are you here? I'm in trouble. Shanked. You're right, you're in trouble. I heard you were cheating on a test <laughs> while sexually pressuring other students, including our beloved Kent. That's not There's true. always time for hydration. Oh, sure, I've heard it all before. Hmm, let's see. Oh, there's so many things wrong with you. Where to begin? It's lecture time, Coop. Do you want to hear the long version or the short version? Uh, the long uh, version? The long version, I guess. It keeps me out of class. Coop, what are your goals? How do you plan to score them? What would make you win the big game called life? Uh, I guess I've always wanted to help people. Help people with their troubles and problems. You know, kind of like a superhero. Like Psionic Steve. And Psionic how's Steve. That working out for you? Uh, well, most people I try 27 to fights? Really I oh, dude, those are rookie this numbers. You gotta pump those up. <laughs> what kind of hero cheats on tests? What kind of champion gets his head shoved into a urinal every day? And no prom date? Pathetic! Even I have this a prom poor guy. Date. Wait. I'm not even allowed to. You know, anyone who's anyone has a prom date. People keep saying that. Keep it up, and it's no hashtag epic field trip to the local bomb shelter for Coop, and no prom. He does look like Fred's dad. <laughs> Three strikes means you struck out. Game over, Coop. Game over. 
You'll leave high school forever remembered as the guy who didn't score a touchdown, the weirdo who didn't have a prom date, the freak Wait. who didn't help anyone. But, Is that the kind of superhero you want to be? He's a, a he's a principal, no, sir, okay? It's just hard to focus on my goals or scoring goals when I'm tormented by bullies every day. It's hard to focus when my teacher shoots spit wads into my mouth whenever I yawn, or when Kent posts my internet search history on billboards all over town. Life is going to test you, Coop. You have to keep your eye on the ball. Huh. We're all balls in the same bag, Coop. You have to be a team player, like a sports team. Keep your eye on the ball and the other eye on the prize. Help the team cross the finish line and score a touchdown. You could pass or you could go for that three-pointer, but that wouldn't make you a team player. And if you don't pass, you fail. Not to put you down, but are you picking up what I'm putting down? I'm really not great with the uh, sports examples. It's a simile, Coop, like a metaphor with more likes. I want you to like your life. I want you to like, share, and subscribe to your own future. Are we on the same page? Speaking of pages, Coop. Speaking of liking, sharing, and subscribing. Record. <laughs> Dear I mean, you two partner, God, you skate. This is worse than I thought. This permanent record here. This is a loser's permanent record. Losers stay losers permanently. Only a loser would have this many strikes on his record. And losers don't get to go on the hashtag epic field trip to the local bomb shelter. Here I go, clicking my pen. The pen I'm using to mark this down on your permanent record to make you a permanent loser. Permanently. With permanent ink. Please don't. It, it won't happen again. I, Poor I'm sorry kid. I've been acting up lately. I guess I have been feeling pretty directionless. I don't really have much of a positive role model in my life. I mean... They're psionic Steve, but he's a, uh, he's not exactly real. I really could use someone real Stay to talk to, you toes. know? I, I guess I... Oh. What's this? A distracting phone call? Uh, get, get the pin. Don't you know I'm in the middle of leaving a red mark on a kid's future? Permanently? What's that? Stacy broke her pelvis during the split. By the way, Turtle Pasta, 100%. The cheer squad. My time to shine. I'll be right there. Go Narwhals! Wait. Hold on. Yeah, don't forget Kingdom Hearts is coming out on Epic 2. Use my code. I'm going to start being like that one guy on TikTok. Like, now follow me, you fucking idiots. That dude cracks me up. Guess what I'm having for breakfast? Is it toast? Is it cocaine? Okay. I'll deal with your permanent record later. I have to go do something that's far more important than fixing your life. Now sit here and think of every word I've said. And oh, it's cocaine? Look at, touch, or touch to a <laughs> okay, so I'm going to get... Wait, is that whiteout? Do I see whiteout on the left? Social media password. Spice Girls rule. How did... Wait. How did this game get my... You know, never mind. Yikes! I better find some way to alter my permanent record. There's wide out. Principal McNally sees it, or he'll never let me go on that field trip. As somebody who has altered his record in school, I know exactly to look for the f for the fucking wide out. Okay. Also, enter the giveaway, you fucking idiots. Free office supplies. Now let's go mark out our. You downloaded Dick Talk? Wait, I thought you had. Oh, that's a different thing. I was gonna say I thought we met on Dick Talk. No, you you we met on TikTok. Okay, we need wide out. Never mind. Tries to help everyone. Aquatic life. Psionic Steve, that's misspelled, versus the bronze brain. Pet rocks, companions for life. Seahorse made. Wait, oh, these are. Yeah, that's misspelled. It's supposed to be Psionic Steve with a P. Wait. Looked at technician entering restricted lab area blinded by science. Like a ninja. Okay, now I better go fetch the permission slip for the You saw that, right? Epic field trip to the bomb shelter from my locker. The hashtag epic assigned, field trip. Go on the trip, get closer to Sawyer. Whoops. And finally be safe from bullies and bombs. Not so permanent after all. Impermanent record. Oh, we we acquired a chore. I did not read it in time. That's okay. YOLO. Yolo. What's this old lady doing? Uh, no thanks. I don't want to grab that old lady. She's not my type. Oh, I thought she was about to say something like your loss. She looks busy enough without me pestering her. 
Can I get water? I need hydration. Talk Mother, to the water. May I see you pee? Ha! Oh wait, okay, we can't. All right, let's go. This is where I see my objectives, right? Chores. Okay, main chore, locker lamentations. Okay, locate my locker. Kinda easy to see, it's the one that's been smashed in because my face has been slammed in it too many times. Oh! Her name is Holly Pass. You just gotta grab a Holly Pass, but you're not gonna get one without a damn good reason though, so don't get your hopes up, Buster. Holly Pass? Don't you mean Hall Pass? No, they changed it on account of how great I am at this job. No, they didn't. Yes, they did. Nope. Yes, huh? Mr. Aizawa. Uh, yes, huh? Times a million. Damn, she has more yes, huhs than me. You win this round. <laughs> Dude, are you okay? Holly's been riding my ass since day one. I gotta find somebody who can help me make a fake hall pass. Then I can wander around freely without her constantly breathing down my neck. Why do... Why does she have a black eye? What you up to? Mark Huffington. That explains it. Are you huffing one of those scented markers? Will you go to a uh, prom with me? Have you wait? Have you ever used a marker for its intended purposes? So where exactly in the school would I score the good sniff? So where exactly in the school would one score the good sniff markers? In the school? Yeah, right. Those golden days have long since passed. Industrial grade markers got hardcore banned. Hardcore banned. banned. Uh, an anonymous student got busted snorting 32 of them in the air ducts during the Narwhals game, and it totally wasn't his fault that he huffboxed everyone in the gym below, or that the basketball team got highlighter lung and lost the championship. Fry leaf! How you, how you, how you so doing? Where can Hard. I, uh, score some? I heard there's a black marker dealer outside the school, but I can't feel my legs due to a completely unrelated fall from Black marker. I can't try to track him down. That's okay, fucking I'll brilliant. Sniff out the goods somewhere outside. Okay. Are you huffing one of those scented markers? <laughs> you mean that weak strawberry scented kindergarten shit? I only do the high grade black markers. High grade strawberry scented shit. You know the hard stuff. It's all used up. I'm starting to get a feeling back in my face again. Uh, that can't be good. You'll never get those brain cells back. Brain cells? <laughs> when am I playing Apex again? I don't know. Do Probably like stronger. The soon. School ban the super strong stuff, and you can only buy them on the black market now. Well, at least it's a cheap addiction. True. Uh, I, I'm gonna end up having to to get better with other legends because they nerfed the shit out of my boy, my, my gassy boy. So I'm gonna have to get I'm gonna have to get good. Smell you later. Can I grab them? I'm pretty sure Chet would pulverize me for being close to her. Actually, she'd probably oh, me too. There's my locker. I know, dude. Like, why do they look at how they massacred hey, my uh, boy? Guys, would you mind uh, stepping aside so I can get into my locker? Make out noises. Oh, that's just eyeliner, I think. Uh, they actually... Okay, so they took low profile away from Pathfinder, so he doesn't take as much damage now. So yeah, they actually kind of buffed him in a, in a way. Uh, let's see. Boy, you two sure are getting, getting at it hot and heavy, huh? It needed to be done. Shut up! <laughs> hey, the bell just rang. Did you hear it? You're going to be late for... Or, you know, this is actually starting to turn me on. You know... Actually starting to turn me on. Whoops, I clicked that wrong. Shit. He's really creeping me out. You perverted little shit. I'm trying to suck face with my babe. With my I babe. It. It's like watching two earthworms sumo wrestle. I just want to stare harder. That's it. I can't do this here. There's a great spot under the bleachers outside where we can continue our mega makeout session. Totally. But first... Hey everyone, Coop's a pervert who likes to watch us make out. You, you <laughs> asshole. Well, hey, hey, Malkari, how are you doing today? Welcome in. I know you. I know you from. I know you from from a string of emails and unread FAQ sheets. <laughs> I, uh, I, I was the big dumb. I'm, I, I'm a. Uh, 
I'm a professional, okay? After graduation, I'll miss having oh, my head I slammed into you, old buddy. Oh, how sweet. Two earthworms sumo wrestle. Okay, I need to find a pencil. Hey, dude, you got a pencil? What you looking at? I'm trying to pick out a new book to read. What kind of books do you like? I like all kinds of stuff, really. Basically, anything that doesn't focus on a meek... Fingers crossed. ...trying to help people out in an apocalyptic setting. Boring. Uh, yeah, I meekly agree. Need help finding something? Absolutely not. Well played. Uh, <laughs> oh, are we doing this? Are, are we doing this? Okay, hold on. Hold on. We gotta do. We got. We we gotta do the thing. ASMR warning, real quick for anybody who hates ASMR. I'm gonna give you a couple of seconds. I'm gonna mute that for a second while we go over here. Now things are about to get real weird. Okay, why is my why is it? Let's raise you up a little. There we go. Wait. There we go. That's better. Now we're gonna do this. If if yes, if you hate ASMR, when we switch back, you'll know it's over. Cause get ready for a mustache ride. I hope that was as good for you as it was for me. Let's get back to the game. Boom. Enjoy. <laughs> All right, let's go find us a pencil. Oh, wait. Is there a locker over here that's open? Just toss a banjo my way and call me Steve Martin. I received a novelty arrow. Wait a second. Whose emote is that? Because that looks suspiciously like me. <laughs> Say, are you done yet? Other people are thirsty too, you know. I tried to break the world record. <laughs> I just started. Uh, careful. You know you I don't know who Jesse Cox is. Too much water, right? Then I the, the but get the beard looks suspiciously like mine. I simultaneously question and admire your dedication. Also, your ability to speak while drinking. Wait, don't go in there! Oh, you know, I didn't want to go in there, but now here we are. We got, wait, why is there a packet of yeast? I've had to do my fair share of awful tasks, but getting yeast from the girls' bathroom is now right at the top of that list. Thanks for that. What? <laughs> Can we take the toilet paper? Like a soft double ply. Perfect for delicate ass cheeks like mine. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sweet! A med kit! I'll keep this around Oof. in case I get any critical wounds. <laughs> Yo, I'm not even gonna question it. I'm not even gonna question it. <laughs> hey, uh, what okay? up, Buns? How you doing, boo-boo? No, hey, by the way, by the way, y'all. Like, okay. Hey, Lucas! How, how you doing, BB? Scoot over. I'll join you. Um, like, why are you, it. like, talking to me? Oh. Uh, it's all right. I cry when I poop too. Okay, see that one right there. That one right there is, hits closer to home. XP, what are you? What are you doing? Oh my god, we're gonna we're gonna celebrate this for a second. We're gonna we're we're, we're gonna we're gonna celebrate. I don't have I don't have any white claws to fucking shotgun this time, but we're gonna we're gonna celebrate with like some. I need to. I, I'm gonna create new. Uh, hold on. We'll wait. You like that? Okay, so after this one, I'll, I'll, I'll give you a, a, a rundown of where that came from. That should be the last one. Okay, so I'm a huge Undertale fan, right? Like big, big, big Undertale fan. It's my favorite game. Uh, but I play a character from time to time on stream. His name is Zebo. He looks like this, uh, but with also face. He looks he looks like that, but also like this. He's a, he's a friend of mine. So I decided to take the sands, the skeleton motion, and put Zebo on top of it with all the, the badges around it. And I was like, you know what? I'm not a video editor. I'm not a graphic designer, but fucking A, we're going to make this happen. And we made it happen. And I'm kind of proud of the way that one worked out. That was back when I still had Adobe After Effects. <laughs> XP, seriously, thank you for all them gifted subs, dude. I'm going to, uh, I'm actually going to start working on getting an alert for, for multi, um, for multi 
gifted sub alerts. That way, it's like one like like it's special in its own way. I got that idea from Duty because he has different stuff, and I'm like, man, that's brilliant. Because of course it is. Because Duty Beard's brilliant at what he does. So that's going to be coming soon. But for now, I I want to click this one without even reading the rest of them because I also. Never mind. Can you please stop crying? It's making me uncomfortable. Are you going to be done soon? I really got to. Will you go to prom with me? You know what? It's all right. I cry when I poop too. It's not all right, and I'm not pooping. Oh. God, I'm like just such a loser. Prom is only like a few weeks away, and not a single person has asked me to like be their date. Anybody who's anybody already has a prom date, so I guess I'm like. A total nobody. I don't have a prom hey, date either. I've been a total nobody for a really long time, and it's not that bad. <laughs> is that like supposed to make me feel better? Her name hey, is Crystal Sobs. Side. It can't get any worse. <laughs> You're like not helping. Will you go to prom with me? <laughs> I'll take that as a maybe. I can't believe like no suitable person will like. Go to prom with no me. suitable person. Such a loser. Hey, over here. Four and a half feet of handsome. Right in front of you. Yeah. Wait, four and a half feet? Don't four and a half feet as a senior in high school? Not desperate. I want to go to prom with Jake. I want to be his little anchovy chip. I told him that in the note I wrote and put in his lunch. Oh, God. Like, I'm so embarrassing. <laughs> All I heard was like, so what time are you picking me up? <laughs> 214 or 2.41 a.m. Get you some sleep. Wait, where is it? Where is it 2.41 a.m. at? Wait, love connection? Okay, so I got to connect her with Jake. We're going to do this. Wait. Oh, I don't have anything yet. Oh, I do have the arrow. I have the arrow. Okay, awesome. We're, we're keeping that. Wait, Where? Washington? It's not 2.41 a.m. in Washington. <laughs> right? <laughs> All right, let's go to the dude's bathroom. We already pissed her off. Oh, my God. Oh, Australia. That makes a lot more sense. Western Australia. See, now I just look even dumber. That's okay. That's okay. Every, everything's fine. Everything's fine. 2.41 a.m. God bless. That's late. Get some sleep. It's good for your mental health to get some sleep. And also not to drink lots of caffeine. Shut up, Titan! Like touching kids while they pee, do you? <laughs> I do my best. Hey. Go away. I'm trying to pee. Peter oh, Tinklage. Rushing rivers. Yes. Waterfalls. Oh. Mr. Coffee, oh. <sighs> I should really get my prostate checked. I could do that for you. If you, I mean, if you want. Uh, hey guys, better be careful. The hall monitor's on a tear out there. Psh, we ain't afraid of no stupid hall monitor. Went we to sleep at 6 a.m. Oof. So cool. I didn't. I, I uh, went to sleep at like okay. a relatively decent hour, but can I just didn't one? sleep well. Only if you do something for us. Oh shit! What do I gotta what do? What is it? Don't tell me it's using my face for punching practice again. <laughs> Not this time, but we'll keep it in mind. Don't want to get rusty. Get us the ingredients to make some school hooch. A.K.A. Scooch, A.K.A. The Devil's Backwash, A.K.A. Toilet Wine. We like to get <laughs> drunk before a dare class. You mean that alcohol that prisoners make in the toilet? Gross. Can do. I can do what that. The ingredients? All right. Here's a list of what we need. Fetch us what's on the list like a good little loser, and we'll get to your hall pass. I'm so attacked. This round, though, is my mom's secret recipe. Wait. Hurry up and get us the shit we need, man. Old fruit, yeast, a plastic I... bag, and some sugar. I had the yeast. For punching practice. <laughs> uh, no thanks. I've had plenty of practice being punched. I'm actually pretty good at it. And make yourself oh. a moving target and get out of Not here. use my phone. Good. Yes, be smart, XP. Thank you for them gifted subs, dude. Drive safe. We'll see you on the on the flip side. Hey, Obi, speaking of Australia. How are you doing, buddy? Hey. Hey, Obi. In case you didn't know. 
Now, I, I said this at the beginning of stream, and I'll say it again because now there are more people here. Uh, if you win the copy of the game today, it will the uh, the Steam key will not be active until tomorrow when the game actually releases. Uh, but in the meantime, you should go wishlist it because wishlisting it, it helps. A, it, it's one of those like free things you can do to help devs out. Do it, fucking do it, you idiots. Okay, let's see. Wait. That's a speaker. It. Very accurate. Can I touch it? Why do you mock my height? Oh. It talks to me, not the other way around. Okay, I'm gonna fuck. That looks disgusting, but let's see I what's in there. Like to piss at home, you know, where my face won't get shoved into it. Oh. So done with ignorant mean people. They're the worst. They're the worst. Hey, sir, I will see you in a bit, dude. I hope you have a good, safe, uh, safe trip to do the things. And Ob, I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Okay, I'm gonna go search this room again. I'm gonna search like everything. This is not the room I was in. Okay, this is even better. <gasps> old fruit. Go take the old fruit. A rotten apple. Maybe there's a Sleeping Beauty somewhere that'll be my prom date. Oh, let's go talk to this guy. Holy crap! What happened to your face, Greg? I know it's horrible, right? I could barely stand to look at it. Oh, you think that's bad? Try living with it. I want to know. Can I move? But I get seasick. I want to know what happened to his face. Let's go oh, take her sure. book. I'll just grab the book while she's reading it. That's a guaranteed ticket to have her rip my throat out. Do it. Do it. You won't. Talk to her. Hey, Jennifer. What's up? Shh. Not now. Jennifer Wellred. <laughs> what about you? Hey, Mr. So Barry. How's history class going today? Today? That would make it present class, would it not? <laughs> Just a little history class humor for you, Coop. Get out. Get out. Sure looks like you have a lot of papers to grade. Do you have any deep philosophical things you'd like to tell me about? Or mind if I take one of your pens? Mind if I take one of your pens? Sorry, but each of those pens has a long history to it. <sighs> I'd be happy to go into great detail about the history of each pen. After that, we can talk about the history of pens and inks if you like. Who needs Netflix when you can talk about history 24-7? <laughs> Am I right? Yeah, no thanks. I just wanted a pen. He's just well, straight up, nope. My desk isn't an office supply store, so you'll have to find one elsewhere. Speaking of office supply stores, would you like to know the history behind office supplies like staplers? I, I want to know about paper? pens. I'd be happy to talk with you about each of them if you have several hours to spare. Sounds fascinating, but no. <laughs> they don't even give us the choice. Ooh, that's that's sketchy. Well, I'm glad you're okay, though. Glad you're okay, though. Sure do. Those who don't learn from the past are doomed. Doomed to repeat it? No, just doomed. That's kind of scary. Just yeah, doomed. But it sure gets my students to study harder. Oh, yeah, Eli uh, Eliza, Eliza like likes to drink when she decorates. It can confirm. Ah, uh, yes. But did you know the history behind paper? Uh, it comes from trees? Yes, but the process of paper making was invented way back in CE 104 by Kai Lun, a Chinese politician from the Han Dynasty. Gee, that's fascinating. Is that true? <laughs> Is that though? true? <laughs> you kids wouldn't learn something like that from your damn video games. He's got a point. Well, just absolutely okay. chugging tequila. Later, if you're not Barry. chugging Jameson, it's blasphemy. Well, or Guinness. You could do Guinness. Guinness is a is a valid replacement. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Absolutely nothing to say to all these presidents. But can you can you take the poster? This isn't a scratch and sniff. Ew. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. There, I touched it. My life is no better or worse having done so. Was there? Was there nothing in there? Stay. Good sticker. <laughs> okay, let's go this way. Let's see what's this way. Drink scotch. Ooh. That's the... That's the life cycle. Wait, what is this? Is this sugar? 
Aha! Now all we need is a plastic bag. Everything a growing kid and future diabetic needs. Wake him up. Mr. Bernal. Nope, can't wake him up. Can we distract them and make them blow Mixing something up? Some chemicals, eh? What are you making? According to my calculations, this should make either some silly putty or a deadly noxious gas. Uh oh, I that see. is. Hmm. Could you find out after I leave the room? Thanks. Y yeah, if I. I wouldn't want to startle her. She might drop those chemicals and cause the entire school to explode. Imagine that a chemical explosion happening in this school. That'd be crazy. Would it? Would it? <laughs> Foreshadowing. Not popular enough without molesting students. Let's keep it that way. Probably, probably for What's the best. Reading? I stumbled upon some weird report on a massive supply of toxic chemicals under the school. Seems to be like a secret lab or something. Sounds like a ridiculous conspiracy theory with no truth to it whatsoever. Oh? Well, you might be right. <laughs> Just like you're right about 9-11. Here, this will prevent the government from reading your mind when you play with yourself. This tinfoil hat will keep my thoughts from being transmitted to the mothership. Oh yeah, we gotta put on the tinfoil hat. The arrow's good, tinfoil hat better. Boom. Nice. Can, can I take the frog? This doesn't seem very consensual. Darn. Can I talk you know, to it? Mr. Dead Frog, sometimes I envy you. Oh. Okay. Now we need all we need is a plastic bag and we can we can get the thing. We can get the uh Wait, can I pull the fire alarm? Oh shit. I'm gonna pull the fire alarm. Okay. Okay. I mean, can you blame the guy? But okay. Let's talk to him. Jesus Christ! What the hell? Mr. Murphy? Gimp Murphy! <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Why don't you do this? Oh. Will you got a problem with me? Is that a yes? Me. You weren't my first choice for a prom date anyway. Darn. Oh, he just said. Oh, do you, do you need, need help? help? I need that pencil. Uh, I don't know. I don't think I'm flexible enough to pull off the necessary amount of torque. <laughs> What's that boy? Is little Timmy stuck Terry, in the Terry, enjoy so class. Funny. Hopefully it goes smoothly for you, and we will see you down the road. Oh, he's not stuck and he's hiding from you? Is that even possible before Labor Day? Suit yourself. No pun intended. Why don't you do this at home? Right? Yeah. Imagine seeing this and having Don't to go, well, I'm off to class. <laughs> Good point. What the hell are you doing? Okay, I can see that, but why have you gagged yourself? Suit yourself, but I really think this is inappropriate for school. Look at how large his nipples are. Well, shit, I didn't mean to hit that. Boom. I'm going to try to repress this from my memory. Bye. I'm going to take this pencil. You're coming with me, my groovy graphite companion. I needed that. Everyone knows better than to touch Mr. Murphy's ominous red button. Well, we know what the ominous red button does now. At least now we can bust open my locker. Let's go bust open my locker. I like how intuitive it is because I'm kind of an idiot. Wait. Oh. I guess I have to use the actual pencil on it. Ooh. Yeah. Sweet. It's nice to know pencils still have a use in modern times. Right? I'll have Grandma sign this later so I can go on the school field trip to the bomb shelter. That just feels iffy. Can I can I use the pencil to open? No. Okay. Oh wait, there's a room down here. I can't go there without a hall pass. Oh. Old Holly Pass. Wait, can I go this way though? Okay, ho hooch. Okay, I gotta, I gotta find, I gotta find a plastic bag for some hooch. Go there a hall pass. Hey, do you have a, do you have a plastic bag by chance? I'm back for more. Oh. Will you go to a I'm gonna ask everybody. With me? Uh, no, I already promised a gorgeous multi-pack of markers. I take her to prom. I understand. Uh, aren't you worried that people are gonna think you look crazy dancing with a marker at prom? 
That's no. That's the thing about markers, man. They make all your worries go away. Except for getting more markers. Huh. Maybe I should try him sometime. Oh, yeah. I was gonna. That's right. I was going to pull the fire alarm. Obviously, yes. <laughs> that face. Smell you later. I was going to pull. Good call. I was going to pull the fire alarm. Wait. What if I don't want to exit during a fire? Did you ever consider that, you selfish prick sign? Right? Fuck that sign, man. Huh, it's made of highly flammable paper. If the school caught on fire, this would be one of the first things to go. How helpful. True. Should I be worried that half of the so-called fire exits in this school were welded shut years ago? That might be worth being worried about. It's a vent. It is? All right, let's go find that fire alarm. There, I pulled it. Nothing happened. That can't be up to code. Oh. In that case, let's go downstairs. I can't go there without oh. a hop. Okay. So in that case, I need to go back and find the plastic bag. I think I I don't know which room I need to check again just to, just to be safe, but we'll go back and and look through them. And accidentally learn something? I think not. <laughs> That's fair. Okay, I'm not seeing a Can I I touched it. I didn't flip the switch, but I touched it. Well, you did what you were supposed to do then. Let's go find this plastic bag. Uh, I went into that room. I can't go there without a hall pad. Okay, we can't go in that one. Can we go in this one? I can't go there without. Okay, is there a way for me to get into the janitor's office yet, or the janitor's closet? Damn, the door's locked. I've always wondered. Okay, let's check the faculty stuff. I may, I may have uh may have left one behind in here or in the uh, in the actual princ principal's office. That's a cactus. I don't have any friends to call right now. They're all at school and they're all Sawyer. Oh. Grandma says that coffee will stunt my growth and I Hey really boo boo. Hey Danny, how you doing? Hey Danny, you should e hit exclamation point raffle. You should you should do it. Gym teacher said we should always wear cups before playing sports. I still don't see how wearing one of these would protect my junk. <laughs> there you go. Has no idea what he entered. He just knows he entered. Okay, let's see. Is there something in here that I could snatch? I'm not going to file these unless somebody pays me. I like your cut, G. Probably shouldn't go through that. It's a federal offense. I don't think it is. Sometimes I wish I had a family. Sometimes. It's a cocked. No way. Once in motion, it's impossible to stop staring Get out. at that. <laughs> I lost a good year of my life last time I started playing with one of these. Being sleazy. By the way, for, the, for, for, for anybody who might be wondering why I'm having people hit exclamation point raffle, also, go wishlist the game, you fucking idiots. I don't know why I enjoy I saying that. I need to stop. <laughs> can, I, can I just take this with me? No? Okay. So the plastic bag's not in here. But how are y'all doing today, friends? I hope y'all are doing well. Can I take the, can I take the cactus? What am I? Some sort of masochist? For the I death lottery? Is incredibly awesome. That was supposed to be a secret. We weren't supposed to tell anybody about that, Danny. Alright, let's see. Where oh where oh where? Wait. Let's check the men's restroom. I don't know if I actually checked to see if there's a if there's a plastic bag in there. I don't. What is this? Can, can I take this? Sweet. Now I can look like a bona fide <gasps> boy too. Oh shit. Oh, let's go. Now we look good. Those are the cool boys. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Talk to him. I forgot to ask something last. Uh. Can you guys help me go to the bathroom? Thank you. Girl, the bathroom <laughs> is next door. Pussy. All right, Scott. Will you go to a prom with me? Say, Coop, you ever been given a swirly and a urinal? And a uh, urinal? A simple no would suffice. How do you get your hair so perfect? A fine combination of hair gel and swirlies. But what's it to you? You're not even cool enough to handle this hair or our game. It's Get funny because I have the exact same hair as him. Fair enough. Uh, uh what okay. Hurry up and get us the shit we need, man. 
Or fruit. Got it. Yeast, Got it. Plastic bag. Missing it. Sugar. Or are you here for okay. Okay. I need to find oh, that plastic right, bag. Cool I just need to stop being. I, I, I need to start being more uh, focused. I already got the yeast. I, I got the yeast out of here. I don't think there was a plastic bag, too. Because I also got tampons from in here. We're, yeah, we're making toilet wine. And? Take it anyways. I'd rather punch my... Stop being, a, stop being a bitch. Uh, my hair is super dry already. Thanks. Can I grab something else out of here? Uh oh, I think I broke it. Whoops. That, that's my bad. Okay. Where am I? Wait, can I take the door stop? The wedgies to the. Okay, this is where I got the sugar, but I don't see any plastic bags in here. That is my current objective, right? Is to, because they can make me a fake hall pass. Hooch mule. Okay, fine plastic baggie. Wait, is there a drug dealer anyway? Oh, first off, I like this. Polly is flushed. Wait, flushed your access to many areas right down the drain. If you want to go down in history, it's not rocket science. You can get a lot out of the. Trash talk. Trash talk. I didn't even think about that. I need a. I, is there is there a trash can I can dig through? I haven't even looked for trash cans. Interesting. I like that. I like that the game has a, a hints button for idiots like me who are horrible at figuring shit out. Because I get too distracted talking to y'all. Is it? I, it's way easier to blame you. Um, I normally use this projector to wipe the boogers off. It's a cabinet for files, also known as a filing cabinet. That's fair. Can I take these? These look almost. I better not. I don't even know the safe word. Oh, that's right. Yeah, probably don't mess with him right now. Okay, let's go and let's actually check tra trash cans in the bathrooms because surely there's. <laughs> Thank God this garbage can was recently emptied. <laughs> well, boo. Not by me. What about the men's restroom? Useful as that trash may be, I think I carry enough garbage around with oh, me as it is. Darn. Hmm, okay. Also, if anybody sees the plastic baggie, feel free to go ahead and be like, hey, dude, open your eyes. It's empty doesn't mean it's clean. No thanks. That may not even actually like the talking trash thing may not even actually been a hint. I may be looking too deep into it because I have a tendency to do stupid stuff like that from time to time. Aha! It wasn't the trash. Grabbing a plastic bag from the trash. I feel like I just saw a glimpse into my. Oh. See, I knew I'd I knew I'd figure it out eventually with enough help. Because yeah, whatever. Let's make this a. Uh... No, he's trying. He's going for the record. He's trying to drink the most water ever. Here you go. Whoa, you came through. I knew you'd do whatever we say, like a little bitch. I guess you aren't as pathetic as you look. Uh, thanks. Yeah, we have your stupid hall pass ready. And if you tell anyone you got it from us, we'll cut you so many times you'll be begging for a stab. Uh, I won't. I promise. <laughs> Official hall pass. Skipping class without a holly pass? That's how you get a whooped ass. Netherton High is not responsible for shotgun wounds. Fair enough. Sweet! My very own fake hall pass. <clears throat> Finally! Freedom at my fingertips. Let's see hall Perfectly pass balanced. Perfectly balanced. Watch, she's gonna get... That guy's been pissing for a while, but... Oh, what's this? It's... Hey! It's Palin! That's a... That's a Palin! That is a Palin. I love that guy. Palin is a cool guy. Hey. Hey, Jerry Jr. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the ND Darlings. But how, how are you doing? Palin. Thank you for the raid. We're going to take a moment before we uh, before we do this. So let's uh let's head over let's head on over to the uh, to the Arthur screen. If I hit the right thing. Arthur screen. Boom. Hi. Welcome in. Oh, wait. What's this? Britta unfiltered? 
disgusting. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Hi, everybody. Welcome in. Palin, how was stream? How, how are you enjoying Valheim? I know a lot of people are enjoying it, so uh, you should too. I haven't yet because I just haven't fucking played it. That's that's my fault, not yours. You know, I'm just messing with you, Britta. Anyways, welcome into my uh, my nice little pre-launch uh, pre stream of Side 9 Happiness' Freak Apocalypse. Uh, we're, we're getting to play it a day early thanks to some amazing people that have been like, hey, you know, content creators, do a thing. And I was like, you know what? I could do the thing. And they're like, all right, you do the thing. And and here we are. But I, I would like to tell you a little bit about myself. Me and Palin are not so different. We, we, we both do like to stream a, a variety of things, mostly centered around indie from what I've gathered. But I would like to like give you a little like brief glimpse, glimpse into the world of my content. So I hope you enjoy this. See you on the other side, kids. I was hoping... Is that guy dry humping a tree? You, uh... You wanna get in on this? Sent you to the wrong... What the fuck? Tunnel. Whatever. Sorry about that. What's that? Oh wait, I can't see my thumbs up. Now I just look stupid. Now I'm like, oh my god, there's a baby behind me. A child. Yes. I'm in. I'm in. All right, here we go. You ready? Yes. Yay! Woo! <laughs> Tree! Tree! <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. You walk right into that one. Oh, I fucking know, B. What are you doing? I'm seeing if I can see my car from here. Oh. I think we're looking in a completely different direction. Just sit. <laughs> What I miss. Oh, we're back. Hi. Hey. Hey. So yes, thank you for thank you for the raid. Thank you for the follows. Thank you for stopping by. Uh, I I hope you enjoy your time here. It's uh, you were doing you were doing dishes. I shit. I need to do dishes. Oh my god. So yes. We are we are doing the thing with with Side Night and Happiness, and uh, because you know I've actually I've been reading Side Night and Happiness comics for years. I have the I have the app. What was that first clip? Wait, which one was the first clip? Was that the tree demon? Was that the tree humping demon? Because that's from a game called After Party, which is going to be coming to YouTube. I'm, I'm going to actually be doing a playthrough for YouTube pretty soon, um, because uh, for those of you who don't know, recently. That happened. My YouTube partner, you skanks, go watch my videos. I'm kidding. You don't have to do that if you don't want to. But it would it'd be like cool if it sure be cool if you did. But we just uh, so we're uh, we we, we just got a fake hall pass by helping a bunch of uh, skeezy assholes in the bathroom make uh, toilet wine. And the, oh. koala, thank you for that host, but. Yeah, seriously, thank you, Palin, for the for for that raid, buddy, and uh, thank you all for the follows. Like on a serious note, I I do genuinely appreciate that. Y'all are uh, y'all are off. Damn it! I really had to burp right in the middle of like a, an actual genuine comp. Can I not do anything seriously? God damn it! Thank you. Mwah. Love you. <laughs> all right, let's let's tell this bitch we got a hall pass. Check it out! I got a hall pass. Kaching in your face, Holly. I don't Suck know it, how Holly. You did it. But enjoy this victory. It won't last. You may have won the battle, but the war is far from over, son. Just be happy for me, goddammit. It's I don't crowd, <laughs> I've let my guard down. Undertale. It used to be Cuphead. It used to be Cuphead, but... Freely. Now step aside. Yeah. So be it. It, 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 it's Undertale. Next time. Next time! By the way, I saw some kids cutting class in the hallway over there. Duty calls! What the fuck? These holes. Enough already! Hey, Coop! Over here! Okay. Hey, Sawyer! 
my only friend. How's it going? Fucking love Undertale. Lousy. Oh yeah. Uh, want to talk about it? Uh, I'm trying to hand out these flyers to help spread awareness hey, about how underfunded the hey. school is and how stupid Speaking all of these Wingles are as a result. And Not to mention my Palin. story about the shady backdoor government funding deals that are totally going on here. That uh sounds pretty serious. It is. Unfortunately, nobody seems to give a damn. I only got one person to take a flyer today, and he only took it because the boys' bathroom was out of toilet paper. Sheep. They're all sheep. Sheeple. Well, what if I help get some more eyes on your flyers? That's awfully sweet of you, Coop. <sighs> no offense, but the only thing people here seem to care about less than my flyers is you. None taken. And I know, but let me try. You've always been nice to me, so allow me to repay the favor. Besides, what have you got to lose? More flyers that nobody's willing to take? All right, fine. Here's a USB drive with the flyers on it. You'll need to make more copies. You could try using the secretary's printer. The library's printer got stolen. Maybe you can at least post them where people will accidentally look at them. Ooh, that's smart. I'll get Boom. right on it. Oh, and uh, try not to make anybody's life worse in the process. You know how you can be. What the fuck? My damnedest. No promises. Ah, oh, shucks. I appreciate it. Thanks, Duder. I better go find something to plug this. She just used the term Duder. First off, Duder is a uh, that's a Danny K term and has been for a long time. Now, anyway, uh, which store are you going to? Wingles Dollar General or Travel Pla or King's Travel Plaza? Oh God damn it! I waited for the dialogue to finish like a gentleman, and now I'm getting in a. Tell him you tell him you'll call him back. No, I'm kidding. He's I know he's at work. But uh Yeah, so for those of you who don't know, Wingles is uh Wingles is uh living in my front yard right now. That's my boy. Oh wait, hold on. What are my chores? What are my chores? I was thinking about something to drink and now locate a printer. Okay, that was she says up by the library, right? Oh, whoops. Wait, what is this? Can I can I touch it? The stuff in this vending machine is far too risque for my PG thirteen hands. Oh, Somebody couldn't even be bothered to put that crumpled piece of paper in the recycling bin. Guess what? Neither can I. <laughs> I like your cut, G. Glorbus, my tier three sub. How are you doing, BB? I I'm gonna I'm gonna shout you out for that. Oh, well you were anyways. That's fine. But uh oh that's right, you you redeemed beard ASMR. Full ASMR warning. Hold on, for anybody who's new here, let's get a uh well once was. Hey. That's more than it. That, that's more than ever, right? That's more than ever. But yeah, hey, real quick, I'm gonna mute this because ASMR warning. I have a. Oh, that's that's so sweet. That's so sweet. I loved. You love to see it. You love to see it. Now, for those of you who are anti ASMR, I, re I I I request that you turn your headphones down until you see my glorious face off this gigantic screen with Arthur here. I, I just yeah, wait for Arthur to disappear and that'll mean it's over, but for now. I hope that was as good for you as it was for me. Let's get back to playing our game, shall we? And now we got to do 30 minutes of getting over it with Bennett body at the end of stream. Fantastic. That's so weird. It's what I do. Weird is what we do. Weird is weird. Okay. First off, normal, normal is overrated. There's no actual such thing as normal. Normal is this social construct of an idea of how you should behave according to anybody else's standards. They can go fuck themselves. The only thing normal to you is being you. Being anything else other than your normal self, what is normal to you, is being fraudulent. Be yourself. Be as weird as you want to be. Because again, who the fuck is out there that can tell you what normal is, right? Boom. <laughs> but no, re reward shouldn't be broken. I see the I see the deal for the 30 minutes of uh of getting over it with Bennett Foddy. 
Uh, let's see. Can I go into the gymnasium? Wait, did I even try to go in here yet? Oh, I didn't. Okay. <gasps> it's a boiler room. <gasps> wait a second. Is that Freddy Krueger's glove? <laughs> oh, wait. Let's go ahead and do that, too. Oh, I got the janitor's keys. Finally explore the mysteries of the janitor's closet. Nice. Room full of new inanimate objects to talk to. Sad. I don't feel like boiling the whole school alive. Yet. Can I take something from here? Gonna leave the hazardous materials alone. Don't leave the hazardous materials alone. Climbable barrels. Every school needs them. Your points didn't change for a second. Are you on mobile? Because if you're on mobile, that'll happen. That rumbling was terrifying almost. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. The narwhals. Both PC and mobile. Interesting. I'm going to take that basketball. Whoa, feels like real fur. Oh, you just just touched her? Pardon me, but do you stop talking? I don't want to catch dork disease. Ouch! So, I saw Lance's car parked outside of your place last night. Gabby Gossip. Shh, keep your voice down. Betty Blabbington. Did you guys, you know. Yeah, dude. Oh my god. What was it like? Tell me more. Dude, you just blow as hard as you can until he's done, and then it sucks back into their body. Ugh, dudes are gross. Dude, I know. I mean, technically, the shiny new Netherton High gym logo, freshly painted and buffed for all the buff people's pleasure. Ooh, you get, you got it, you gotta love. Oh wait, hold on. I sneezed into my fucking microphone. Yes, everybody, wish list this game. Wish list it. And also, enter the giveaway. Do it. Wish list the game. It helps the devs and, and the publisher. Also, so this is the first time I'm playing a game by by Explosum, Um, because I haven't checked out Rapture Rejects yet. But Serenity Forge also published a game called uh, Never Song that was fucking amazing. So Serenity Forge has good taste in games of, for publishing. So we got that going for us. Go, go, go wish list it. Enter the raffle. Every now and then, stream elements lags. If, if you want to, if you want to tap that exclamation point raffle again, by all means. By all means. You're not being left out. I promise. Ah, that's some fine maple wood. He's he's really going after it. Narwhals, narwhals can't be beat. They'll kick your head and break your feet. Narwhals scratch and narwhals bite. Come on, narwhals, fight, fight, fight. I. Knock knock. I'd hire him. Beat, nerd. Well, go fuck yourself. Is this your twin? Ahoy there. Say, do you? Don't talk to me, loser. Huh. I could probably... I, that's probably, like, the point-and-click aspect of, of it. Oh, can I take the helmet? Can I take that helmet? Oh, we're changing. I'm on the team now? Let me... Let me... Wait, hold on. I, let's do some stuff in here. These are locked. What's inside? Only God knows. God's not here. Right? Yeah, Coop's gonna not climb that rope. This isn't even close to weird. You wouldn't like me when I'm weird. Okay then. Here's an idea. Let's not be friends. What about this guy? Um, in case you didn't notice, your flippant towel waving is causing this kid's butt discomfort. <laughs> yeah, I'm whipping the weirdo good. Uh. Hey, how about you give the towel whipping a rest? What's that? You like <laughs> to be next? No, 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 no. I'm just uh admiring your top-notch ass whipping technique. Thanks. He got what nervous real fast. Jones of towel whipping. Mm -hmm. Is there a point where you stop whipping asses and actually get dressed? Hey, you don't get this good at ass whipping without a whole lot of practice. Fair enough. He's got a point. Will, will you go to prom? prom with me? Will you go to prom with me? I'm going to pretend I didn't hear that. I said, will you go to prom with <laughs> me? You know what? Forget it. <sighs> okay, well, I got to go. Little Miss Fortune's so good. Hey, can I watch you shower? Hey, sure. That's not weird at all. 
You need help lathering? I sponge bathe my grandma all the time. She says I'm pretty good at it. Just what I thought you couldn't get any weirder. You're welcome. Will you, you go to prom? prom with me? Uh, I can't. I uh, have to wash my hair that night. But you don't have any hair. Thank I you. My pubes. Well, washing my pubes. Y you can't see them, but there's a lot of them. Oh. Oh, I see. Wow. Oh. I gotta run. Talk to you later. I got this kid's reactions are a lot similar to mine. Ugh, feels like grimy wet rubber. Or a seal. This is copyright for I feel attacked! Okay, let's let's get out of here and let's change it. We're gonna put on the football helmet, because at least maybe then we'll look cool. But I can't put that on in here. All right, let's go see the rope. Can we 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 can't we can't climb the rope, can we? There's no way I could climb that. I could barely lift my backpack. Thought so. Wait. What's all the way over here? Locked. Isn't that a fire hazard? It indeed is. All right. <laughs> Big same, right? Okay. Now we have the janitor's keys though. Before we do anything else, let's go look at that creepy janitor's closet. Boom. Wait, I think I actually have to like pull out the key. Oh, the football helmet is not part of the outfit. All right, it worked. Now I can stand in a tiny cramp. Room full of chemicals. Let's go. Oh, that's a pulley. Can I take that pulley? It's a good thing I found this pulley. Now I can hoist heavy things like a big boy. Like a big boy. I don't think I can use. Wait, can I use that pulley in the gym to climb the rope? <laughs> Okay, now I can go anywhere I want. I can go to any room I any room I damn well please. Oh my god, what is it with all these people looking the same with their face? Ah, stranger danger. Okay. I'd make fun of you some more, but I Wait, hold on. Ah, refrigerator art. Soon to be hand delivered to disappointed parents. Attacked. Attacked. Wait, what is my? I don't even know what my obje objective is at this point. I'm just like enjoying running around. Oh, locating a printer. That's what. That's right. That's right. Guerrilla marketing, side chores, medicinal markers, and love connection. So I need to find Jake. Shit. I gotta hydrate. I, I I gotta hydrate. I'll be right back. I didn't bring any water in here with me. I will. I I'll be, I'll be right back. In, enjoy the the be right back screen. Go with. But if I could detach one body part, um, it'd have to be Mandel. Uh, because how funny would it be just to lob your penis at people? I mean, seriously. Is there any... I mean, come on. Is is this the vision? Because... Jesus, what is the delay? Shut up, I'm fucking doing something. You... This is, this is the, this is the content? This is it? This does it for... Look up. Is that a titty? What? You you told me to look up. Oh my god, what happened? I don't know. <laughs> oh fucking god. And, and a pee pee. Tell me you wanna be my lover. Do you wanna be my lover? You gotta accept my confession. No. And all of a sudden, it all got quiet. Ah! Like I said, I'm. Do I hear a John Cena theme song going right now? Oh. Uh, guys. It's John. <laughs> 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 Don't worry, I'll change the windscreen. I have, there's a second windscreen. Unless you want this one. I mean, if you want this one, I'll give it to you, but I will change the windscreen. Um, but I can send that one as an extra. Oh, yeah. All right, I got water. I got two different kinds of water, actually. I got regular water. And, no, I don't have TC THC water. Wild One, how are you doing, buddy? I had a leftover White Claw from the other night that was in my fridge, so we're gonna drink, we're gonna drink a White Claw. Th we have lots of Truly left, too. This is the last of the actual White Claws. 
and cheers. Mm. Hey, Britta, thank you for being here. Thank you for stopping by with the raid. I hope you have a great rest of your day. You can do an entire stream. Bro, I, I'm actually going to be making more, uh, like, newer videos with my more recent stuff in it. Because if you notice, a lot of my a lot of my clip compilations have older clips in them. Um, well, you wouldn't notice because, you know, like, you, you're you new-ish here. By new-ish, I mean, how, how long? How long have you been following? Since, just since December. So, if you'll notice, wait, don't eat nails? What the fuck? <laughs> Hold on. Can I equip the hat? Not my dumbest idea. Whatever. Yeah. See. So yeah. A, like a lot of the stuff you'll see are is like older stuff. It feels like a boob. Uh, I assume. Fair. Wait. Can I? Can I take something out of this? Ow. Okay. I touched it. Now to wait to see what random disease I get. Er, hey, you go fuck yourself, and you're stupid. Wait. Oh, and you're stupid, dog or hamster. I can't read the rest. It's already been a year. Dude, wait, what? What? Be here a lot more. Oh, well, I mean, if, you know, I mean, I, I streams are hard to catch. Like, so streams are hard to catch. Like, I don't know. Like, diseases. No, the, these diseases are easy. Whatever. Uh, so, like, if you ever want to catch some content away, I'm, I'm putting stuff on YouTube. So, there's, there's that if you'd like to check that out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is there, there's a competition going on? Yeah, me and Wild One have actually known each other for a little while. Oh, buns, barely e eking it out. You just blink and you miss them. Exactly. Especially when you're inconsistent like me. But we are going to, yeah, we're actually going to start doing more co-streaming and more uh, more collaboration stuff. I think that's going to be fun. We got to start doing stuff like that. Of medical assistance. Sorry, kid. We don't do plastic surgery. Um, that hurts my feelings more than you could possibly comprehend, but that's not what I meant. Ouch. Also, I guess you're here for the malnourishment. Or the foul body odor? What the I'll fuck? You stop guessing and I'll just tell you. It's unorthodox, but I'll give it a try. Shoot. I feel sick and I should probably be resting somewhere far away from school. Hmm. You look fine to me. And your forehead doesn't feel hot. Oh no, not my forehead. You gotta check my butt temperature like grandma. It's a volcano back there. Not a chance, kid. We stopped doing that after the thermometer broke off in Timmy Daniels and he butt chugged all that mercury. Jesus! I know, I was worried too. But thanks to parental consent forms, everything turned out just fine. But what happened to Timmy? I don't know. I think he died of something. Wow. So can I go home now? No! Damn it! What? Also, she sounds like the uh, the receptionist for the principal at uh, on Bob's Burgers. I can't remember her name. I remember Miss LeBons. I, I remember Miss Selbo, but I can't remember the uh, I can't remember the receptionist's name. Will you go to prom with me? Are you over eighteen? Um, not exactly. Then no. Sorry, kid. I go all the way a bust on prom night. Oh, okay. If I said yes, would we have had sex on prom night? You could have played doctor on my naughty bits. Huh. Oh. Something weird is going on with me. I can't stop looking at, talking to, and touching things. That's just your hormones acting up, Coop. Being really weird and gross is totally normal for someone your age. Is it still totally normal when you're 31? You're probably sick of this conversation. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> Where's my uh, costumes? There we go. Okay, I can't put on the... We're going to go back to the arrow. I want the arrow. Well, that was quick. Can These I markers are all dried up. How useless. Ah, oh, bummer. Use band-aids? tried putting them on, but they won't stick to anything anymore. Gross. All right, let's head out. Let's head to the next place. Because we have all of this open area to explore all of a sudden. Oh. oh people have unlocked lockers from Kickstarter backers. I've always wondered how weird these people are. Guess there's only one way to find out. What? Hold on. That's okay. That's kind of cool. That's that's actually pretty neat. And that's a lot of wait. The bumble bear. Those assholes are right where they belong, lying motionless on the floor. 
when the Kickstarter started. Wait, you've got a Side Night Happiness card game? Wait, what is this? Wait, wait, what does that say? Who is that? Spangled bastard. He's not the hero America needs, but he's the hero America deserves. Oh wait, do I see something in there I can grab? I'm dirty enough already. Oh no. A dirty, dirty boy. Hey, I will let you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, by the way, if you haven't already entered, feel free to enter the. Uh... Wait, oh wait, 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 wait. I have, uh. I have a Side Nine Happiness card game that's like Cards Against Humanity. But I can't... Wait, what's it called? Holy shit, I can't even remember what it's called, but I have it. Because I have What Do You Meme, I have a few different versions of Cards Against Humanity. I have the Side Nine Happiness one that's like Cards Against Humanity, too. Dude, you really stayed in place last night? Yeah, dude. dude <laughs> dirt Doodler. Head. Palms are sweaty, knees weak, petting heavy. So, what's it like to, you know... Dude, it's like, dude, you know... You squeeze the boobs as hard as you can till they fall off. Then our adult boobs grow in. Dude, oh. girls are awesome. Dude, I know. Okay. Put a cork in it, board. Ha, got him. You got him good, you fucker. That's really cool they put like the actual Kickstarter backers in the game. Wait, is that not the way I came from, or is that a different hall? Oh, that's a different hallway. Got him. Taco Bell or Burger King? Taco Bell, 100 times out of 100, dude. Bundle trash on your own time. Unless you're craving a burger, then you go to Taco Bell. Okay, okay, we're back here. All right, so now we know how to establish that. Noted. I need to be I need to be finding the library though, I believe. What's in shop? Oh, look at you. Art credit. It's super nice looking in the wait, in the Kickstarter back and thing. Dude, right? Right? I love the fact I love just I love the fact that they stuck true to their animation style. That they didn't do the they didn't do the whole thing where it's like, you know, they try to go over the top with it, make it different. That's just not their style. So I'm glad they went this way. Oh. I need those to count. Fair. Hard work, hard wood. Wait, there's a lever. What happens if I pull this lever? Okay, so it moves the chain up and down. For leverage, maybe? For lever... There's a finger. That, uh, that isn't mine. To let the adults talk? Uh, I haven't yet. I I have it. I believe. Um, it's it, what is that? It's um, dude, I can't remember the names of shit now. But I have it though, because uh, Tiny Build published it. Rapture rejects. Jesus Christ! Why did that take so long? Yeah. Hey, Oof. Max, you doing all right? I don't know, dude. <laughs> this birdhouse stuff just isn't for me. Would mm -hmm. you say it's for the birds? That was zero percent funny, Coop. Sorry, I just saw an opening. Had to take God it. God damn it, anyway, Coop. If it makes you feel any better, I couldn't even tell that was a birdhouse. No. No, that does not make me feel any better. Give me a break. I'm trying over here. I like where your head's at. Okay. So, how's shop class treating you? What kind of a question is that? It's going awful, Coop. Maybe it'd make a better doorstop at this rate. Oh. My assignment is to construct a birdhouse. Right now, it looks like a tiny bird hurricane destroyed it. But I really need to pass this class before the school year ends. Maybe I Don't can help. Worry. There are plenty of people who work in construction that never graduated high school. That is true. You have the future in construction, dude. Would you get lost? You're tarnishing the little hope I have left. Heh. <laughs> Tarnish. Nice wood pun. Please leave. Damn it. Have you ever made something other <laughs> than a birdhouse? Yeah, I tried to make a bird mansion once, but that turned out even worse. Well, yeah. Sheesh, what'd that look like? It looked like it was part of a planned demolition. Unlike a planned demolition, however, they found bodies under the rubble. Yikes, what happened? I was hoisting it up with a rope and pulley, but the whole thing came crashing down. Teacher was pissed, lives were lost. Not my best Thursday. Damn, so what became of the project? The teacher recycled but it's only the and constructed a memorial to all those who died in the bird mansion. He gave the pulley back to the janitor. I'm not allowed to use it anymore. 
I did not hear about any of this. Uh, I have that pulley if Will you want it back. <laughs> Come on, man. I already told you, I'm saving prom for marriage. It's Wednesday, my dudes. Her to ask. Uh... Maybe building isn't your thing. Maybe making friends isn't your thing. Can't argue with that. Well, as long as we all know our place. Besides, it's not my fault. You have a fucking emote. If it wasn't for that stupid climbing rope in the gymnasium. You have the emote. Slide back down. It wouldn't hurt to hammer so much, and I wouldn't have to try gluing all this wood together. Rope burns suck. Yes. I remember when Kent tied my nuts to that rope and attached the other end to Principal McNally's rear car bumper as he drove home after school one day. Doctor said I couldn't wear pants for three weeks. May never bear children. That's probably for the best, honestly. Way to make my pain all about you, Coop. If you're looking to cry about it, find another shoulder. I've got enough to worry about. Okay, catch you later, Mac. Don't talk to me like we're friends, Coop. I have a pulley. That didn't work, but if I try it 130 more times, it might. Don't tempt me. Don't tempt me. It's really stuck under there. I'm gonna have to. What if I do it again? Will it say? Coop loses 10 confidence points. Okay. Dude, that's so funny. That, I mean, that you had the emote. Hey, Todd. You look a bit more roughed up than the last time I saw you. What happened? Yeah, I broke my arm in a freak 2 by 4 accident. I don't really want to talk about it. Bro, that's more than an arm. Sorry. And what happened to your eye? Oh, funny story, actually. I aimed my hammer the wrong way and got a nail stuck in it. Aimed your hammer the wrong way? Yep. And got a nail stuck in your eye? Uh-huh. Wow. Well, at least it's an unusual injury. Don't eat nails, yep, kids. Third time I've done it this semester. What? Jesus, Todd. I like how the corner of the fucking rooms are being held together by these little brackets. I want to wait. Can I? Hanging the pulley on there with nothing else won't do me much good. I better combine the pulley with something first. We need rope. Don't we? We need rope. Okay. Okay. We're going to go find rope. Oh yeah, I kind of picked that up from the from the name of the emote. How's it hanging? Hanging, hanging. This is no gallery. Can't you see this painting is currently displayed on an easel and not hung? I hope the not. Walls? I fucking hope Sorry not. I, ask. I may be able to take the gym rope down. Be. You, I might be able to. You know what? You're kind of a dick. I'm so for... I'm not high enough for this. He called me a philistine. The audacity. Oh. Hold on! It's not gonna show me what's on the other side of that, but there it is. Looks like Damien has a bright future in porn commissions. Good job, Damien. Hey, what you drawing? As much as I'd love to spend a few hours explaining to you the intricacies of balance, movement, and use of shapes. I'm in the thick of an artistic spike that I simply cannot let slip away. Looks like a dude with his dick out. <laughs> yep. You could have just said that, you know. I... I didn't want you to make fun of me. It's cool, dude. Draw all the dicks you'd like. I won't tell anyone. Phew. Thanks, man. I'm gonna tell everyone. Hey, Mr. Jellyneck. Sold any of your paintings yet? My paintings are too high concept for plebes to understand. <laughs> I take cryptocurrency and cigarettes. Uh, I'll pass. You're dead to me. Uh? Is majoring in art a wise career choice? Yes, absolutely. There's lots of money in art. I've never been happier. I have a feeling you're lying. Kill me. Oh. When do we get to paint that naked lady? When you stop being such a little pervert. Oh, so, never. never. <laughs> Off I go. Let's see. I don't see anything I can really take in here. What is this? Fantastic. Oh. Now I can look like a pompous art prick too. Yes. Uh, get 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 the beret out. We're gonna wear it or the beret rather. Costumes. Yeah. Let's go. I can look like a pompous art prick too. Okay, what's the, this way? Get milk. This is hall monitor brutality. This is justice. Thanks 
for the lead. Now I can feed my knee to make this punk bleed. I'd say you're welcome, but I honestly feel awful about this. You I'm should. Easy on him. You this should feel. I love my job. Stop resisting. Stop resisting. Try any touches, and your ass will be in crutches. Oh I wow. Figured as much as. Wait, the grape flavored milk? What? I'm not thirsty enough to. Oh, body armor. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> What's in the cafeteria? God, there's so much going on in here. Uh, let's see. I'm not seeing anything I can necessarily grab yet. We're gonna wander around before we start talking to everybody. Can I pull? The, can I pull this fire alarm? I pulled this once. Nothing happened. Our school doesn't have the budget for a fire alarm. There are starving kids out there. Eat what you're served. It's out of order, as usual. Of course, it's for veg. It's veggies. My heart already beats fast enough due to social anxiety, so the last thing I need is an energy drink. Fair. I don't have enough money to waste on a tube dinner. Hunger tube. I better not touch him. I'll just delay how long he takes to decide on a snack. Hey, how's it going? Just trying to make a choice here. Stingy Vince. Are you uh, uh using this? Using this? Yeah. I'm just having a little trouble deciding. So you won't mind if I go ahead and... No cutting! No cutting! Okay, okay, okay. Jeez. Hmm. Easy there, Hoss. Get the gummy bears. Gummy bears are good. Bro, get the Doritos. Hmm. I do like pretending I'm the god of the tiny bear people while I bite their heads off. Don't we all? Gummy worms for breakfast, so... Oh. Nah. Don't we all love that, cookies. though? Everyone loves cookies. Yeah. I like cookies. Well, cookies are a misnomer. I love cookies. Renamed bakies. Right. Sure. Fight the power. Touche, sir. Grab, Grab some, some chips. chips. Chips are the best. Hmm. I think you're on to something there, but what kind? Exactly. See, Eliza knows. Hold on. Oh, shit. Hold on. Hold on. No, wrong button. Wrong button. Wrong button. That button. Oh. Never mind, it's just not showing up. Uh, so uh, I, I just like straight. Yes, okay. I I would like uh, I would like a big bottle of water, um, and honestly, like I I'd be good with just a big bottle of water. So on my end, the sub badges aren't showing on on Eliza. Now it is. What happened to my water filter? I haven't filled I haven't filled it up. I need to refill it. That bottle's not full, <laughs> but uh, it didn't it didn't show up that she was subbed. I was about to just like Loki, bam, gift her a sub, and then it was like, no, dude, we're just fucking up, and her badge isn't appearing. I'm like, ah, I will after I'm done here. <laughs> I need to refill that thing. That's boring. But I don't want to go to Walmart. Like ordering vanilla ice cream or a cheese pizza. But those are my favorites. Fucking Arkansas, dude. Coolest ranch isn't bad. True. True. Fucking Arkansas, so dude. Cool as it is, I'd be afraid of the consequences from my coolness levels reaching critical mass. Ooh, they have anchovy chips. They have anchovy chips. I don't know why, but they do. Oh shit, anchovy chips! I didn't even see those. Hell yeah. Okay. We'll get sweet. we'll get a new one. Made a decision. We'll get a new it's one. It's the wrong decision, but hey, you made it. I'm proud of you. There we go. Oh, thanks. Now I just need to find another quarter. God damn it! Boom. That's how you pro that's how you properly do that. Is there anybody over here? What is up with this guy? This guy eats just too many fucking chips. Are you alright? Yeah. I'm oh, it's Jake! I might blow chunks. I think I'm dying. It's Jake. What's your name? Jake. Jake Upchuck. Up, Chuck? Isn't that a little on the nose? Huh? Aren't all names in this game? What are you talking about? I'm breaking the fourth. Ah, uh, never mind. I'm with you, buddy. Uh, did I have a love letter to give to him or something? You uh didn't notice a note in your lunch, did you? Oh, there we go. A note in my lunch? Nah. Though to be honest, anything that gets between me and my anchovy chips is likely to get chewed and or swallowed. So you wouldn't have noticed if there was a note in there? He, Interesting. He chewed it up, didn't he? You don't look so good. 
Maybe I should get the nurse. Nah, I'm fine. I just... I just need a minute. What you need is a stomach pump. Yes. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have eaten those anchovy chips so fast. Dude, his his gross sounds That's are making me feel a little iffy. Your feet. Anchovy chips. They're so goddamn good. I ate so many last time I think I'm good. But I could go for some more right now. You got any? What I meant was you should throw those bags in the trash. <laughs> Screw you. When am I, the janitor? Uh, well, you ignore trash like you're the janitor, but you cry about your ex-wife way less, so I guess not. Ooh. See you later, regurgitator. Literally holding in puke. Okay, I need to figure out a way. I wonder if there's a way for me to get him to throw up. Can I get more anchovy chips? Can I get some? I'm back for more. Will you go to prom with me? Yeah, right. I've got enough problems as it is. Mostly revolving around Ben. Oh. Problems <laughs> nonetheless. Godspeed, you snack champion. Take it easy. Okay, so I need to figure out love connection. Get anchovy chips from the vending machine. Can I just Poor Vince, bald at such a young age. <laughs> Shut up. I can't use it while Vince is blocking the vending machine. Okay, talk to him. Talk to him. Let's see what. Grab some chips. But what kind? They have anchovy chips. I don't know why, but they do. Oh shit! Anchovy chips? I didn't even see those. Hell yeah! Okay, sweet. You made a decision. It's the wrong decision, but hey, you made it. Oh, I'm smoothie sounds it. good. Hey, thanks. Now I just need to find another quarter. Okay. God damn it. Okay, I need to find a quarter. Okay, we can do that. Let's go talk to this person. Nope. 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 Blueberry banana smoothie sounds good. Wait. Ramona Flowers over here doesn't even want to fucking talk to me? This is, this is some bull crap. Hi. Oh, your face is making me nauseous. Dick. Blueberry banana smoothies are the shit. Oh, let's talk to the janitor. You missed a spot. Oh, I'm sorry. I know I'm slacking. Wait, you you love John Brintz's hair though, right? Right? Just too bad he's a dick. To be honest. I feel like I ain't got no reason to clean no more since my wife left me. We're going through divorce. And my cleaning skills ain't what they used to be. Every piece of white trash reminds me of her. I can't take myself to throw anything away. Uh, that sucks, man. I'm make the whole kid. thing taste like banana? That's fair. Advice. That's fair. Which is ironic, because I don't Sorry typically like bananas. You. But I think it's a consistency over a flavor thing. The grapevine. And by grapevine, I mean stalking her. That she's taking out a new fella to lay telepathy. It's not fair. That was our special spot. I hope her day turns out horrible. This is a lot of personal information. Ooh. I do like, I, I like pineapple and smoothies too. I like pineapple in general. I don't like dried pineapple as much, but I do fucking love good pineapple. Your tears are doing half the mopping around here. I've never had Orange Julius. Oh, my forehead itches for some reason. Oh, Beverly. A curly blonde hair, a permanent scowl, that rare smile that shines. Smells like a sexual Tyrannosaurus in here. That's uh very sweet. You want some of this? Something I could do to Turn you into a goddamn sexual Tyrannosaurus. That's a Predator reference, by the way. Which is odd considering I'm talking to the creepy janitor about to ask him if he'll go to prom with me. Oh, sorry, kid. You're cute and all, but I, I can't bear to be around romance right now. It's just too painful to be reminded of my uh, soon to be ex -wife. I could have muted that. I chose not to. You're welcome. Think your soon to be ex wife would go to prom with me? Fuck you, kid. <laughs> you ask her yourself. She's probably at least telepathy moving on without me. Marriage mending. Oh. Say, can I borrow your keys? My, my keys? Wait, that's a, that's a perk. Gotta love Jesse the Body Ventura. Uh, I was going 
looking to key the car of your soon-to-be ex-wife's date. Oh, that's awfully sweet you little buddy. The thing is, they're not on me, and I can't remember where I left them. I have them. I could have left them in one of my crying spots, like the faculty lounge or the boiler room, so maybe check those places. Okay, I'll check those out, and maybe give those crying spots a test drive. Oh, <laughs> trust me. They're the best darn crying spots in the whole school. This poor fucking well, guy. Oh, if luck be a lady, she would have left me too. Oh, Beverly. Fucking course her name is Beverly. Oh, I don't have the keys anymore, though. Uh, okay, let's let's go talk to these people. Is this lion even moving? You guys have been here all lunch period. <sighs> have you ever noticed how perfect Ken's Her name is literally Groupie Greta. I'd do anything to go on just one date with him. I'd punch my own mother in the throat. I'd kill my best friend and burn the body. Are you serious? Dead serious. Speaking of dead, can you get lost? i just die if Kent saw me talking to a loser like you. Oh man, you're right. What was I thinking? Sorry for existing. I'll just get out your hair then. I don't forget Sad. you. Bye. Rude. What are you going to have Kent write in your yearbook? Oh, uh, good question. I, I don't even know. I, I saved up my lunch money for three weeks to afford it, though. I better think of something good. You know, I will say this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give, I'm gonna give like a, a pretty big props to this game right now, in the idea that a lot of point and clicks have zero voice work, like voiceover lines and stuff, and this game is carrying the entire conversation for me. I don't have to read them. <laughs> Good on you. Wait, you've got to pay him to get him to sign it? Flips like us should be honored to have the opportunity to even gaze upon his glory, let alone borrow a moment of his precious time. You do know that he's probably a total jerk because people like you let him act this way, right? Plus, he's already stupid rich. Why would you pay him to write in your book? This whole thing is stupid. Thank you. Don't criticize me! It's moments like this that make it so fun to watch Kent beat you up! Shit. Yeah, <sighs> whatever, dude. That kid's you a dick. to have Kent sign your yearbook? Oh my gosh, yes. I slept here all last night so I could get a good spot in the <sighs> mentally unstable, Stacy? Likely. Likely. That's, uh, pretty dedicated. Oh, I'm Kent's number one fan! I own all his dead pets, even the cocker spaniel that died under mysterious circumstances. Okay. Oh, the simpiest of simps. Hey, I Look, kid, we're trying to get Sir Kent's autograph. You're gonna have to line up right here like everyone else. No cutsies. Uh, no. I, I just wanted to. No cutsies. Kent. Oh, look. Oh, yes, you can. <laughs> you see that line, Dick Nips? It's not for decoration. Get in the back of the line like everyone else, and if you're lucky, I'll we'll charge Nips. you double for my autograph. I don't want you to sign my yearbook, dude. What a trick! Didn't you get voted most likely to get murdered by Kent? Yeah, and I don't want to commemorate it. Thanks. Suit yourself. Let me know if you change your mind. I'll even write your epitaph in there. You bit. Well, wait, here we go. Your family is filthy rich, dude. Why are you taking money for autographs? Well, piss face, my autograph in a freshman yearbook pre prom is top shelf stuff, especially with this being my second senior year. Some people collect these things. Nice things. Don't get all butt hurt because you can't afford nice things. Or is it because you can't afford these nice things since your parents cut you off for being held back a grade? Sawyer said that you cried when they cut up your credit card. Ooh. Well, I'll leave it. Keep talking like that and I'll have to do something about it. See, do, do something, I heard then, your bitch. Your history got posted on billboards all over town. Wonder how that happened. Go fuck yourself. Very funny. You won't be able to do pranks like that anymore now that your family cut off your gravy train. I heard that get circle butt James flustered. Hiring, oh, but I thought, I thought uh, he, he's getting, getting butt flustered is what it is. Seriously, dude, thanks for the bullshit advice, but if I were you, I'd walk away while you still have your legs. Would your parents still bail you out of jail after an assault charge? You're goddamn right they would. Would they? Well, uh, you know, I'm just fooling with Would they, heart. though? Just jokes. Please walk away. No. Why do you hate me so much? You see, Aww. the ecology of a modern-day high school is a delicate balance that must be precisely maintained at all times. I'm a white hat bully. I bully for good, not for evil. If it weren't for bullies like me, 
everyone would be eating their boogers and sucking their thumbs. Who would make fun of the kid with the boner? Who would make fun of the LARPing kids? Who would all the hot girls date? I give people the opportunity for change, a chance to see the light. I'm a mirror for self-reflection, and I'm going to make you less shitty no matter what, even if it kills you. Yeah, it's too bad for you that I'm totally confident in who I am and don't need your acceptance to feel validated as a person. Yeah, you Let's go, Coop. Let's ourselves, cum face. Well, I don't LARP, at least. A drop in the bucket, pal. There's got no a long way to go. There's nothing wrong with LARPing. What would you say if I told you I know the real reason why you didn't graduate? Oh? What are you getting at, piss pants? Oh. Everyone knows I got held back on purpose so I can be the only hunk to ever get voted prom king five times. Oh, so it definitely isn't because you failed every single class except for culinary arts? That you were nowhere near the required credit count to graduate? Uh... Culinary no, arts, that, huh? That's ridiculous! Hmm. You're way off base, poop scoop! Everyone knows that I'm here for the sole purpose of defending... Hit him with piss pants, cum face, and poop scoop. Like but that second part is more of a hobby than anything else. That's weird, because I heard that your final report card went missing last year. Like, someone stole out of your mailbox or something. Was that just a rumor? Weird rumor. Wonder where it ended up if it did go missing. Probably not in the hands of a dickweed like me or anything. Hope it's somewhere safe. What are you huh. trying to say? Are you saying you have it, Queef Beef? I'm just saying, I bet you make a mean quiche. Mr. Beef makes a mean knuckle sandwich if you'd like a sample. Oh, Mr. Beef. Busted on that. Uh, no thanks. I'm on a low violence diet. Then I suggest you forget whatever Smooth. you think that you know, and if you don't, I'm glad you made it to work safe, Chris. You have a you have a fun day at work. You you go be the best right, tool you can, the best tool salesman you can be. What do I have to do to get you to leave me alone? You can stop pissing me off with every breath you take, for starters. Oh. Or you can move or be buried alive or something. So rude. Lives wouldn't be as fun, would they, Coop? The only thing I'm going to miss after graduation is tormenting you. I'm going to miss throwing your photo albums in the toilet. Hey, what a pop-up, Patchy. Thank you for that thing. Thank you for that lurk. Thank, thank you so much for that lurk, BB. I'll How you doing? I'll be gay conversion therapy. Or that time I switch your antidepressants with depressants. And I'll definitely miss paying your dentist to replace your teeth with little tiny dildos. I definitely won't miss getting my armpit hair ripped out or having aluminum foil thrown to my mouth whenever I yawn. It's such a shame. School is a lot more fun when there's a puss tush to torment. A puss tush. Puss tush a man like me could ask for. Soon it'll be the last time you see this puss tush. Enjoy it while it lasts. Dude, you should be saving them points for free merchandise, dude. Like, yeah. Consider it a farewell from yours truly. You'll see. What does that mean? Oh, nothing. Good luck trying to make it to graduation day. Ah, shit. Ah, shit indeed. You look busy. I'm always too busy for you. Don't come back. Rude. Okay. Wait, let's go talk to the... Oh, what's in here? Can I go in... Can I straight up go in the kitchen? Wait. Why is there bleach in the kitchen? And a milk bag? What is this, Canada? Oh, look at that! Hey, hey buddy. Hey there, what you cooking, good looking? Don't hit on me, kid. I'm way out of your league. True. Kind of filthy back here, don't you think? Well, look who we got here. If it isn't the little baby health inspector, thanks for your concern, but it's gonna have to stay this way until that damn janitor gets his emotions under control. Uh, okay, but does cleaning the dishes really fall under the janitor's duties? Does it look like I've cleaned them? Ants. Uh, not really. Well, then I guess it's Ow, up to shit. the janitor to handle then, isn't it? Can't argue with that logic. It's perfectly logical. Will you go to prom with me? No way, bub. I already Aww. went to prom back when I was your age, and one prom is plenty. I went to two. Oh man. Wait, who? Well, got any tips for someone looking to go is. to prom in hopes of finding Look love at you, palin. in his budding sexuality? Wait, what are you gonna get? What are you gonna get? Tell me. What are you gonna get? I wanna know. What are you, what are you gonna get? What are you gonna get? Tell me. Tell me what are you gonna get. That take you all the way. What? Take it from me, kid. Let your ass crack breathe, and the ladies will follow your sweet pheromones. I don't think that'd work. Then why do you think you walked in here? Fair okay, point. Well. Yeah, yeah. Gross. Oh my god, dude. Something is itching my eye, and I can't make it stop. There we go. Pig parts. 
I don't see anything I can grab yet, so we're gonna... Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm fairly certain that this is what's on the cafeteria menu for the rest of the week. Oh. Wait, can we not just go in there? It's frozen shut. Of course it is. Okay. Let's go this way. It's his fart. It's it's his fart. It It's his fart. Is 200,000. 200,000. You want a hoodie? Talk to me, babe. Yeesh. This food smells like a wet wad of death. Why don't I reduce you into a wet wad of death for that comment? Oh, what, it's making my eyes itch? <laughs> What's a food budget? I'm not gonna miss eating here after I graduate. Do you need something, mouth breather? Or are you just here to fog up my sneeze god? Uh... We go to problem? Wait, yes. Oh, wait, we already we already know where Jake is. Eli Eliza's gonna pick my next, uh... My next stream, aren't you? I know exactly what we're gonna do. Let you get back joke all you want but from this day forth you'll never know what's in your lunch kid oh all right let's see if we can let's see if we can find a quarter somewhere not my job buddy can i exit it's locked isn't it they're sealed shut so we can't escape this prison i know and i only got to play it for 30 minutes there's not another door either is there okay maybe we can find the quarter elsewhere Wait, is there? There's a staircase over here. Can I go up the staircase? I can. What's up here? Oh, this is where I came from. Okay. Uh, where do I go from here? Wait, can I go outside over here though? See, I'm waiting to get a. Uh, I'm waiting to get a cease and desist letter from the old PH. There we go. All right, we can go outside now. <gasps> oh, look at you! You're the cool kid. You got a goatee and everything. You know smoking is bad for your health, right? So is living, Daddy O. Bebop Daddy O. That's my oh, whoops. soul patch, baby. I got so much soul. You're pretty lucky to be able to grow facial hair at this age. All right, baby, you got me. It's poop. Whatever it takes to look cool, man. You got that right, baby. Hey, hey, guys. Hey, I just want you to uh. I just want you... I know this is like a narwhal, but it looks more like a sperm whale. This is the best and only rack I've ever touched. Now, since I have not done it yet, if you want, Glorvis, we can refund your points, and then you can save them up for later. Oh, it's Jesus. Can we go talk to Jesus? Uh, what are you doing here? YOLO, I'm just out here living life to the fullest. Going door to door, looking to score. Any luck? I've been getting looks, and I've been passing out winks and smiles. Oh. What are you? Some kind of rock star? As far as these chicks are concerned, I'm a sensitive, heart throbbing, tear jerking, seat wetting rock star. Oh, so you're just trying to impress high school girls? Trying, it's pretty easy when you have a guitar. Aren't you old enough where it's kinda, I don't know, creepy as hell? What's so creepy about fingering something other than a guitar? Oh, this is the narwhal that said goodbye. <laughs> In but anyways, here's Wonderwall. This is the narwhal that said goodbye to Buddy on uh, on the movie Elf. Where'd you learn to play guitar? My stepdad started drinking Aww. and forgot about his guitar. <laughs> oh, that sucks having a dad who drinks. Mine died, so I can kind of relate. Dead dads are better than drunk dads who beat you up and make you eat ants out of the garden. Got it! Think I'd get a girlfriend if I learned guitar? Maybe if you put a guitar over your face and draw a better one in its place. Ouch, dude. Uh, I don't think I'd want to do that. In that case, bud, call a grave digger on your face and have him bury it deep in a grave. 
How rude. Will you go to prom you with me? You prom with me? Maybe if you drew lipstick on your hand That's a babe I could understand Old prom night handy, Jays. I was Jays. thinking you'd take my entire body to prom. Oh, I don't think the rest of you. No, 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 you're not as cute. Fucking asshole. Okay, I gotta go. Shine on, you crazy creep. Oh, whatever, bud. Peace and love. About that. Peace and love. Okay, if you want, yeah, I'll, I'll refund your points, and, uh, oh, hi. Psst, hey, I heard you could get the hard stuff. Oh, the, the marker markers. guy. I've got the strongest markers in town. Wow, H how'd you know I was talking about markers? I can sniff out a sniffer from a mile away. Hand over the money, and this here deep blue jumbo-sized mark tech marker is all yours. Oh, I don't have any money. Um, <sighs> could you just, like, give it to me? You just redeem your channel points and then uh, just give an address I can mail it to? Fuck no. But I suppose there's something you could do for me. What? Come on. I could probably help. See, I've been trying to bust into the kindergarten market, right? But every time I approach the playground, this damn kick-ass scar on my face sends those babies running for the hills. I take care of it myself, but buddy, thank you. I'm blacklisted from every pharmacy in town for oh wow. Yeah, I was like legit frozen. So what you're saying is that's awesome. Scar away, scar be gone, scar lost, scar bro, fair skin, scar whatever brand you can get your hands on. Give me the scar cream, and the marker is all yours. Right? Okay, got it. Hey, Palin, look who it is. Hey, buddy. He goes, oh my god, wild wingles appears. Oh shit. Yeah, it's an IQ 200 move. Oh, shit. And now it's all over me. That's fine. Yep. Got you wet. You oh, got me good, you fucker. hot in here, so it's not a bad thing. Mm-hmm. That's why I didn't mind opening the door before. I heard the door, the, the car door shut, so I was like, you know what? I'm going to open this door now to let some breeze come through. Yeah, there you go. Mm. Man. Now I have to actually, like, portion this out and not just chug it in one go. Mm -hmm. Look at that. It's called, it's called lack of self-control. He's looking out for me. I'm useful. I don't care what my dad said. I'm, 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 <laughs> I'm doing my part. <laughs> oh, man. I had a saying I always said. It was, uh, uh, I don't care what my dad says. I'm, uh, I'm good for something. I'm good for something. <laughs> I'm with it. Mm -hmm. How's your game so far? I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. It's yeah. very, very side night happiness humor, and that's just right up my alley. Gotcha. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get, uh, get this guy into the kindergarten game selling markers for kids to huff. Oh, nice. Yeah. Which is good because I have like real life experience in this, so it's gonna play to my advantage. So there you go. I was it's gonna good say to good. While, while I'm walking in this room over here, uh, Nikki's craft room, I was smelling all the enamel and stuff. Oh like, god! Oh man! Yeah, you can, is, you uh... can get high on the fumes back here. Oh yeah, it's great. Well, I noticed. <laughs> it's, it's it's amazing. Normally that's why I leave the door shut or the window shut. I'm mm. like that way I can hot box that stuff in here. Oh there you go. Yeah, I tell I, I tell her all the time. Don't worry about it. Nobody sleeps back here. Spray paint in the house. Yeah, there you go. And wait, just wait till I'm back here. Oh hey chicken. Is chicken, chicken is, is wingles. <laughs> also, basically what you saw the other night is going to be the beginning of the day of mischief, pal, and so get ready. It's going to get weird. You okay. probably won't be as drunk. No, probably not, because it, it, then it'd just be a problem, because it's although, like fucking although, nine in the morning. Yeah. I don't know. we got a long way to go. Oh, hey, Obi. Hey, it's a, hey, Obi. What's going on, man? Kiffin. I already have. Mm -hmm. You just... Nothing above here, though. No, 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 no. It's nothing seeable except for on OnlyFans. Oh, hey, Grimdy. Oh, hey, Grimdy. What's going on, man? Hi, buddy. Th hey, thank, thank, thank you for that sub. 28 months. Jesus, fuck. That's awesome. Enjoy work, man. I miss your face. See anyone other than me on stream? Hey, special guests. Special guests. It's what we do. I'm an outside pet. He's an outside pet. He's OP. <laughs> He's OP, OB. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Boo. Yeah. Boo work. Yay, Wingles. I don't, I don't think I'm going to work all the way until I have, like, until four. I started at five this morning, so. Jesus Christ. Right. Hi, Cola. How you doing? I I'll cut out early, probably. All right, well, what time do you finish streaming? I don't know yet. Just like, I'm, just, I'm not like on a set deal, so. Oh, I thought go. you had a time or something for this. No. You just play. Yeah, just getting to do it. Just kind of, kind of however I want. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's cool. 
uh, while we're while we're here, for those of you who uh, don't already, if you don't, you should. It's uh, this is my friend, Mr. Wingles. Guys, that's me. You should follow him. You should follow him. Yeah, go follow that guy. Go follow that guy. He's cool people. I'll, I'll, I'll stream again eventually. Event eventually! Yeah, probably probably as soon as I'm in the new camper, I'll stream. So probably probably next week I'll start back up. Maybe we could stream going to get the new camper if we as long as we I have it stream it. I'll probably I'll probably film it. I don't know if I've shown you uh uh I don't know if I've shown you my uh my new camera that Eliza got me, but I haven't seen it yet. Uh, yeah, that's the one I got like all the GoPro mounts and stuff for. Oh. Uh, but we'll probably film the vlog for that that I'll edit Hell by yeah. the end of the year. <laughs> still Hell yeah! I still haven't edited the Christmas vlog, so that's a. Uh, oh, uh, dude! Thing. Yeah, you just batch edit all of them, and release them as like a as an as a special. I mean, honestly, I'm like my YouTube channel's small enough that I'm not like in any sort of algorithm or anything like that. So the t the release time doesn't matter for me. I right. can just drop them all at once, like batch it. Yeah, I'm 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 not gonna be recommended with as small as I am, so it's not uh, it's not that important. That makes sense. Yeah, because the way that, I mean, at least my understanding of the YouTube algorithm is, like, you have to be consistent up to a certain point. Yeah. Then they'll be like, okay, this person's actually trying. Yeah, that's why, that's why I've kind of, like, fucked myself, honestly. Because, uh, I, I have only released one video in, like, the last week. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I think as long as you do weekly, you're good. Yeah, and I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna do something with this tonight, and, uh... Maybe later tonight and release it tomorrow since the game actually comes out tomorrow. Which, if you have not, wishlisted. Enter for a free copy, you fuckers. Yeah, get your free copy. Why not? Yeah, fuckers. Yeah. Get it. Enter the giveaway. Fuck. Do it. Anyways. All right, man. Watch you. Uh, watch you tomorrow. Enjoy, enjoy the rest of work. Don't, don't worry, chat. I'm going to sexually harass you in a bit. He will. Especially you, Harm. Hey, he will. I've seen it. <laughs> Thank you for the water, buddy. Oh, yeah, no problem. Oh, I got us, uh, uh, we'll probably drink before then, but I got us energy drinks for Saturday. Oh, good. <laughs> good, because we're going to need them. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's, that's Wingles. That's, that's my outside pet and my good friend. He, uh, he's going to be going to Texas like next month, I think, but until then, he's going to be hanging out in, in, in my yard. I still got to locate a printer. I have also wait. Go to La Telepath. Okay, we got so, scar issue. Find scar cream for the drug dealer. Okay, I bet I can find. I bet I bet I know where to find scar cream. I bet it's in the uh, the nurse's office. Let's go. Let's go to the nurse's office. I too would tax that ass. <laughs> I I mean I mean he, he's a good dude. You'll get to tell him that here in a minute because he's gonna be back in here. Okay, not this one. That poster said, I got my eye on you. That's amazing. Okay. Oh, the library. The library. I actually, this is part of my, part of my actual thing. I need to be taking this USB and putting it on. Nope, that didn't work at all. Oh, shit. Let's talk to this guy first. Hey there, do you mind if I? Did I give you permission to look at, let alone speak to me? Oh, that's right. That's what it was. There's no printer here. I think I got to take it to the office or something, right? Hold on. Let's let's get back to it. Let's let's take a look. Let's take a look real quick. Yeah, locate a printer. Hard to look away from if you don't have the stomach for it. You can always lounge around like a jaded teacher. No, that's okay. That's what it was. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But while we're here, what the fuck? Hello, Mr. Pepe. Well, well. It seems the winds have served as nature's guide, bringing a weird little nomad unto me. Uh, right. My name's Coop, by the way. Young Coop, I cannot speak for long, for I have to stay vigilant against those who find the need to take more from this earth than they give. Is there a printer here I could use? I am afraid not, for the serpent who lives within has shown itself, causing great sorrow and confusion across the computer lab. Who? Who ban appealed? What happened? Due to underfunding, a great Here. blaze has swept over the school like a storm over the gentle plains. The tools of the people are being sequestered under a blind eye. Wait, what did he get banned for? Has been taken, and I can only wish to Mother Squirrel and Brother Antelope in hopes that it fell into the hands of someone who truly needed it. So it was stolen. Got it. 
Also, every program is being up. He kind of does the needs of a 64 bit. Oh, so that's what it was. Lunch in harmony and not overtax the CPU like the farmer who harvests. I don't remember a lot about that night. Dire times, young papoose. These are dire times indeed. Tell me about it. See you later, Mr. Pepe. Mr. Pepe. What are you doing down here, guy? Where'd they get all of these books? Did they pull them out of a better library's dumpster? Heh. <laughs> oh, wait. Him. Talk to him. What you reading there? I'm expanding my vocabulary with new words out of the dictionary. Wow, that's pretty proactive of you. Very. This one. Belch. Verb. To orally stimulate the anus of a sexual partner, specifically to remove semen. Felch. Huh. I'm learning. Depending on which way I walk, this t-shirt will either say boob or dude. What kind of shirt sorcery is this? Oh. Oh. Wait, did I get did I get a new Oh I got a new shirt? Nice. I'm with it. Read, damn it. Oh hey, who are you? Gods vs. Dogs Volume 2. Hey, I'm Coop and I was Pass. Okay. What's this way? Oh, we're back here. Would you stop? Okay, let's go to the teacher's lounge. Which was this way, I believe. Wait, scar cream first. Let's see if we can find scar cream. Is this scar cream? No. Hello. Oh, it feels like a boob. Oh, never mind. That's the uh, that's that stuff. Maybe she has scar cream. I need scarring cream, please. Sorry, kid. It doesn't work on emotional scars. That's uh, I don't need it for that. Damn it. Okay, well I don't see any scars. No scars, no cream. I have scars. I totally have scars. I definitely have a scar. Uh. Down there. Uh, it's kind of in a private place, and uh, prom is coming up, so. Say no more, kid. Just please don't whip your balls out. <laughs> as a favor to you, I'll give you the scarry cream. And as a favor to me, you can leave me alone and stop bothering me about your genital tearing. I like it. Yes. Now I can give the scar cream to that crack dealer. What? Uh, nothing. Torn balls. Whatever, kid. As much as I like bacteria-infected offices, I should get going. Yeah, I hate it here, too. All right, we got it. We got the scar cream. Boom. All right, let's go ahead and go take care of that first. Is that this way? Right? No, no, no. That's, that's not this way. Was it this way? Yeah, because then it was this way. Boom. And then, wait, I'll get there eventually. I'll get there eventually. I don't remember how to do things and stuff, but we will get there. Okay, book fair. Oh, that's right. Then we go. The, okay. Yeah, yeah, because he's right outside the store. We got the scarring cream. We can get the markers. Let's go. Damn it. I'm touching all the bikes. Scarring cream? Boom. Oops brought you the scar cream. All right. Hey, thanks, kid. You ain't half bad. As promised, here's the hard stuff ready to be sniffed to your nose's content. It's not for me. It's for a friend. Whatever, kid. Look, all I know is thanks to you, a nose. I'm here for the sexy man. The sexy man's head. already went back out to I his camper. Goofballs to six-year-olds. Thanks. Oh, uh, I feel like I didn't think this through. I think I'm in over my head. Well, see ya. You're doing great, kid. A weed shirt. Does this mean I can smoke it? Oh, we got a weed shirt? Let's go. Costume. Boom. Now we really look like a pretentious dick. Wait, wait what do we get here? The marker? Okay. Uh, Chores. Medicinal markers. Give Mark the scented marker. Let's go. We did the thing. Here, Mark. Oh, hi, Mark. I got that marker for you. You did? No way! Gimme, gimme, gimme! So, will you go to prom with me now? Huh? What? His fucking eyes, though! I'll take that as a maybe. A, a, a. to remember me by. A dick. On my face. You, uh, really shouldn't have. Well, glad it could help. See yes! 
Achieved Huff the Magic Dragon. We got Dick Face. Let's go. Wait, trophies. Is that what that is? Huff the Magic. Oh, the achievements. Okay, got it. Let's see. Let's go. Anchovy chips for the vending machine. We're going to have to wait on that one, I think. We need to find a quarter. Go to Le Telepath and talk to Beverly. Can I leave school grounds? Because if I can leave. This is the longest lunch break ever, by the way. Can we go to Le Telepath? Can we just leave? Oh, we can. School isn't over yet. Never mind. We have to wait. Okay, so I have to wait on that, I think. Okay, let's go to the faculty office. What happened here? What are you guys in for? This narc keeps saying I beat him. Starsky. True, but don't go around knocking about it. You call that and Hutch. Thing? It's Starsky and Hutch. Got him old. Maybe I can help. Maybe you can fuck off. See what I have to deal with. Guys, let's be constructive here. Why don't you each vocalize your issues with one another? My biggest issue right now is with a little dweeb sticking his nose where it doesn't belong. What the hell, man? The kid's just trying to help. Yeah. Oh, what? Now you guys are ganging up on me? Classic knock behavior right there. Just leave us alone. Great. It sounds like we're closing in on a breakthrough here. You obviously hate each other. Why do you even hang out? Because he's my best friend. Even though he hurts me. Aw. Dude. That's how relationships are supposed to work. Wait. No, it's not. We're supposed to use our Oh, I didn't even see the poll. There's a poll. Right here, over there. A. I'm voting too. I'm, I don't normally vote on my own polls, Guys, but I'm voting A. Shut the fuck up, Coop. Can you believe this fucking kid? I know, right? He thinks he's fucking Dr. Phil or some shit. <laughs> Listen. I'm sorry I haven't been the best about expressing my feelings. I guess my anger just manifests itself in violence because that's the only thing I've seen my parents do. But together, I think maybe we can learn to break the cycle. Yeah, you're right. I could have been more receptive to your positive behavior and not just your violent behavior. I know that when I lash out, it exacerbates emotions. And when tempers get to that next level, I tend to lose my cool and open up to authority figures instead of you. See? Shut, Shut the, the fuck, fuck up, up, Coop! I love you almost as much as I hate Coop's dumbass suggestions. What? Aw, I love the way you hate him. Aw. Oh, whoa, hey, whoa, what? Ooh, this is even steamier than the romance novels on my e-reader. Um. What? know how to lock lips i'm learning a lot just by watching that went a direction god her eyes got huge remain distracted by those two guess at least now we can do this uh damn i must have inserted it the wrong way why does that always happen with usb drives better try again flipped usb drive uh, i guess i must have had it right the first time god damn it they really did it. They did the thing. Those two are going the fuck at it, aren't they? What the? How come that didn't work on my first try? God damn it! I hate technology. Ugh. Oh well, at least the copies are printed. Copy that. You spelled coming wrong. Are you talking about the? Wait, are you talking about the USB? Oh. <laughs> Okay, now that I have these flyers, I just need to find three good spots in school to hang them up. I know one. I already know one. Out front. Go, leave. <sighs> Announcements. There's one. That's a damn good spot for a flyer if I do. And I do. All right. There's one outside. I know, dude. She was just... She was locked eyes on locked lips, dude. Boom. That's a damn good spot for a flyer if I do say so myself, and I do. I like your cut, G. I like the cut of your jib. All right, let's go find a third spot. Uh, art gallery, maybe? Oh, wait. <laughs> Hold on. Can I? There's a spot. Let's be honest. 
Peter's flyer looks way better than any of this art anyway, so I did them a favor. There we go. Sawyer's definitely gonna think of me as her best friend now. Well, hopefully. Sad. <laughs> she was. That's very accurate. Hey, Sawyer. I got those flyers up. I'm sure some of these idiots will accidentally see it. I hope so. Thanks for that. Oh, by the way, you should go talk to the librarian. I saw her cracking her knuckles and swearing vengeance on you. Something about an overdue book? Yeesh. I already have enough people threatening my life as it is. Thanks for the heads up. I'll go talk to her. Whoops. Okay. Talk to the librarian. I still can't do those two yet. So yeah, let's go talk to the librarian. Where was the library? This way? Hey, look at me. Excuse me. Please, I... Ah, oh, Mr. McCarthy. Just the person I wanted to see. That doesn't sound good. How observant of you. The thing is, little bitch. Can I call you little bitch? I'd prefer you didn't. The thing is, little bitch, <laughs> you owe the library some debt. Does 99 ways to make friends. The psionic perceive versus the bronze brain or... Where are my pubes? A guide to late bloomers. Sound familiar? Uh, isn't there some sort of confidentiality rule or something? I know you have them, Koopa. The library knows everything. Hey. It's okay. I, I can just run home and get them. I'm afraid I can't let you leave. Not with regular unbeaten knees, anyway. Not my knees. Those are my favorite knees. Lucky for you, I have a little deal to oh. offer. Either we take your overdue book debt out on your little bitch knees, or you can do us a favor on the down low. We're what? missing a very important carpentry book. First edition. Bring it back to me and carpentry. I might let you live. Okay. Hell, I'll even throw in a little something extra for scratching our back. How does that sound? Sounds like I don't have a choice. You don't. Now get moving while you still can walk. Uh, okay, since it's not in the library, <laughs> the hell can I find a time out. Book? Uh, shop. Let's go to shop. Shop is where missing book be. Would bet. Chicken's still new here. Chicken doesn't understand. Wait, what's this way? Have I gone this way? Oh, that's cafeteria. Okay, I need to go to shop. Hey. <laughs> This way? Which way was shop? It's down that hallway. Right this way? Yeah, there we go. Hey, what up, Donnie? You do indeed spy on me. How How you doing? How you doing? Like birds are more likely to There's got to be a book in here somewhere, right? Aha! It's really stuck under there. I'm going to have to find a way to raise the desk if I want to get Oh, look at all that. Okay. To the, back to the gymnasium we go cuz we're going to get that rope. Dude, I've been really good. I'm A2, electric A. <laughs> I've been doing really well, man. Just enjoying enjoying things and stuff. How have you been, my guy? I think that's the more important question here. Gymnasium. I need this I need this rope. He is still going at that. There's got to be a better way. I I don't have a do I have a Wait, 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 wait. I have an idea. I don't know if this is I don't know if this is the way to go about it, but we're gonna give it a shot. Actually first, let's go to the boiler room. Cause there may be rope in the boiler room. These tools feel nice. I I think I'm a You're not. You're not. Alright, let's head over to I need to go back to the shop, which was on the third little hall over here with the, the tire tracks for some reason. Oh, you had your birth miss, dude. What did you, you do for your birthday? What did, what did you do? I need to take this box cutter, don't I? Sweet, a box cutter. It's like the switchblade of office supplies. <laughs> the switchblade of office supplies. Let's go. I like it. I want, I want a, dude, I want a box cutter. Wait.
Hey. Hey. I have a box cutter. <laughs> uh, I can't get the book yet. It's stuck under the desk. So what I'm gonna, what I think I have to do, is go over here to uh, back to the gym, cut the rope down, put the rope and the pulley together, hook it to the chain, raise the desk, get the book. Boom. Bada boom. Skirt. Boom. I'm sure nobody will miss this portion of the rope. Who knows? Who knows? Combining a rope and pulley? Genius! How do I come up with these great ideas? Wait. I, I don't think that's necessarily a new... T yum? Meh. Everybody knows the top of the, the the top of the food pyramid's best. I completely forgot I had a box cutter. It's more of a carpet knife, I guess, actually, than a box cutter. But yeah, it's whatever. That that might be. I'm starting to turn into my dad. My dad has that pasta is on the bottom. It, everything in the middle can eat a dick. Everything like the top and bottom of the food pyramid are the best. Cause I do loves me some pasta. Boom. Damn, I've got surprisingly good aim. You do. Okay, that's more secure than I'll ever be. Oh. Now we lift that up. I'm not gonna question the physics of what just happened. I'm just glad it worked. Yes. Get the book. Is what that? That right there? Finally. Is that I a finger? Is that a finger? I better return this to the library. <laughs> How you doing? Days. How you doing, Ryan? How, you, how are you doing? Welcome in, friendo. Can I take any of this other I shit? I think this is a little advanced for me. One time I somehow managed to hot glue my nostrils shut. Oh. I shouldn't touch it when it's showing its teeth like that. Oh, that's, that's pretty cool, dude. Uh, which one did you join, if you don't mind my asking? Doing... Doing Dandorino. Ooh, that's that's some pretty fine doing then. That's some pretty fine doing. Hey Shazzy, how are you doing, friendo? Oh shit, where's the library? The library was whoops. Library was this way? Right? This library? Nope. Library was downstairs, right? This way? Nope, that's cafeteria. Shit. The monster squad? Nice. I'm happy for you, my guy. Just woke up. I still feel like I'm in the process of doing that myself. Library was this one then, wasn't it? Oh, duh, library is this one. It's where the book fair is. I'm fucking It's fine. Everything's fine. Hey, uh, I found that missing book fine. You're looking for. You stole it, didn't you? No! Admit it! Admit it! Mm. What? No! I found it under a table in the shop class. Yeah. That... Ah, the shop class! That explains it. All the students in there should be executed. Hit me up after stream, Glorbus. I I have an idea. I put my tax dollars towards housing them in prison later down the road. Uh, yeah. So, can I get my reward now? Yeah. A reward? What reward? You said if I scratched your back by recovering that book, you'd give me something. That doesn't sound like something I'd say. And I don't want your grubby little fingers scratching my back. However, what? you did bring back that book, so here's a coupon for one free Rod's Thick Cheese Pizza. I hope you choke on it. Wait. Wow, thanks. This is actually really nice, and I totally appreciate... Shh. Idea. This may be wrong, but I have an idea. All right, oh! I'm done. Eat shit, obligations. Now I can finally get out of this godforsaken... Oh, okay. Let's score some free pizza. If I'm good, <laughs> if I'm gonna go out, I'm gonna go out choking on some thick pizza. Choke me on that cheesy pizza. Love me. What the fuck is wrong with me? Sometimes I'm a lot. Uh, sometimes I feel like I'm a lot dumber than I originally think I am. Let's go find that thick cheese pizza. Cause now school's out. Bean friend. Can't tell me where to go, sign. I'll walk wherever I damn well please. Hi, house. I forgot. Thanks, but my name isn't Mr. House Grabber. That's where Mr. Crotch Grabber lives. He's actually a really nice guy, but everyone thinks he's a sex offender due to the unfortunate family name. Wait, whose house did I just run up on? Oh, you. I don't have 
time to sit around talking about the lizards that run our government while producing toothpaste used for mind control. Okay. Not my mail. Not. Ah. Be hateful. Steal something. Oh, the Circle J. Of course, it's the Circle J. Howdy, partner. I beat it, kid. Wait, Dan Nguyen. Hold on a second. Oh, no, no, no. Different. Speaking of Side Night and Happiness. <laughs> I've read this book on stream before. I have a slew of kids books over here. Oh, hey. You, you okay, my guy? Mind if I walk up and start talking to you out of nowhere? Of course I mind. Can a guy construct a devious plot in peace? I, where do I know the name Dan Nguyen, though? Who are you taking to prom? I haven't decided yet. I've asked 12 girls and got 12 yeses. The girls are thirsty for prom dates, and Jimmy's got enough for everyone to drink. But I don't have to tell you. I'm sure you know what I mean. Uh, yeah. Way too many bitches up on my jock. <laughs> About that. How can I help? I need you to go into the Circle J and buy the condoms for me. I think I did this backwards. Can't you just get condoms at the gas station? So a uh, so a preacher, a minister, or a, yeah, a preacher, a minister, and a rabbit walk in to get their blood drawn, and uh, they begin to ask what they all are, and uh, or what all blood types they have. And the preacher says, "I believe I'm uh, I uh, AB negative," and the uh, the minister says, "I believe I'm B positive," and. Uh, the rabbit goes, I don't know if I'm negative or positive, but I do believe I'm a type O. If you if you get the joke, you get the joke. Nope, they caught me stuffing my jacket with lollipops. <gasps> okay, what about the grocery store? Can't. I got caught stealing kebabs, and now I'm banned. Kebabs? You sure like stealing. There's two things Jimmy loves. Stealing and stick-based consumables. So, are you going to help me get this condom or not? I'm broke. All right, well... I don't usually go around paying for things, but here's some cash. Wow, a dollar and fourteen cents. What an oddly specific amount. That yeah, is. that's right. And keep the change. And don't tell <sighs> anyone I gave that to you. I've got a reputation to maintain around here. Uh, sure. Thanks for the cash. That was one hell of a dad joke. I have two. I have two. <laughs> one dollar and fourteen cents added to backpack. I bet I get to keep a quarter out of this. Uh, where are Le Condams? Where are the <laughs> camel toes? One pack of condoms, please. Uh, what species? I'm sorry, what? Uh, original, I guess. Uh, original? You mean human? I'll need to see some identification because you need to be at least 18 in human years, 126 in dog years. Or 149 in fox years to purchase condoms. I, uh, don't have an ID on me. Uh, actually, my manager says I can't sell condoms to minors anymore after the fire. I can offer you some of our flavored diva cups or a sponge. I actually don't. I have a Siri. Or not, or not a Siri. I have, a, uh, I have an Alexa, but not a Google Home. Hard no on that offer. So, where are these condoms? Because I have a feeling if I can find them, I might be able to, uh... Oh, hey, there's porn. Uh, but there's no, uh, articles I want to read. Worth a try, bud. Maybe I could, maybe I can cause a distraction. I'm just pour it into my hands. I need a cup. Oh, well, where are the fuck? where are the cups? Here? Cups? One cup, primed and ready to be filled with soup. Super slurper goodness. Hi, Sev. Well, you like you like cyanide happiness, huh? If you like cyanide happiness, dude, enter the giveaway. Fuck, what's taking you so long? 
Hey, what up, Mr. Greenlee? Oh, I saw you were uh, asking for recommendations on a chair. Which one did you, uh... At S.O. Heh. I'm doing it! And don't forget to wishlist the game, too. Can I just, like, walk out with this? Uh, excuse me. Shit. Do you think you're leaving without exchanging... Whoops! You can have it back. I I'll see myself out. Oh, did I just straight up... Hold on. Hold on. I want to buy a fucking super slurper thingy. Raffle! Primed and ready to be filled with... Here, let's do this again. Mmm. Super slurper goodness. Bring on the brain freeze. You cannot tell me that's not the fucking Rugrats logo. But a Croy from Staples... We don't have a Staples anymore. You can't tell... It, it, that's the Rugrats logo, bro. So I'm just gonna steal this guy's money and... Uh, that's not what Jimmy asked me. Oh. Well, darn it! Where are the con where are the condoms? Toiletries? Midas? Is that the... How the heck am I gonna take these condoms with me when I can't buy them? Uh, we need to cause a distraction. That's how. Need to figure out how. Hold on. Hold on. Maybe there's a hint on how to cause this. Chores. Ready for rod. Oh, that's right. We gotta go do that. I'm sorry. Wait, what? If you can't carry protection out in the open, stay chill and conceal it. Okay. Wait. Do I have something I can put? Hiding condoms in a super Boom. Super cup? Genius. I don't get to keep the change, but... One large super slurper, please. Uh, okay. Well, then you owe me 14,000 gil or $1.14. Here you go. Uh. We hid it, it. We hid the condoms in the slurp. In the slurper. Here you go. Uh, why did you just hand me a slurper cup? Look closer. Are those my condoms in there? Yep. One box of condoms. Extra thick. Consider yourself helped. Should have had two C's in there. Thanks. You've made little Jimmy a happy chub. But, uh, why did you have to soak them in an icy cold slurper drink? Don't tell anyone, but I stole it. Ah, the old five finger discount. Nice. I'm proud of you, bud. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to prepare this condom for my prom night by poking a few holes in it, as is my limited understanding of condoms. See you around, chum. See ya. Don't. By the way, here's an extra large condom for your troubles. New hat. New hat. You're supposed to roll condoms over the head, so I guess I'm supposed to wear this as a hat? I really don't understand sex. You understand just fine, buddy. You understand just fine. Yep, there it is. Boom. There. You... We win. Oh my god, look at that. Nope, that didn't work at all. Look at the pizza coupon. Look at the pizza coupon. I love it. Oh wait, I can go up here? Hold on, let's go up here. Hey, oh, that's my house. Right now I need to focus. Okay, at least I know which house is mine. What the fuck? I'm sorry, who? Hi, I'm Coop and I just wanted to say that I... Please don't interact with me. Did you lose something? Just my son, Billy. Don't know where he ran off to. Probably working on a surprise for his old dad. <laughs> I remember him from one of the old cartoons. Where are you from? I'm a Citytropolis native. Why do you ask? Something seems different about you. Can't quite Damn it. My I can't get it, it to melt fast enough. Maybe it's the time. Let's go with that. Will you go to prom with me? Uh, I appreciate you thinking about me, but I'd rather not. Off the mustache. Why not? <laughs> Billy doesn't want me to start dating again. It oh. makes him uncomfortable. And I don't think you'd make a very good mother for him, despite your figure. Aww. I just want somebody to go to prom with me. No strings attached. I'm afraid I'm not emotionally available. Or physically. Or maritally. Or maritimely. Or... Okay, okay, I get it. Maritimely. Get it, because he's a shark. Grow that sweet mustache. Oh, that? I just rub a little chum on the old upper lip. What's chum? Is that like some kind of special mustache oil? 
Uh, sure, you could call it that. Nice. Where can I get some? I've been trying to grow a mustache for ages to no avail. It's not sold around here. It comes from overseas. Damn, must be fancy. Well, I gotta get going. See you later, neighbor. Please don't. Uh, please don't what? Please don't see me later. <sighs> ah, dude, dick. That's a dick move. We live on Knothole Road. Oh, I hear a commotion down here. Hello? I talked to him, but I honestly don't know where the money is either. Guess that's why I'm broke all the time. Okay. Oh, I can't really go that way. Okay. Can't go that way either. I can go that way, though. What? Excuse me. Just trying to get past. Halt! Citizen! Please remain at least three feet away from me while you give me your spare change. Otherwise, I am legally obligated to inform you I will bite. P.S. Got a spare change? I'm really just looking to get by. How about five bucks? I can turn to any shape you want for the minimum donation of five bucks. <laughs> dollars. <laughs> um. Sorry, I stopped carrying cash after I was mugged for 12 years straight by the bullies at my school. Oh. You're kind of a bummer, aren't you, kid? Maybe. Can you just let me buy, please? Come on, kid. Help me out here. How about a dollar? Some change? You gotta have a few quarters rattling around in that backpack of yours. I wish, but nope. Then allow me to contort my hand thusly. You're flipping me off, but I still don't have any money. Oh, Sad. Fine. Sorry. It's just been hard living out here with nowhere to call my own. Eh, I'm used to it. I get flipped off a lot by this bully, Kent. And teachers. And babies. Yeesh. So you'll let me buy? Absolutely. Oh, good. After a small donation. Damn it! <laughs> Damn it! Do you do yoga or something? Yoga? Ha! I think not. I'm a contortion artist and the greatest that ever lived. I'm known from all over the world for my feats of flexibility and the amazing ways in which I stand. Uh, strangely. How come I've never heard of you? Because you and the rest of the world are ignorant of the beauty in a man. I need this to hurry up and start melting. Back. I guess I still am. Oh, I Sounds kind of gross. The ability to dislocate my shoulders and rest my scrotum on my forehead is also gross. Do you do yoga or something? Oh yoga? shit, I didn't mean to click. You, I guess. Oh. Do you do yoga? Damn, stop clicking the same thing. Guess, oh. There we go. Don't you have somewhere else you can go? I did once. I had a beautiful home, a spacious two bedroom with a foyer to practice my contortion arts. Oh. What happened? Did the bank foreclose on you? Something like that. It was a microwave box, and the garbage man nabbed it from the alley while I was showering in the gas station bathroom. Oh. You lived in a microwave box? I know, I know. It's a little excessive, but sometimes you just need a place with a lot of space so you could really stretch out in. Now it's gone. It's just me and the streets trying to survive the elements. I tried to use my bottom half as a shelter for my top half, but it's just not the same. Wow. I'm sorry you don't have a home, mister. Maybe there's something I can do to help. Oh, great. We got to find him a box. Um, let me live in your home. No. Uh, no. Something that isn't that. Well, I suppose uh, some spare change would help. Got any spare change? Wait, really? Like recently or a long time ago? I was thinking of something more inventory based. How about that backpack? Looks roomy. I'm not going to carry you around. You may not be as helpful as you think you are, kid. Oh. Are you sure contorting? Boy, art is being able to stuff yourself into I was 22, maybe. Okay. Until your lungs can no <laughs> the kitchen or the restroom? <laughs> oh, like you will never understand true art. The morning routine in the slop sink? You're right. I don't get it. Mm. Huh. Just like the uncultured swines in charge of the county fairgrounds. Don't scare the children, Mo. Nobody's interested in the flexibility of your sphincter, Mo. Stop taking naps in the cotton candy machine, Mo. In grades, they fired me, folded me into a ball, and rolled me downhill to whatever crap town this is. Oh, Netherton, tough break. Which is exactly why I need a minimum donation of spare change. You got a spare change? Still no. Damn it. Take it easy, Stretch. Come back when you actually have something to offer me. They walked in. They were like, "Hey, somebody's showering in the or somebody's bathing in the bathroom sink." They walked in, and, w and Wingles was like, 
feet on the mirror, anus under the spout, just sitting there, pat, wiping it out. Hold on. Ah, Rod's thick pizza, mother clucking chicken. Let's go to Rod's. Look at you. As luck would have it, I actually have a coupon for a free pizza. A free pizza? You sure that coupon isn't expired? I'd be sad. There's no expiration on it. Damn. Wish I could say the same about my condoms. Your what? Hello? Uh, my condiments. So, what? can I get that free cheese pizza? Alright, why the hell not? Just don't go telling your friends I'm giving away free pizzas. Unless, of course, they're barely legal females, then you can send them my way. Deal? Uh, deal. Right on. Here you go, kid. Enjoy my thick pizza. Wish you wouldn't say it like that, but thanks. A lovely cheese pizza, just for me. I guess today wasn't. That's the wife. Time to head back home and scarf it down. I did. I missed all of it. Now I'm like sad. I'll go back and rewatch it later. <laughs> Let's see here. Uh, I got it. Homeward Bound is my next one. So I, do I actually go home? Okay, but we need to find La Telepath. It was squishy. Gross. Oh, they telepath. Let's see. We, let's see if we can fix up that marriage, though. Why is there a baby on the plate? A chicken taco and a bacon cake. Sir, I understand that you think she looks friendly based on her pleasant demeanor, but I assure you that a chill runs up her spine when you approach her. Please keep away. Aw. She, this is her, isn't it? Hey, aren't you the high school janitor's wife? Ugh, ex-wife. Please, kid, can't you see I'm on a date? I think you should give the janitor a second chance. Are you kidding me? When we met, he promised to sweep me off of my feet. At first, I thought I could overlook his love of the custodial arts. Oh. But when he would only make love on garbage day in a trash bin with a mop on my head, I could only take so much. He can only focus on one thing at a time. And I You're right. It was either trash or me. Well, now he's not doing either. Don't you think you could have a clean <laughs> and exciting life together? Exciting life? Ha! Huh. His bucket list? was just a list of buckets he wants to own before he dies. And? That's uh still pretty exciting, I think. So, what are you going to order? At this point, anything. I'm starving. If only my vapid date would make up his mind. You can tell a lot about a person I have an by idea. what they order here. That's a good idea. You can find what their desire is pretty easily that way. Exactly. Honestly, I'd be surprised if his deepest desire isn't just a copy of himself that he can date. Aww. Besides, if all of his desires are below the belt, it'll show up as his dinner, and I'll definitely know he's a creep. Oh. Well, you got a problem with me? Wow. I'm flattered. Moved, actually. But kid, Aww. our love could never be. It could be. You're so underage and illegal. No, don't look at me like that with your lonely, beautiful, trash bin eyes. I am only so strong. Besides, what would Libman, your janitor, a.k.a. my ex-husband, do if he ever saw us together? No, it could never be. Maybe in another life. Or semester. A or simple semester. no would suffice. I'm sorry. Didn't mean to disturb you while you're trying to get laid. Scram, kid. I have real emotional needs. I'm not just looking for a plate of dicks. Or are you? Can I offer you? Nope, that didn't work at all. Nope, okay. I want to know what's up with this baby back here. So, allow me to stop you from asking her to prom before you start. She says no. But I want to know what, what's the deal with the baby. If I do, its mother might not take it back. 
Wait, what's this? It can spin, but I'm not gonna spin it without a reason. That's a waste of a spin. No, it's not. Spin it. Nah, it's one of those swinging doors, and I'll probably just get trampled by a waiter if I go in there. Oh. Hmm, okay, wait, hold on. There's gotta be... Ruin Beverly's date. Okay. So I, I need to talk to this dipshit. Hi, I'm Coop. Damn, you are one fine-looking specimen, if I do say so myself. This fucking guy. Looking good. His hair wow, is pretty on point, thanks. though. He's talking to himself, Coop, not you. So sexy. <laughs> I like how it's looking yeah. good, guy. The bone-in chicken taco, right, over here? It's like the making bacon pancakes thing. They just left the pan out. So what do you do for a living? Are you a janitor too? No, but I, I have one right here for him. Since the ladies melt under the floor whenever I'm around. <laughs> this guy. Um, okay. So what do you do? What don't I do? Actually, it's more like who do I do? Am I right? Or am I right? Am I right? Ugh. No. No, you're not. How's the food here anyway? All I know is everything is delicious because I'm what's on the menu tonight, and all the ladies want some of this four course meal. <laughs> this guy's such a prick. Wait, I don't understand. Are you talking about yourself? I'm just asking how the food tastes. Looking good guy doesn't swing that way, but you can buy him. That's his actual name. Of course, you'll have to get in line, baby, because all the ladies are picking up the tab for my drinks. <laughs> you might be the second poor, most sad dog. person I've ever met. The waiter told me the same thing. Guess that's just a fancy French word for attractive. <laughs> You're on fire tonight. Looking good. <laughs> Ooh. With a bat. I think isn't that like sodomy by instrumentation. Don't you ever crave something more than looks and shallow conversation? Oh my god, yes, I'm so lonely. I'm so goddamn lonely. <laughs> Did you know I dry humped myself the other day? Wait. Seriously, I humped a goddamn mirror because I'm so vain and lonely. A mirror! All I want Bonk. is somebody to hug Go to horny and jail. it's gonna be okay so I can fall asleep at night without crying. <laughs> Jeez, I, I'm sorry. I, di I didn't know you were hurting that bad inside. I, uh... <clears throat> Not as much as the ladies are hurting inside after a squirting from this guy. Looking good, yeah. <laughs> You're hopeless. Okay, so I need to figure out how to okay. ruin this. Uh, they hate to see me go, but they love to watch me leave. Looking good. Idea. I guess it doesn't hurt to try. No? no? Okay, how do I go about this? I wish that would work. Nope. Okay. I need to figure out how to do this. I forgot to ask something last time we spoke. No, we didn't. Shit. I'm sorry. Didn't scram, kid. How do I ruin the date? Can I talk to can I talk to him? Hi there. Welcome to our telepathy. In all fine establishments. That explains okay. your brain waves and serve you a dish from your deepest desires. I'd like to make an order. Oh, apologies, sir, but we don't serve friendship here. Ouch. I'm starving. Can I order something for my deepest desires? Oh, I'm very oh. sorry, sir. But we're in <laughs> a restaurant. We can't make you a hero here, sir. Oh. Only you can do such a thing. Sad. Uh, and by the looks of you, that's quite unlikely. What's wrong with the way I look? Not serving me is discrimination or racist or something, I bet. You're right. Apologies, sir, but we serve based on our customers' deepest desires. And I'm afraid we can't grow you a giant beard. Can't blame him. Is there anything Ow. your kitchen can serve me? There we go. Little sir, our kitchen is ill-equipped to prepare you a prom date. Attacks! Damn it! Attacks! Excuse me. Tiny monsieur. If you're applying to be busboy around here, I'm afraid we're not currently hiring children who can't even lift a baguette. Rude. I could totally lift a baguette. Would you care to put a wager on that, sir? I, uh, I'm above your silly trials. Besides, I lifted three dinner rolls just the other day. Grandma took my picture. True. Most impressive, sir. But don't touch the dishes. Hmm. Off I go. I have got to find a way to ruin this date. Can I talk to him? Sir, if you would be so kind as to, uh, fuck off, 
That would be most exquisite. Rude? Oh. Hey there, do you mind if I... I'm trying to enjoy my dinner, and I don't remember ordering you. <sighs> Sir, allow me to stop you from asking... I'm not gonna ask him to prom. Hey, I'm Coop, and I... Just leave me alone, kid. Damn it. Wait, can I take that piece of paper? Don't worry, baby. I'll pick up the ticket. Wait, idea. <laughs> idea, then. Nothing ruins a date faster than receiving the wrong order. Got him. when it's an order of penises. Order up. And here you are, sir. Your plate of dicks. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, looking good. Mmm. What? <laughs> that, that gross plate of, of dicks? <laughs> Hold on. No, I don't want to skip the video. Because he goes... Dicks. Delicious. <laughs> Why do you keep telling me to skip when video? I oh my god. dating a man who's constantly looking at himself in the mirror. I had oh no my god. idea he'd be so full of himself. And now this is what you order? I knew men only had <laughs> one thing on their mind. I just assumed it was their own. I hope you and your plate of dicks are happy. God, I made a mistake. Dating sucks. I might as well go back to what's comfortable instead of trying to find what makes me happy. I'm going back to my ex-husband! To a plate of dicks. Can I take this? Can I take this now? She's not gonna Feels eat it. To me. You are a vegan's worst night. That is literally a, it's a it's a it's a cup steak. Uh playing with that food might make me go blind. <laughs> oh my god. Dicks. Return to the janitor. Okay, I think we do that tomorrow, right? <laughs> oh, hey. He's literally right here. I, uh, ruined your wife's fancy date. You, you did? For me? <laughs> oh, but why? So you'd clean up the school. That place is so trashed I got my neck stuck in a plastic soda ring and almost died like one of those sea turtles. You're right, kid. I don't deserve people like you in my life. Aw. Does this mean we're friends? No, hold on. <laughs> Let's take it slow. Uh, this divorce is rough, and I'm in no place to make commitments yet. But I uh, appreciate everything you've done. Aw. Well, at least I got that chore complete. Wait. Oh, God, I'm filthy now. Great, I'm just dirty Thanks now. Dirty hug. Made all this effort totally worth it. Great. Now I'm covered in dirt and tears. Now I'm just covered in dirty coop stuff. You got the clip? Nice. Sure is lonely being... Hey, it's that stupid kid everyone hates. What a loser. Rude? Is he supposed to be Luke Perry? So, what's it like wearing a chicken outfit all day long? Eh, beats being in high school. I legitimately can't argue with that. Get it. Enter the giveaway. Enter the giveaway. What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Enter the giveaway. You're taking too long. Enter. En enter. So how's the chicken here anyway? Couldn't say. We don't serve chicken here. We only serve chicken. What is? Uh, what's the difference? To Good. legally call your food chicken, it needs to actually contain chicken in it. We can't make that claim. So legally, the workaround is to call it chicken instead. Okay, so what's in it then? Herbs, spices, I got and you. a shitload of factory chemicals to create a chicken-like substitute. A strike? So you like won't get a, a, a strike for what? Faux chicken? No, there's definitely lots of animal parts mixed in with those chemicals. We just don't know what animals. All we know is that none of them I got are you. I got you. <laughs> I feel like I'm going down a very disturbing rabbit hole here. But rabbit's part of the chick or part of the meal. Actually, Rabbit could be one of those animals in our chick end product. It's a mystery turducken chemical in food product. This sounds delicious. People getting strikes for sending clips on streams? Not gonna happen on mine. All right, 
We got a we, we got an ASMR, a beard ASMR incoming. Beard ASMR incoming. If you do not like ASMR, now is your chance to just like like uh, go ahead and like take it take a second to to mute your headphones or whatever. So get ready, get ready, get ready. Damn it! I was gonna watch that Wingles. <laughs> you fucker. <laughs> How'd you like how'd you like that throat sound coming through the microphone? I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. Oh hi! Hi. Uh don't worry about it. You could just pr pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> no, so like I went like this and just went. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that was uh I I I, I, I really curious how that I never watched those back, but I do want to watch this back. We're gonna go uh, hold on, we're gonna we're gonna go. Open this. Display capture. So, your plate of tea. <laughs> so, your plate of tea. <laughs> Dicks. Whoosh. Do you guys sell Enjoy. Types of food? Funny you mention it, because we've just unveiled our new Mother Cluckin slurry surprise. What's that? You what it's now? It's a byproduct of our chick and chemical process, and then we serve it piping hot in a cup with an extra thick straw. An extra thick straw? That's an odd thing to mention. Well, it's still quite chunky. We're not sure why, but even though we heat it to 900 degrees for several days, some of the stuff in the slurry just doesn't break down. Rather than scoop it out, we just give it to our customers with an extra thick straw so they can suck up those chunky bits. You know, I think I'm gonna have to pass on the slurry surprise. Yeah, most people do. How long did it take Ew. you to get at sign twirling? About 10 years. Wow, I had no idea you sign spinners put so many hours into it. Yeah, it's a unique skill. A lost art, if you will. We twirlers have been honing our craft for ages, so businesses had best cough up some real cash if they want our expertise. Expertise. Oh yeah? What kind of cash? Minimum wage. Dare to dream. <laughs> Dare so to be stupid. What do to score a costume like that? Normally, you'd need to become a full-time employee here, but if you'd be willing to help me out, I can score one for you. What you got, dude? I guess that depends on the favor. Well, I just got a delivery order, and that's great. But research has shown that every time I step away to make a delivery, instead of standing here doing my sign twirling routine, we lose customers. Makes sense. It does. So I need you to deliver this mother cluck and chicken order and have the customer sign the credit card receipt. That's it? Yep. Just bring that signed receipt back to me, and I'll get you a mother clucking costume. Do we have a deal? Sure. I can swing that. Great. Here's the chicken and Let's the go. credit card receipt. Just Let's take do it this. to the pink house located on Knothole Street. Knock on the door, make sure they sign that receipt, then bring it back to me. Okay. Got good luck. Knothole Street's where I live, so... Let's go. I need to talk to you, though. I'm curious. Lemonade? Can't stand it. You motherfucker. Hello. Let me stop you right there and leave. Hold on. Why do I know that name? I feel like I'm knowing these names. Whatever, let's go to Not Whole Street. Yes, lemonade type drinks. Wait. Oh, resume. Resume. There we go. Uh yes? Dr. Scoops, got anything good for a hot day like this? And how? Step up to the cone zone. The cone I zone. Get you a scoop of our delicious ice poutine, or perhaps I could prescribe you a dose of our blumpkin spice. What do you say, Mr. Coop? You can call me Coop. Coop? <laughs> that rhymes with scoop. I think we're gonna get along just fine, Mr. Coop. Cool. Does that mean we're friends? I'm friends with every paying customer. So what'll it be? I don't have money. I'm not really feeling those flavors. Well, there's plenty more where they came from. Blumpkin Spice? Always scoop something up. We've got a special on sour green road apple. Care for a scoop, Coop? Not my first choice of flavors. 
brain wrapped milkshake? Hell yeah, dude. Okay, let's see. Okay, we went, uh, yeah, this is where we go. Okay. We gotta get back to Knothole Street. Oh, wait, I don't live on Knothole Street. I have to go down Knothole. No, yeah, I do. It said the pink house, right? Is that what he said? Get away, get away, bullies. Mother Cluck and Master. Okay, yeah, the, the pink house. We are on Knothole Street. Get away from me. Don't touch me. But where's the, where's the pink house? This guy? This guy's who's getting the... Gross. Hey there. Are you the one who ordered the mother clucking chicken? I am not surprised. You know, yes, I am. What took you so mother clucking long? Sorry, I'm new to this mother clucking delivery <laughs> stuff. Anyway, I have your mother clucking chicken order right here. And just need you to sign this receipt. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Slow down there. I don't just provide my signature to any stranger off the street, you know. Lots of identity theft going on in the world these days. But I'm just a kid. And you said you ordered this. And that's how them identity thieves get you. They lure you in with a false sense of security. In this case, a harmless, quivering, lonely-looking teenager. Why you gotta be hey, so rude? That's rude. Point is, we're gonna have to work some things out before I go signing any so-called credit card slip of yours. So, tell me. Which came first, the chicken or the egg? The egg. Uh, the egg, right? I know why, too. Ah, he thinks the egg came first. You gotta be shitting me. Okay, genius. Then explain how the egg came into existence if a chicken didn't lay it first. I could, if it gives me the option. I don't really like that answer. Uh, if anybody um, really wants to know, I'll let you know. Existence or something. Ah, the classic God debate. My human brain can't understand the science behind everything, so I'll make up a story about mythical beings in the clouds creating things and call it a day. Fine, I'll play your game, kid. Tell me, if God created it, then who created God? I think God created God, because only a God could do such a thing, right? Your argument is falling apart, kid. Even if there was a god, at some point in time, there had to be nothing. No planets, no space, no gods, nothing. Absolutely nothing. With that in mind, how did any of that stuff come to be? And furthermore, how did it all lead to the chicken or the egg? Okay, so here's how here's how the egg came first. Uh, Neil deGrasse Tyson actually explained this, and I just rolled along with it. So, over, over time... Animals have changed, right? They've, they've, uh, Shazzy did it. Shazzy already did it. I was going to, he, yeah, exactly. So, so they were laying eggs and it gradually evolved into a chicken. So therefore something that was not a chicken laid an egg that hatched into a chicken through evolution. So therefore the egg came first. You know, the grass Tyson told me that once. This is insane. How the fuck am I supposed to answer that? Beep. Wrong answer. Come back to me when you figure things out, moron. God damn it. I love that his answer is usually, God damn it. Oh. Um, the chicken, right? Ha! He thinks the chicken came first. You gotta be shitting me. Okay, genius. Then explain how the chicken came into existence if it didn't hatch from an egg first. Uh, I really don't know. Can you please just sign this so I can be on the my waffle page? or the waffle iron? Oh, I, I would, I would assume the wa assume the waffle iron. Well, unless waffle unless waffles were created without actual waffle irons, and then the waffle iron was created to streamline the process of creating a waffle. I would have to look and see the creation of the waffle iron, waffle iron, the chicken or the tendies. You, this fucking guy, I'm about to just, get, don't I have a pin? I don't have a pin. I was going to, here, eat this food. Here, we're going to go to the egg. Uh, We'll do it this way. And then we'll go. Come on. Wrong answer. God damn it. Is there, do I have a book? Is there a way for um, me to? Uh, uh, 
Oh, nope. We're I'm about to fucking punch him is what I'm going to do. Um Um Okay. I think God created your argument is Look, I don't pretend to comprehend all the ins and outs of the universe. For Christ's sakes, I'm just a kid trying to survive high school. Maybe some crazy sciencey stuff happened, like a Big Bang or a black hole imploded on itself, or some super god magically came into existence and started creating all this stuff. Listen to yourself. Big Bangs? Black holes? Are you kidding me? You're tying your logic into a Gordian knot, kid. It's a simple question, so just give me a simple answer. How did the entire universe come into existence? Ultra Mega Chicken? Or hatched from some Ultra Mega Egg? I don't know. Maybe it was laid by some kind of Ultra Mega Chicken. Holy shit! Eureka! I think you figured it all out! This is it! This is the answer to our existence! You've done it, kid! You cracked the code! You've cracked the egg! You've unlocked the mysteries of the universe! Uh, I did? Yes! This is huge! I'm gonna write a book all about it! Hope you don't mind if I take all the credit. Maybe I'll mention you in the special thanks section. What was your name again? Oh, it's Coop. Actually, never mind. Can't talk forever about nonsense with a delivery boy. Who the hell has time for that? Here, take the signed credit card receipt and get out of here. I've got some mother clucking chicken to eat and a mother clucking book to write. According to that logic, you're right. It's ridiculously complicated. And no tip? Someone ought to ultra mega egg his Oh, I will. I will ultra mega egg his house, little fucker. Okay. What about what like what's up with the with the, the popular kids outside the house? Oh. Well, 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 look who it is. Put me down! Leave me alone! Uh, at least he brought us some pizza. Oh, pizza? Come on, guys, that's my lunch! And dinner! Relax, Pipsqueak. We saved you some. Oh my god, can we kill that kid? Yeah, bitch. Today's top story, you fuckers are douchebags. Hey, these claims are unsubstantiated! Don't you have anything better to do than push around Coop? Oh, bite it, Sawyer! Just get out of the way so I can kick the shit out of this shrimp! Kick the shit out of him, huh? You mean like the time you kicked the shit out of your pant leg, Chet? Uh... You did what? Babe, babe, no, I was sick You're and... fucking gross! Oh my god! He shit himself. Shower? It was just a little oh, nugget! Don't oh, touch babe, me. don't be like that! Well... That was gross. Anyway, my lovely Sawyer, now that we're alone... Uh, hey, third party, right in front of you. Shut the fuck up, Smegma Breath. Oh! Now that we're alone... That's a new one. Ask, That's a new one. Do you have a date for prom? I'd like a girl who has dirt on everyone. That chance, Kent. I'll be at prom, but strictly as a reporter. I can see the headline already. Kent, not awarded prom king cries for 72 hours straight and dies a dehydrated husk. I like that idea. That's what you think. The school isn't letting anyone go stag. Damn it! No stag attendees? What is this? Some kind of breeding camp? You can you can go with me. Face it, Sawyer. The only way into the dance is to give in to your desires. Take my hand and say yes. Will you be my prom queen? Special appearance by Wingles. Actually, I'm going with Coop. Coop? You fucking serious? Uh, me? Got really? him. <laughs> oh, I get it. You're playing hard to get to entice the... Uh, meow. Looks like this cat has claws. Look. Oh, shit. I clicked through that. I'll pick out a nice slow Look. song for us to dance close Over here. to when you go with me to prom. Because if you go with Coop, I'd have to kill him. Yeah, best of luck, <laughs> bitch. Wait, he stole my fucking bike. He stole her bike. Wasn't that your bike? Oh, yeah. Shit. How'd you know I didn't have a date? Um, call it a hunch. I didn't even know you liked me. Aw, of course I like you, little buddy. You're my favorite neighbor. And anyway, did you see how pissed off Kent was? That was awesome. Yeah, she got, <laughs> she got him yeah. fucked. Bitch. He's murder me. Don't worry about that snooty prick. You gotta stick up for yourself, Coop. They won't pick on you if you fight back. True. You think? 
Cause last week I tweeted, Kent can sometimes be impolite, and he responded by swatting my house. Uh. Oh, I heard about that. Sorry about your dog. I miss Scooter. Yeah, well, you're on your own tomorrow, pal. I'm gone all day on a field trip. Stay strong, brother. Fight the power. Later, Coop. Cool, yeah. Damn the man, and so on. And so on. I am so screwed. Wait, no, we have that permission slip, though. I didn't mean to double click the house. Shit. Ah, cool. Grandma. You're home. Hi, Grandma. Hey, Graham. You sure are full of life today. I've had such a wonderful day. I got some groceries, finished my Kegel exercises, and guess what? Your grandma has a date this week. Ooh, Granny gonna get some dick. <sighs> That's great, Grandma. My, my, my. You sure are devoid of life today. Tough day at school again? <sighs> yeah. Was it those bullies? Your old grandma can roll up her sleeves and knock some heads together. Please don't. Last time you helped, you only made it worse. Now they just say, better call your grandma to come save you, pussy, while they punch me even harder. What? Are you ashamed of your old grandma? Not at all, Grams. No, Graham, it's just... <sighs> Have you ever heard the phrase adding insult to injury? Oh, sure. I've heard lots of phrases. Like, no matter how flat you make a pancake, it always has two sides. Yeah, but... Oh, oh, or you can't turn a hoe into a housewife. <laughs> Your grandma is... Can't up. make a wife out of a hoe. Oh. <sighs> Boy, I'll say. Oh, I'm sorry you had a bad day. You know, you'll always be my little Cooper hero. Aww. Thanks, Graham. Cheer up, Coop. I know you like helping people, so why don't you help me out? When you're ready, I have a couple of things that only a superhero like yourself could do. Sure, Grandma. I'll... Oh, oh, I'm just going upstairs? Okay. Free time at last. Now I can look, touch, and talk to all my cool stuff. Well, until I'm ready to go help out Grandma with whatever she needs, that is. Okay, grab the pin. Right? Grab a pin. It's a pen. Perfect for forging signatures. I like it. I'd be talking to myself anyway, like I am right now. Oh. Sawyer, are you there? Am I safe to go outside? Hello? Oh. I can't just fake Grandma's signature standing here. I'm gonna need a copy of her signature along with something to trace it on. Okay, I'm sure I can figure something out. What is this? I, uh, don't wanna touch those, uh, crunchy socks. Please don't ask why. Hey. I'd love to stay in bed all day, but I have a lot of looking, talk talking and touching to do. Oh, book report? I don't wanna do homework. Oh, well, you know what, me neither. Let's go. Hey. Oh. We need to find something with Grandma's signature on it. So we can forge it. There's nothing in here, maybe? Wait, maybe? I don't think there's a product in here that's gonna fast forward me through the unsightly horror. True. I'm no Mr. Fix-It, so it's gonna have to remain leaky. Same reason why I can't use the shower. Which sucks, because you're filthy. I could change, change your clothes, probably, but still. Oh! Oh, Granny. I'd prefer to respect Grandma's privacy in this case. My it's mouth a is dick. Full. Ew. No way. I have enough nightmares about what Grandma does in the bedroom as it is. No need to see what kinky crap she keeps in the closet. Some. Yeah, let's not. Let's go. Wait, what's this way? No way. Last time I opened that door, a spider sack burst open with a million tiny spiderlings. They've clearly conquered that territory, so I'll let them keep it. Fair. Can we... Damn it! I'm too short to reach the string. I gotta find something to hook it with if I'm ever gonna get up into the attic. Let's see. Do I have anything? Do I have anything? I don't really have anything. Okay, I will... Swing and a miss. Oh, uh, worth a shot. Okay, let's head back downstairs. I'm gonna find... I'm gonna find that, uh... It's something to... Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. The kitchen. Old people keep shit in the kitchen, like bills and stuff, right? No, I apparently don't know anything about old people yet. 
Hey, what are you, saran wrap? Oh, it's a fruity roll. And useful. We're just gonna, we're just gonna no leave that open. Do. It's been frozen shut for years. Pretty sure it's just pure ice now. That's fair. Can we, can we shut this though? No. Okay. We'll leave that open. I don't care. I don't give it. I don't. I don't do care. I could go on my computer. You could. We could go into <gasps> fishy. Glurp is overfed as it is. Grandma constantly dumps her leftovers in there. Oh, you probably could. You probably could. That's a fair point. Let's go out the back door. See what's back here. No thanks. I'm not doing that. Oh, go up here. What's up here? Are you crazy? I'm not gonna pick up that nest with my bare hand. I hope nobody saw me try that. You're fine. Nope. I've seen grim. <laughs> seen gremlins. That's fair. That's fair. Ah. The late Let's see y'all. I wonder what I can even do with this. No way! Those wasps are way too hostile. They'll sting me so hard I'll die to death. How do beekeepers get their bees to chill the fuck out? Weed. Wait, can I take these nails? These hastily hammered nails might be the only thing holding this roof together. Can't reach it, don't want it, forget about it. <laughs> he, he's just like, fuck this shit, I'm out. No thanks. Uh can I take some can I take some uh Ted Bear. If I need, like, or want to bother with gardening. If I need to turn on the waterworks, I'll just think about how my parents abandoned me. No, 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 don't go up there. Hey, there are ants. I could totally climb this pole, but I left my climbing shoes at the shoe store where I never bought them in the first place. Fair. It's Ted Bear. I used to love the Ted Bear video. Let's go get on the computer. Let's see what's on the computer. And gave it another annoying virus. It Shit. Plenty of paper and the ink cartridges look fine. I wonder what's wrong with it. Probably something up there. I should probably just see where the cable leads to rather than yank it out. I don't know. Yanking it out usually seems to be a pretty good. Uh. Oh wait, matches. Cool. I like matches. matches. Now all I gotta do is find something to light on fire. Preferably not the house. Maybe the beehive. Gross. They're covered in dust. Gross, indeed. What's this way? <sighs> My backwards hat is supposed to give a I'm too cool to play with toys vibe, even if it's not working very well. Oh, can I take this hat though? Can I take this one? And get dust all over my cool No 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 the just the hat. Hat buddy, it's the yeah. new Wait, what's this? I mean, touching it would make sense if I wanted to trace my hand to make a hand turkey. So, okay. do I push your buttons? Call me. I see what to do here. Okay. Mega Mom. Okay. So. They're not addressed to me, so why would I want them? Because they may have your grandma's signature on them. Maybe. And then I could trace it using that thing. Wait, can I, can I do something with the music? Eek. Yeah, I probably don't touch it the hard way that I shouldn't touch those. Fair. All right, let's go upstairs. I should probably just see where the cable... Oh, I can't... Wait, I can't get in... Oh, it's in the attic. Okay. I meant to do that. Nope. Uh... At least it was fun to try. No? What about... Can I burn the... Can I, can I burn this he motherfucker shoots. down? No? Okay. I, I think I may be able to use the matches on the uh, on I the beehive. Turn this on. I, I could be wrong, but I think the beehive might be the move. Because I don't think I have anything in here that I prefer to keep them here where they're safe. That she signed. Do do I? Okay, no, I'm not seeing anything in here. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go fuck with the beehive. Or maybe I can just talk I to Grandma. Oh, don't, yeah, don't touch Grandma. Talk to Grandma. Hey there, Coop. I completed my senior power workout routine. Good. Uh, great. Long as I don't have to hear you having loud sex in the house again. My, uh, hearing aid ran out of batteries. I thought I was being quiet last time. Gross. I'm gonna go now. 
Hold on, mister. Your grandmother needs some help before you go. Uh. You need help? I hope it's not what I think it is. Oh, no. I already, I already tried to pick him up, and it told me I wasn't going to pick up the crusty socks. Excuse me? I told you already, Grandma. I'm done helping you cheat at bingo. Coop, it's not about that. We took a lot of prizes from a lot of innocent people, Grandma. I told you I was out of the game, and I'm staying out. The only people we hurt were the fat cats at Big Bingo, damn it! Anyway, <laughs> that isn't what I need help with. I have some chores for you. Oh, sorry. Although, I wonder if she has a grabber. Giving out iPads now. I'll split the profit 60 40 your way. I said no, Grandma. Fine. Wimp. <laughs> she is a hustler, dude. Here's an idea. How about we soundproof the walls? I guess I'd consider getting some soundproofing for the bedroom walls. Hi, Kim. How you doing? Those late night visits you have with Bernie are scarring me for life. Hey! Those thin walls go both ways, Buster. I'm sick of you bringing down the mood with your constant sobbing. Yeah, uh, it might be best if I meet that future. I'm doing person. good. Wait, did you pick up any good snacks? Did you pick up any good snacks? I sure did. All the prune swirl you can handle. Gross. Huh. That doesn't really suit my needs as a radical teenager. I gotta have something on the go, preferably extreme. I also got some fruity roll-ups. Yeah, I already got that. I like it. Just try not to eat them all. I'm planning on fashioning them into an edible thong. And I've lost my appetite. <laughs> Puritan. Why was that so much louder than everything else? Welcome in, Kim! Grandma. There's something wrong with the printer. I pressed print over and over, but I can't seem to get it to work. It's probably just out of ink. I'll take a look at it for you. There's my little superhero. Come find me when you get it working, as I'll need your help with one more thing. Okay. Oh, come on. Two chores. What about my active social life? You don't have one. Come on, Coop. Don't bullshit a bullshitter. <laughs> Fair enough. I better get started. Okay. Thanks, honey. By the way, Bernie's coming by at nine tonight, so don't come around unless you're into hearing your grandmother reach a new plane of sexual nirvana. One second. My brain is <laughs> this conversation from my memory and blocked out. What do you need, Grandma? Fix the printer. Got it. Thanks for helping, my little pile of coop. Really though? Okay. I gotta run. I gotta, okay, let's see. I gotta do, locate the problem with print, with grandma's printer. Okay, so we already know the issue is this cable. It has plenty of paper. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at a hint. Whoever installed that long cable was a few fruits short of a smoothie. So we did that. I mean, that's what we tried to do, right? Was use the, maybe it wouldn't let me do it until I talked to her or something. I think that's gonna work unless unless I have to like cut this up or something uh let's just pretend that okay outlook not so hmm you think on the cable instead of on the actual thing maybe oh oh on the cable once we get up there to fix it I, I see what you mean just see where the cable leaves Okay, so we need to see if we can find a grabber. We need, we need to try to find maybe or. Thanks, but I prefer my side tables with a side of ramp. Not the table. Not the table. I don't have any back problems yet. Come on, let's go. And. Look at me opening the attic door. I'm a big boy now. You're a big boy now, Coop. Okay, mousetrap. Ouch! My fucking fingers! Warning! These fireworks release an absurd amount of smoke. Fireworks may cause mild entertainment and or cancer. For outdoor use only. Suitable for ages 7 and under. Discard after October 1956. Jeez, these sound fun. So, now the goal is to, uh... Will this work? Will this work? I can't believe that worked. 
It worked. Well, it's a temporary yep. fix to the the smoky of the be the smoky beehive on the uh, or the smoky fireworks in the beehive. Can I take the spider web? No way! Haven't you ever seen arachnophobia oh. before? Big Bob could be in here. Big Bob can eat a dick. Um, can I take these dolls? These in the attic? Too creepy for me. Look how derpy that horse's eyes are, though. Wait, what is this? It has my name on it. I'm a baby anymore. I'm a big boy. Okay, okay, my bad guy. My bad, my guy. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, Grandma. Wait, call now. Okay. I got your printer working, Grandma. Atta boy. Now for my gardening problem. Oh. You need me to water your flowers? It's swarming with wasps. I need there it is. To okay. Get rid of their nest on the roof. I got this. Don't worry about it. I already. I I got this. Let's. We got this. We're gonna. We're just gonna head up there and get this one done. That way, Grandma can get that dick. Maybe all the people who said. Oh. Wait. Swing in a minute. So it's not. Nope, didn't work. Huh. Wait a second. Smoke out wasps to make them more docile. Survey says. Wait. Rats, no duck. What's happening here? Mm, wrong. Did I do something wrong here? Smoke out wasps to make them more docile. Shouldn't be done with. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, it's a, it's a combination thing. It's a combination thing. Swing and a miss. No way. Those wasps are way too. Wait. That didn't work. But if how the? What am I doing wrong? Hold on. Let's read this whole thing. Matches against wasps are a game of wit. Some work shouldn't be done with bare hands, especially if it's fire work. Hey, sir, I know you too. How you doing, boo boo? Maybe I should try being smart. Maybe I, I could. But none of these were to together. Can I just. Maybe I should try being. No. Can I put these on the ground? At least it was fun to try. What if we mix. There's got to be a. Hmm. Coop loses. Well, I mean, I have the, I have these, the fireworks. But I feel like I'm missing something. But what? But what? Lady just got the all clear. F and A, Cotton. Good. Oh. There we go. Got it. We figured it out. Yes! Breathe in the smoke, my waspy little friends. Sleep! Sleep forever! Wow, I could be a supervillain. You could, if you weren't such a wiener. There we go. Do I get to keep the wasp nest and, like, use it on bullies? Because that'd be pretty awesome. Now we can go over here and do this. Shit. Okay. Get away! No! The wasps! I'm standing here and swatted them! That'll surely work! Oh god! It hurts so bad! It hurts so bad! Make it stop! I can't see without my glasses! Ah! I wanted to be an acrobat! An acrobat! Sorry, sir! It was an accident! Well, at least I got rid of the nest. Guess I'll let Grandma know. Whoops. Might leave out what happened to the neighbor. Big whoops. But it's not my problem. All right, come on, Grandma. I got your chores done. Let's go. How often? No, don't touch Grandma. I'll talk to her. Damn it. I'm getting finger happy. I hope you kept that thumb of yours green, because your garden is now 100% wasp free. That's wonderful news! Time to prep and plant some petunia pals! Great! So I'm free to obsessively look, touch, and talk at the rest of the town now? You sure are! Right after you deliver these photos I printed. 
Ah, oh, man. Okay, fine. To Thanks, who? Cooper. Just stop by the Golden Haze Retirement Home and leave them with Bernie for personal use. Personal use? Gross. Bernie's easy to spot. Just look for a ravenous sexual stallion and a bulge you can't take your eyes off of. <laughs> oh. <laughs> say no more, Grandma. For the love of God, say no more. Say no more. Have a good day, dearie. Don't kiss me. Don't kiss me with that mouth. Okay. Guess I gotta head over to the Golden Haze Retirement Home. Granny, now. stop. It's the saddest place in town. The first being my heart. Oh. <laughs> That didn't work, but... Oh, sorry. I was wanting to look... Disco Dick would love this game. You goddamn right, Disco Dick would love this game. <laughs> okay. I also still... Now that I'm back out here, I can actually go and finish my deal with the... Uh, what is it? The... Um... Shit, I don't have any change to get rid of that guy. He needs spare change. But I can go give the mother cluck and chicken guy the receipt. Boom. Okay, that's mother clucking great. Okay, a deal's a deal. Here's your new mother clucking chicken costume. Wear it with pride. I'm not sure that's possible, but thanks. Delivering food to that weirdo in order to get this chicken costume was totally worth it. Okay, I may need to reevaluate my life decisions at some point. You're doing great, kid. Wait, haven't I already talked to this guy somewhere else, though? Shit. Salutations there, good. Uh, I'm not legally allowed to be this close to children. Is this Bernie? No, that's Mo. I forgot to ask some Back for more marvelous feats of flexibility, are ya? I don't have any spare change yet. Right? Maybe all the people who said I suck were right. Oh. I was worth a shot. All right, we got to get some money. Rhino, so hey. I'm trying to find my How you doing? I don't Welcome care. in, friend. Okay. Hi. Welcome in, buddy. How are you doing today? Would you mind telling me? Just leave me alone, kid. Okay, we got to go find we got to go find money. Oh, the bank. Let's go rob a bank. For this guy. We can rob this guy. Nice day out here, isn't it? How the hell should I know? I'm blind, you little shit. No, I meant the day's still young, right? Warm, sunny weather and all. I haven't seen the sun since I was a boy. So, thanks for bringing up that painful memory. So, how did you go blind, if you don't mind me asking? I went blind the same way all people go blind. Which is? Masturbating. What? That's a real thing? I thought it was an urban legend. Well, it was pretty legendary. It all started <laughs> when I accidentally <laughs> shot one right into my eyes. The sperm impregnated my eyeballs, and they exploded when I carried my pregnant eyes to full term. This is officially my least favorite conversation of the day. Day ain't over yet, kid. He's got a point. He's That's got a nice point. Dog. What's his name? Dog? This thing's a dog? The guy who sold it to me said it was an ostrich. Bastard ripped me off. Holy crap! That's so mean! How could he take advantage of you like that? People are the worst, I swear. If I had the power, I'd wipe... <laughs> I was joking, you idiot. You really think all us blind folk are that helpless and gullible? No, but I'm starting... <laughs> because it hasn't plan. come out yet. It doesn't come out Sounds until tomorrow. Funny. That's how. But can you can still enter dog? to win a free copy. Oh, my dog. Right here. Too? Uh, no. Then why would I ever let you borrow old Duke? Uh, because some bullies swatted my house recently and the SWAT team accidentally shot my dog. Why in the hell would I let you borrow my dog if you can't even keep your own dog alive? Ouch. Harsh, but fair. Yeah. <laughs> Is there anything I can do to help? Sure. You can give me a sensual massage or an erotic lap dance. Uh, I was thinking of something less creepy, degrading, and frankly, less illegal. Look, kid, it's been a while since I've been able to get some stimulation happening in my root chakra, if you know what I mean. If you're not gonna do it, find me a massage, or a magazine, or something. I'll keep my eyes open, er, I'll see what I can do. Wait, <laughs> what's he gonna do with a magazine? See? You'll see me later, you asshole. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to... <laughs> Got you again, moron. Just walk away. It's braille. That's what it is. It's braille porn. Hey, mailman. I got a package you can deliver. 
Why, of course, son. Just stamp it, address it, and drop it in the mailbox. That's what us male folk do. Ah, I guess that joke was too subtle for him. Why do dogs hate you? Maybe it's because I run a dog fighting ring out of my house and they can smell the inhumanity. What? Can I have a free stamp? No way, kid. Giving you a stamp for free is a federal offense. Is it... I don't want to risk losing my job. Is it though? I love my job almost as much as I hate dogs. Oh. Well, I gotta go. Have fun destroying people's mail. Ruining the mail of others is one of the greatest perks of this job. Touche. Yeah, he's actually reading somebody's mail right now. Come out with your hands up, Mc... Yeah! You'll never take me alive, copper! I just received a... Wait. Oh, wait. It's just a... It's just a beanie. Darn. I'll take it. Still have the dick on my face. We're gonna run with it. Oh, I can't really go that way. Okay, so I need to figure out how to get some spare change to get this dude out of my way so that way I can... Uh, I can give these nudes to... What's-his-face? Is there any clown that isn't crying on the inside? A sad clown onesie? Uh, thank you. Put it on now. Oh. Yes. Lemonade stand? How quaintly Americana. That's the heart of our business down here at Lemonade's lemon-flavored lemon-type drinks. We serve the finest sweet and country-style lemon-type drink plucked right from my parents' own lemon tree, God bless them. We pride ourselves on customer satisfaction here. <laughs> lemon that's why when you drink Lemonade's lemon-flavored lemon-type drinks, you'll say, damn, that's pretty close to lemonade. Who's we? Well, just me, unless you want a job. You're hired, but I can only pay you in lemons. Also, I'm out of lemons. Uh, no thanks. Damn it. Uh... How much for a glass? Each glass of Lemon Abe's lemon-flavored lemon-type drink is tailored specifically to the wealth of our customers. You, sir, strike me as an upper-crust type. How about I pour you one in our exclusive diamond-encrusted Abe chalice complete with a Bluetooth stereo and leather carrying case. At only $79.95, you can't afford to miss out. I okay. uh, don't think I can afford that. Ah, so you're a middle class man then. You'll love our jumbo size. It comes with a limited edition. I don't think I'm that either. Lemonade style drink crazy straw. It's shaped like me, Lemonade, and for only $12. What a steal. Look, I don't have very much money. What can I get for a nickel? A nickel? Are you serious? All right, for a nickel, I'll throw a drink in your face and hopefully you'll taste some, but I have to spit in it first. <laughs> Do it. I'll pass. Oh. I guess beggars can be choosers. Wait. Okay, well. Sounds good. And remember, at Lemonade's. If I have a nickel. You, Cabe. We're always glad you, Cabe. Uh, what? Hold on. I have. If I have a nickel, why can't I give it to this guy? Uh. Oh, I have a box for him. I brought this for you. Oh, I appreciate it, but I don't eat gluten. Trying to keep my girlish figure for bikini season. I meant the box. It's empty. I thought maybe you could, like, use it as shelter. Oh, hell. Thanks, kid. I'll try it on right now. Wow. It's a lot roomier from the inside. And these grease stains have kind of an art deco vibe. Now, a little cleaning up, and it'll be good as new. Thanks. I'll take it. You may proceed, citizen. I just helped a homeless man find some garbage to sleep in. I'm a hero. Okay, that was strange. Well, onward to something more normal. Delivering erotic photos of my grandma to some old dude in a retirement home. More normal indeed. All right, we got to find Bernie now. What do we got going on here? Uh, excuse me, ma'am. Can I get by? I'm almost there, young man. Uh... Hey there, is there any way you can speed her up a bit? Why did I find that photo album? Sure, no! Let me just strap <laughs> the jetpack onto her tiny arthritic frame so she can whiz around like a bottle rocket and be out of your way, my liege. Uh, That'd be good. Uh, hold on a second. Oh yeah, sign? What a... I touched the wet paint sign. I gained 10 wet points. That's not paint, that's cement, my guy. 
That's not gonna do anything. Turn down. Oh, it's kind of hot, dude. I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of hot. The way it. Oh, that's disgusting. But okay. Oh, there's a there's a walkway. Okay, I'm stupid. Just open your eyes, Rev. It's a loading entrance. Wait, what's all this? Prune swirl. Wait. Here goes nothing. Ugh, gross. I hate prunes. Oh. I'm already regretting this. Joking hazard. Yes, that's the one. All right. I got to go deliver some prune swirls to these diaper wearing fucks, so I'll catch you later. We've all been there. <laughs> Let's go find Bernie. It's crazy we've been playing this for as long. And the, the freak apocalypse hasn't even started yet. Ugh, covered in prune swirl sludge. Gross. I gotta wash this crap off somehow. It's locked. Guess I'll just have to exit through the front door. Uh. All I wanna do is. Whoa, no, no, no. There we go. Electronic wheelchair storage. Is that Jesus? Bernie Bear? Is that his... Is that... Nope. Oh. Excuse me, ma'am. What happens? Is that you, God? Uh, no. My name is Coop. Ha! So modest. Classic God. Um. Do you really think God would have a high-pitched voice? The Lord works in mysterious ways. Maybe, but I'm pretty sure God wouldn't sound like a kid. I cannot tell a lie, so I must confess that your voice is far more shrill and grating than I would have expected. You sound a bit like a squirrel in its dying moments. Hey! Ooh, that's just too much. Oh, I'm sorry, <laughs> Lord. Please forgive my earthly mortal ears for being unable to hear the beautiful music in your voice. Welcome me You're goddamn right. I leave this mortal coil, and we shall sing together in harmony while we dance through the heavens. That's not in my power. I'm just a kid. That's just what Jesus would say. Is it though? All right, hold on. Uh... Fine. Uh, I command thee to do my bidding. Yes, command me, my lord. Can I have five butts? You certainly can. Score. Hell yeah. Be sure to bring it to church this Sunday. Oh, no, that's not what I meant. I wanted you to give it to me now, and... You know I never miss going to church, and when they pass the collection plate around, <laughs> I'll give you I was... all that I have, for I know I shan't be on this earth for much longer. Of course, I was going to give it to my grandchildren so that they could go to college, but you're commanding me to give it to you, so Whoops. I know that it's going to a higher purpose. No, please don't. I don't want the money. Just give it to your grandchildren. Look at you, testing my faith once again. God first, family second. The money is yours. This is horrible. I hate being God. <laughs> okay, lady, you just keep on praying. I have, uh, God stuff to do. Take care. By your grace. Uh, peace be with you and stuff. I wonder if and I could... also with you. I wonder if I can snatch that out her by hair. Looks of it, she's already been touched by the Lord. Oh. I, on the other hand, was touched by a priest once. <laughs> can I go in here? That's a cross I'd rather not. Oh nope. Okay. Let's just go ahead and exit out. Unless, can I steal a rosary? Hail Mary, full of grace. Please let me grant. Okay, no. I was hoping maybe I could I could snatch up one of them rosaries. What is this though? As much as I'd like to answer this prayer, I don't want Jesus to kick my ass for stealing his letter. Fair. That's fair. It feels just like other fake plants. I'm beginning to think they're all made in the same place. What is this? Hold on. Hold on. What? Wait, wait just a damn second. Hold on. We'll leave the music on for, for now. Let's, uh... Grand Dutious. Grand Dutious. What is you doing? Wait, at dead of night. Wait. At Dead of Night, is that the one that's like a, it's like an FMV style horror game in the hotel or whatever with like the, the comedian crazy guy? Is that, is that at Dead of Night? How is it? How are you enjoying that? Because I thought about getting it myself and I was kind of terrified. I thought I might shit my pants. 
which is fine. Don't get me wrong. I'll do it. I've done it before. But uh, welcome in, friends. We're uh, we're playing Side Night and Happiness as Freak Apocalypse as a, as a pre-launch release. Um, fun fact: we're doing a giveaway as well. He died at least. He oh did at least once. Oh yeah, I mean shit his pants, right? I mean I've seen trailers. And I'm like, uh, excuse me. But to all of you that have come along on this glorious raid from the Grand Dutius, the grandest of Dutiuses, uh, I would like to sit here and tell you a little bit about myself. My name's Rev. I'm an indie focused variety streamer, and I could sit here and tell you about all the things I do, but instead, I'm just going to go ahead and show you. So what are you <laughs> waiting for? YG's Dental Cream. Creaming in your mouth since 1939. Will he be all right? What? Oh. Okay. Okay. Cough on me, Daddy. Uh. Right. Well, check this out. Now with real bullets. Look at the size of those bullets. Bullets. I, I think I broke the game. Where you going, bitch? Thought you wanted some of this smoke. That's right. Oh, fucking. Now, now you all see. See the resemblance? Isn't he adorable? Isn't he the cutest? So thank you once again for that that lovely, lovely rate. Oh, the, yeah, the clown. That's a. Uh, that's me. <laughs> I haven't done it in a while. I haven't done it in a long time. Actually, I've probably gone the longest without a Zebo's Funhouse than I have in a long ass time. Uh, also, full disclosure to those who uh, who are entering the raffle, if you win, the Steam key will not be active till tomorrow as the game does not release until tomorrow. But uh, there's a strange old man with a switchblade pulled on me. Okay, he, oh wow, wow. You put the switchblade up right as I turned back. You Now I look like a liar. We're going to wait. There's a lot going on in here that's like really out of context. Boom. Look at him. Now, we're in a nursing home because we're going to deliver nudes of our grandma to some weird old man. And if this is him... Hi, um, Mr. Bernie? Listen, kid, I'm sure you've had it rough. Bernie but Shanks. You so small, you still got to use the training toilet and all. But that's no excuse for you to walk into my room covered in that shit. So you have two options. One, watch me demonstrate how quickly I can crush your skull with my bare hands. Dude, I'm enjoying the oh my god hell out of this game, Jeff Harper Games. Thank you for stopping by. So what's it gonna be, punk? Okay, do I really have a choice? Nope, I need to go wash this shit off of me, don't I? Wait, it smells like diarrhea in there. And I'm pretty sure this shower would make me even dirtier somehow. I'll find another water source to bathe in. You're not wrong. Yeah, I'm actually... Yeah, I've been really, really enjoying it. I, uh... The, the humor? Pinpoint. The hu oh, my God. The humor has been pinpoint accurate with, uh... With Side Night and Happiness's kind of, like, uh... Brand. And I've been reading Side Night and Happiness since I was, like, a, literally, like, a, a kid. <laughs> Which... Damn. You know? Oh, oh um... Wait. Pause. Um... Are you okay? Can I touch him? There you go. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> Out of my way, young man. We've got a dire emergency here. Sir? Sir, can you hear me? Can you raise your arms for me? Both of them. Just raise them up for me. Come on, sir. I'm going to need you to cooperate with me. Can you smell toast, sir? Do you have any allergies to nitroglycerin? Okay, have you been this way for more than four hours? Hello? Get it, because he's stiff. Blink six times if you can hear me. 
sir, you need to respond to my questions or we're going to be here all day long. Now I'm going to ask you again. Can you raise your arms for me? <sighs> I'm pretty sure he's dead, lady. Excuse me. Welcome to Golden Haze. How can I help you? <laughs> Looking for my grandma's friend, Bernie. Old guy, lives here, currently going through a sexual awakening. Do you know where I can find him? I sure can. Bernie lives right here. Oh yeah, Golden yeah, I've, I've, already, I've already found Bernie. I was hoping you'd be a little more specific. Of course. You can find him in the interior of the building. Great. Huge help. Wait a second. Oh, okay. Okay, it's locked. I was like, can I be a cheating bitch? No, I can't be a cheating bitch. The nurse station. Coffee. Where's the bathroom? There's a B in the floor. Fair. Yeah, dude. F f fucking assholes. Oh shit! I'm back. I I I've come full circle. Literally. I need to find the bathroom. I got you, bitch. Okay, electronic wheelchair storage. Maybe one of these had a bathroom in it. Maybe if I go in here, maybe old uh, old Blair has a has a bathroom I can use. Toilet rules. Can I go I in? Touch the toilet rules sign or the toilet for that matter. Son of a bitch. Wait, what do we got going on here though? Can I steal your money? I'm not gonna steal this birthday card money. Think of the children. I did, and I still want to steal it. Uh -oh. You're not my son. Get out of here. Anyway. Oh yeah. When I was your age, we didn't have any fancy video game nonsense. Oh no. We didn't need any Nintendo's or Xbox bull honky. If you wanted to stop a Goomba, you'd have to do it the old-fashioned way. By going to the Italian deli and slapping the cannoli out of their hands. <laughs> and then just walk back and forth like some meandering pile of dog shit. Those Goombas would put up a fight. My old man and I would speedrun all the Goombas out of town with our keyblades. Which of course were old mail keys we had fashioned into knives. A nice formal shirt and tie for me oh, to hey. win. Nothing is getting me down. At least I get. At least I get that. I got that going for me. Wait, where? What about this way? What? Okay, this took me back here. I know. I, I I'm pretty sure my current chore is clean off the prune swirl mess. Just be sure to wash up when you're finished. Of course. Okay. So I need to find a place that I can I can conceivably wash up. Wait. I want to talk to you. I'm not going to miss out on the opportunity to talk to people. Nice. It's a bucket of piss. Ah, oh, come on. I know it's not a luxury resort and all, but it's certainly not as bad as an actual bucket of piss. Oh. Dicks. Do me a favor, Sonny. Inhale deeply for me. Why? Just do it. Don't. Uh, okay. Don't. <laughs> so. Yeah. What did you say? What, what you get. <laughs> uh, you're in. Ha! See? I rest my case. P.S. Well, I'm sure there are some good things about this place. Oh, sure. I can look on the bright side. At least it's not the Mooch Emporium. That's fair. Can you explain where that urine smell is coming from? You mean other than from my own bloomers? That's already more than I needed to know. <laughs> How often does your family come to see you? Family? I outlived all those bastards. Well, I guess that just means you lived a healthy lifestyle or had good genes. Nope. I was born with leprosy, smoked four packs of unfiltered cigarettes a day, and I constantly administered vodka directly into my bloodstream with an IV drip bag. They were the healthy ones. Yeesh. She's a so, gangster, were they dude. A tragic accident or something? That's what the police report said, but uh me and my flamethrower know what really happened. You probably shouldn't be telling this to strangers. What's well, nobody's gonna believe me point? anyways. Are you shitting me, Sonny? What is get it? wrong with the mulch emporium? <laughs> shitting me? I don't get it. They just sell mulch and deliver it to your home, don't they? Some years ago, I specifically <gasps> ordered a sphagnum peat moss mulch for my Sphag garden from the mulch emporium. Did they the give you a smegma one? Me that they could not only deliver it, <laughs> Way but more they would spread it around while I was out of town to help my garden grow. Uh, okay. Sounds about right. 
Yeah, sounded great. Sounded fucking fantastic, eh, Sonny? Well, those dipshit twerps over at Mulch Emporium got my order mixed up, and they delivered a huge batch of rubber mulch. Okay. Rubber mulch. Tires! They delivered recycled tire rubber and spread it all over my entire property. Oh. That doesn't seem like something that would help a garden grow. Ding, ding, ding. We have a winner. Fuckers. The rubber mulch killed my garden. It killed every living thing. So did they come replace it and pay for the damages? Oh, sure. They offered to plant me a new garden and pay for my losses, but that doesn't cover all the work I put into my beloved garden. You can't pay for that loss of time. Actually, that's what lawsuits are for, and... Pretty hard to hit him with a lawsuit when you took a flamethrower to your entire property in a fit of rage. Sure, they couldn't prove that I started the fire, but they claimed that the fire is what caused my garden to die, and not their wretched <sighs> rubber tire mulch. I bet it stunk like sorry a motherfucker. Not as sorry as they're going to be. That sounds frighteningly ominous. What do you mean? I'm sending them a scathing letter in the mail. <gasps> a letter? You heard me. I the audacity. A letter explaining what a horrible company they are. That actually sounds like a perfectly pragmatic way of handling it. I think so too. I also go on to explain that they murdered my garden and they murdered my family because it's their fault I set fire to the house. No, don't. Okay. That sounds crazy and <laughs> damn it. Then I go on to explain how I'm going to set fire to their families when I kick my flamethrower out of storage. I'm sorry, but that's not a scathing letter. What you've written is a death threat. You mean there's a difference? Can I help you in some way? Come to think of it, you can. Oh no. Would you go oh, fetch no. me my flamethrower? Where no. is it? No, I won't be doing that. Oh. And here I thought you were the <laughs> kind of young man who believed in standing up for what's good and right. I thought you believed in chivalry. I I'd, I'd get her a flamethrower. That involves flamethrowers. Fine. Can you at least mail my scathing letter to the Mulch Emporium for me? That I can I'm do. Not comfortable with that. Isn't that like being an accomplice? Technically, I don't know, but trust me, Sonny, you don't want to get on my shit list. So again, will you mail out my letter? <sighs> yes. I'll think about it. Well, why don't you think about walking over to the nurse's station, grabbing it out of my purse, and then heading outdoors to put it in the mailbox so I don't have to set your house on fire. Holy shit! I guess you best be getting on with it then, Sonny. Who knows, maybe I'll even give you a reward for doing me this Ooh. favor. I guess I, uh... Yeah, okay. Uh, Wookie Webster, thank you for that host, friendo. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. It, it took it took a death threat from an old woman to get you to host me? That's what took so fucking long? What's wrong with you? <laughs> Sounds like somebody needs to get this old timer a CPAP machine. My dad has one of those. Thanks, but I think I'll pass on adding fondling the unconscious elderly to my permanent record. Your loss. Say there, mister. What you watching? Quit your chin wagon. I can't hear my story. All I see is static. Perhaps you'd like me to embark on a quest to fix the channel for you. Remote. Don't you dare go messing with the TV. If I miss this episode, I won't know what's going on in the next one. You would have got jack shit. That's more like, right? <laughs> Hey, uh, yeah, dude, yeah, you gotta get you some, uh, you, you gotta get you some sleep. I know you already entered, but don't forget, uh, just in case, you know, just in case you don't win the giveaway, go wishlist it on Steam if you haven't already. It comes out tomorrow. It comes out tomorrow. Pretty sure it'll be more snow and static. Winter is coming. Enough of your belly aching. This is the best part. You do realize that TV is busted, right? Not as busted as your face is gonna be if you don't get the hell away from me, you little whipper shit. <laughs> whipper shit. <laughs> Do you even know what year it is? It's the year where I lose all my inhibitions and manners on a kid who won't stop interrupting my stories. I'm gonna get fought, aren't I? What? I actually, I don't know. Uh, I'm Pretty not. I, I have zero idea how much it's actually gonna end up being. Timer. I'll know in a few hours. <laughs> ticking time bomb called my fist. And let me tell you, when it goes off, there won't be nobody left to pull out of this foxhole. 
Oh. What's happening on your, uh, stories? Oh, you watch them too? Margaret got the family back to the cabin before the big storm hit. Looks like they might be okay for now, if that pack of coyotes doesn't come back for the ducks. Yeah, but how are they going to feed themselves with them coyotes out there? They can't stay shacked up in that cabin forever. Cannibalism. Margaret's got a good head on her shoulders, and she's bringing up those kids right. As long as they work together, a pack of coyotes won't be much of a problem. I gotta say, I kind of have a crush on Margaret. That scene of her trying on new pantaloons got me all hot and heavy. Wait. How dare you? Lusting after a recent widow like that? She's got mouths to feed, and here you are ogling her. You keep your eyes off anything that isn't a damn coyote. Will you go to prom, you with, to prom me? with me? Lost a lot of good men to prom. Uh. Some of them came back, but you know, they didn't really come back. Not, you um. Can see the loss in their <laughs> eyes. Damn it. Stairs and all. So, is that a yes? Out of respect for my fallen comrades, no. Besides, I'd rather walk backwards naked through a cattail patch than be your date, Thimble Dick. All of the insults. All of them. Well, have fun watching TV, dude. Later. Well, it's about damn time. I can't watch what happens to Margaret with you yabbering my ear off all goddamn day. I want to be him when I get older. I want to be him when I get older, 100%. Wait. Okay, I can't go that way. I can only go this way. But can I go this way? What's this way? Ah! Jump on in, buddy! Boom. Wait, you need some... <laughs> I know, dude! We're gonna... I'm gonna need all the aloe. Ew, the water's all purple now. Fucking ants! I'm so clean, you can eat off me. Now to deliver these photos and get out of here before they make me a lifelong resident. Hold on, before we go, before we go. Can I take no it? I saw what happened in Friday the 13th part two. Holy shit. Hold on. I know that reference. Okay, so in Friday the 13th part two, Jason kills a guy in a wheelchair, but he hits him in the face with his machete backwards and it sticks in his face and the dude in the wheelchair goes down the stairs. I, wow, that is an obscure reference and I understood it. Jimmy and Anna. Can you feel its pain? Oh. I. Wow. Friday the 13th Part 2 was the first one that actually Jason was the primary killer in. He, um. Wait, where's the nurse station? Good afternoon. But, yeah, he didn't get his oh, hockey mask till number three, it. though. I just got it replaced. Works like a charm now. Tick tock. Oh, is that what so that was? I've never, I've never seen Fern Gully. When I was a pilot, the air traffic controller was a woman. Very unusual. I took note of her kindness and gentle voice, but I wish I could have smelled her through the controller. <laughs> Rutabaga. Do you have any other regrets? Regrets? Oh, I'm full of them, but I wasn't sure if the boat would float. Good golly, it did, though. Took us wherever we needed to go, and boy, did we get some serious VD. Never did find the bodies. Sturdy boat, good sails. That's TMI for a question I never asked. <laughs> Fair. Cool bolo tie. I do like Did your, your bolo tie. Give you that. You know who you remind me of? The Rita Hayworth. She wasn't as pretty as the other girls of her time, but boy, did she have talent. Huh. Thanks. I don't get a lot of compliments, so I'll have to I'll check it out. I, I never watched it. You gotta take it where you can get it, Sonny. To be honest, everyone was simply amazed at just how much blood that boy could lose. The floor was like lava, but sticky instead of hot. Sometimes I see it when I close my eyes. Okie dokie. Psst, come on over here. I got something to tell you. You'll find the naked ladies in the dumpster. They're blind, but golly are they beautiful. Don't tell them I sent you though. Double okey, double dokey. How do you like Golden Hands? What? <laughs> it was 3 p.m. on a Sunday when my wife died. Boy, did it rain that day. But the chicken on the roof told us not to touch the green goo, so we went down to the A&W to get some root beer. Back in those days, the root was just a stick they put in your beer. Sometimes I get sad now. What little I understood of that sounded pretty sad. Well, you know what they say. It takes two to tango, but two birds in the hand will eat the whole bush before the early bird even wakes up. 
Ever since then, I've left a trail of breadcrumbs. At the time, everyone was doing it, so even the police didn't mind. I'm honestly not following. I can't believe I have a son, especially a white one. <laughs> Wait. Have you got a problem with me? <laughs> I love to, little honky, but I'm married. My wife used to make the most glorious key lime pie. Oh. Real key limes and everything. I used to say to her, I used to say, Mary, your pie is the key lime to my heart. And we would laugh and laugh. That was surprisingly lucid. I told him it would never be deep enough. But far be it from me to argue with a grave digger. Long story short, not deep enough. Do you have any other stories about Whoa. your wife? Oh, no, I never married. I was a sailor. I was married to the sea. Couldn't tie this old schooner down. Except maybe for an evening if those legs were long enough. Meow. Oh. Say, would you like to see my coin collection? Sure. Sure. So, are you going to show it to me? Show you what now? Your coin collection. I was all, ex I was all excited. Why would I want to see your coin collection? I have one of my own. No, I... You... You offered to show me your coin collection. I don't have your coin collection, son. That's your business. And business is closed. <laughs> what I'm trying to say is, I'd be happy to see your coin collection. Coins or beans, you can't grow tobacco in a turnip patch. But boy, we sure tried back in my day. I think it's pill time for you, dude. I've once seen a man with bamboo shoes shoved under his fingernails. And he wasn't even a panda. I um. I better ramble on from this rambling on. Let's let's move on. Yeah, so I killed a few men. So what? We were fighting the good fight, and a damn good fight it was. Where was the nurses' station? Wasn't it in here? Yeah, in here. Let's let's go get that letter. Where where where's that letter? And why is there? Why is there lotion and tissue here? We got the skating letter. Time to go find a mailbox. Are we going to address this though? Did I ever tell you the oh. definition of hand sanitizer? It's washing your hands over and over again. It's oh, it's hand sanitizer. That would be bad. The bacteria still remains. Some hand sanitizer. The cool boys sometimes drink this to get drunk. Kind of sad, really. The ones for the bathroom. I don't want to deprive the nurse of her medication. It's worth a shot. I'll save the smoking for after I have sex. Any day now. That's <laughs> it. Okay, we got the scathing letter. We can do all that. Let's go, uh... Let's go ahead and go do the thing. The thing with the thing at the, at the place. It's 3.30 in the afternoon. We have not burned very much time in this game. <laughs> Crushing the snort and smarties to look cool. I, I knew a couple of kids that did that. It was I was not one of them, although I was tempted. All right, Bernie. Look at my grandma's snatch. Hi, um, Mr. Bernie. Huh? What? Who let you in here? What do you want, Pipsqueak? Rude. My grandma wanted me to um deliver these uh photos to you. Hot damn! It's about time. What took you so long? Well, first I had to knock down a wasp's net. I don't give a shit! <laughs> an unlimited time here! So for all future deliveries, make sure to put a rush on them before my dick falls off! <laughs> Is there anything you want me to tell Grandma? Tell my little honey bucket I can't wait for her to do that thing she does to me when she removes her dentures. Mm. Ugh, that's just too much. Oh, and tell her I talked to Gertrude, and she's game for that three-way. Can't you just write her a note so I don't have to tell her these things? Fuck no, I've got some salacious snapshots to spank my chef to. I can't be wasting my time writing letters to her. You can bring her one thing, though. <laughs> oh my god. Head over to the main commons area and find Monty. Can't miss him. He's the one who's always sleeping. Rifle through his pockets till you find them virility pills that he uses on all of his mistresses. And bring the bottle to your grandma. She'll know what to what? do with them. 
This sounds like something a kid my age really shouldn't be involved with. I agree. And the sooner you finish doing it, the sooner you can move on with your sad excuse for our life. So hop to it. Okay. I know where I, I know where Monty is. I remember sleeping Monty. I don't remember if I'm going the right way here, but I remember Monty. Nope. I mean, I guess we could have went around that way. This place is one giant circle jerk. Cir circle. Circle. There he is. Please don't wake up, old man. I'm just borrowing your drugs. Uh, huh? Huh? What the hell do you think you're doing, lip dick? I I'm just getting these pills for my... Looks like we got ourselves a burglar. No, wait! You don't understand! I... Get him! Thief! Vandal! Wait! Hold on! I I, I didn't... I, I can explain! Thief! Don't move! Get on the ground! Put your hands up! Hands behind your head! Now! Now put your legs behind your head! Now roll around a little bit! I said don't move! Stop resisting! <laughs> Ow! Damn, this stuff is spicy. Well, another by the book arrest. Can we just take him downtown and brutally beat him within the confines of the law? Not today, I'm afraid. Turns out this perp is a miner. A miner? Ew, I can't believe I touched it. So what you're saying is this will go on his... His permanent record. No. Oh, damn. Even better. Goodness me, what's going on? Well, I'm afraid your grandson got into a bit of trouble down at the retirement home. Don't worry, though. The long arm of the law gave him a long spanking. <gasps> oh, my. My coop? Oh, I hope he wasn't too much trouble, officers. No trouble God damn all, it, ma'am. Not after we showed up. It's too bad we don't get perps this tiny more often. They're a lot of fun to take down. Better keep an eye on this one. Well, thank you for bringing him back, officers. I'll take the punishment over from here. Will you be needing this? <laughs> no, thanks. I'm sure I've got a bedpan or two that could use some cleaning. Ew, yuck. Yeah, let's get out of here before this gets ugly. I've already gone through trauma therapy twice. Have a good night, officers. <laughs> I'm sorry, Grandma. What the fuck, man? <laughs> You're bringing the fuzz to my doorstep? What do I always say? Those pigs want to snatch my crops. Me? If it wasn't for your weird, horny, chore, and violent boyfriend, I wouldn't have been there in the first place. I didn't raise no narc. You're an adult now, Cooper. Not legally. You can be tried as one, and that would really harsh my mellow. Just tuck your stupid puberty hormones back in your pants before you end up behind bars. This is unacceptable, Cooper. You need to be punished. Oh, no. What? Wh Why? Wh wh what would the neighbors think if I didn't set an example and knock your trick ass down a peg? <laughs> Let me you by the window so they can see. What punishment could be worse than being tormented every waking moment at school, all while living with my horny, strung out grandma? <gasps> Cooper! Those hormones must be out of control! You've never spoken to me like this before. Well, Mr. Big Pants, how about no field trip tomorrow? How do you like them rutabagas? No, I hate them rutabagas. Aww. You can't do this. Too bad, Buster. I gotta keep my hose on a leash. God damn it. You don't care about what I'm going through. Poor Coop. Oh, hi. No, you treat me more like an errand boy than a grandson. You say I'm going through a phase? What about your creepy golden year sexual renaissance, huh? You only care about yourself. But. You don't care about me, Grandma. Grandmas just don't understand. I'm a complicated, unique teen going through unique problems that nobody could possibly understand. Coop, I had no idea. You don't want me. Nobody wants me. Not as a friend, not as a prom date, not as a grandson. I'll always be remembered as the freak no one wants. I wish I died in the car crash with my parents instead of being raised by you. I Ow. suppose you know best. Yeah, and as soon as I graduate, I'm running away forever. So you won't have to deal with my hormones. Then I won't have to give a damn about what happens to this suck-ass town. Or you. Oh. Why do I keep acting out? Why do I only make things worse? 
What the hell is wrong with me? Maybe Ken is right. Maybe I am a stupid dick-lipped loser. Psionic Steve, I'll bet you never got yelled at by your grandma. I mean, if your grandma wasn't eaten alive in your tragic backstory, that is. No, you always do the exact right thing. How Aww. do you do it? I wish you were here to show me. You'd stand up to my bullies, not run from them. You'd help the elderly, not steal their sex pills. You'd have a prom date and be a somebody, not a lonely nobody. And if you were here, you'd show me how to be the hero of the story, and not a worthless freak. But you're not here. You're not even real. And I am all alone. I guess I'll go to sleep and try to forget about this suck-ass day. Maybe tomorrow I'll finally stand up for myself, get a prom date, and be somebody worth remembering. Maybe tomorrow will be better. Hopefully better than all of my yesterdays. <sighs> Good night, Steve. Poor Coop. Damn. The next day. Coop. You there? Does this thing still work? <gasps> Sawyer's calling on the friend zone phone. Of course it's called the friend zone phone. Seahorse to sawhorse, come in. <laughs> use proper CB lingo. Over. I'm over the radio lingo. Can you not be weird for like two seconds? This is important. Roger that. Reading you loud and clear. Over. Whatever. Anyway, have you been outside? Ken and his butthole patrol have been gunning for you all morning. They've like got some big end of school prank to pull on you or something. Might have to do with your butthole? Ugh. Over. Get Zooks! I can't skip school today. How the hell are my butthole and I supposed to avoid them? Today's a big field trip to the bomb shelter. You coming? I mean, I know they won't be going on the trip because Kent and his pals think that school buses are the chariots of the poor. Aww. Jesus, how do you know all of this? Over. I have dirt on everyone in this town, Coop. By the way, your hamster's dead. What? Oh, no, he's just a sleepy little boy. Aren't oh, ya? yes, you are. He is Over. not asleep. Get over here, Duder. If you can make it to the school, at least you'll be safe today. But there's no way Grandma will sign my permission slip after my very recent felony arrest. Here we go. Yeah, I heard. Didn't take you as the type of guy to grope senior citizens. Pretty thirsty for a prom date, aren't you? God damn it. What? No, it wasn't my fault. Look, I'll tell you about it later. <sighs> Any good ways to get past Kent and his shithead lackeys? You're on your own there, bud. I can't fight all your fights for you. Just watch out for them. They've been on a stakeout on Knothole Street, near the school entrance. If you can get around them, you're good as gold. Just do me a favor and try not to end up like your hamster, okay? Fat chance. I'm not even tired. All right. Well, I'll see you on the bus. Over and out, Duder. Wait, before you go... Can you make it quick? These covert government conspiracies aren't going to uncover themselves. <laughs> I was wondering... W will you really be my prom date? If you help me find out what shady secrets our town has, everyone's gonna owe you one. Oh yeah. So... Yes, if you help me out, I'll be your prom date. Plus, we all know prom is just a vapid social construct made to subjugate the masses into competing in pageantry for a plastic crown that is neither with glory nor power. <laughs> yeah, totally. Prom T sucks. Totally. Besides, Imagine the look on Kent's face when he sees me walking into prom with someone like you. <laughs> right. It'll be hilarious. Oh. All right. Get out there. Damn it. Try not to be <laughs> Good luck. Okay. Love you. I mean, seahorse over and out. Hopefully not forever. Shit. If Grandma doesn't sign my permission slip, Ken and his gang are going to curb stomp me. Or worse. There's got to be a way to forge your signature. We'll figure this out together, buddy. I feel like playing with my hamster's ghost. Okay, at least you understand that he's actually dead. We need to find something to forge her signature. There's got to be something around here somewhere. There's a check. There's a check. Check it, check it, check it out. I found a check. Boom. Now, let's go. You can go in here. You can put... Oh, wait, wrong one. 
we could put the check on here. Then we could put the permission slip. And then we can sign it. Yes. Perfect. Hey, if I can get this slip to school without Ken and his gang finding me, I can avoid a beating and possibly live to see tomorrow. Nice. Okay. Whoops. Why did why was there a little like a little what appeared to be clansmen for uh, a doll there? All right, we got to figure out a way around. I think I know. I think I have an idea. Yep, I can go this way. Shit! Can't Brittany and Chad are waiting right there to do their big murder prank on me. Brittany, two T's, two eyes. School when they're blocking the way. God damn it! Okay. Beat down bypass. This way. Maybe. This. Wait, hold on. Is there? Can I take some of this? That's not mine. These, well, I. Mean, I wouldn't want to mess these. It's yours if you take it, sir. You don't have to be so goody two shoes. Free tires. See. Just take it. They're free. While they look great, I don't think these are a match for my bike. That's fair. Okay. Oh, can I take a leaf blower? Maybe this can blow me over the wall somehow. And that's not a fellatio joke. No? Okay, wait. Sorry, dinosaurs. We need your bones more than you do. Do I still have any matches? I don't have any matches, do I? Darn. Okay. Can I climb this? Even my Hulk like strength can't push through this wall. I'm gonna have to find a way over it. Okay, so we gotta find a way over the wall. I I, I can't turn these on? Okay. Hold on. We can do a hint. Build a contraption to get past the bullies. Bling sucks, but it's time to get over it. Huffing gas isn't the only way to get high. I'm not tall enough to catch that bag. I need something sticky to I don't do I have anything I don't have anything sticky at the moment. Alright, let's see if we can find something sticky to catch that bag with. Uh I can't use this. Is there something in the trash? I'm not into raccoon roll. No, what about this? Can I take the rag? Thanks, but I'm not doing any oil changes today. What about the clipboard? What do I look like? A survey taker? No. Maybe. I'll put this outfit on, but don't go hey. expecting a lube job for me or anything. Eh. I can't get up there. Okay. Let's see. I like chicken. I wouldn't mind some chicken. Wait, what is this? Is that a porn mag? Porno mag? Porn for the blind? Wait, isn't looking at porn what makes you go blind? I'm so confused. I'll be right back. We really found braille porn. I'm gonna go give this man some braille porn. Ooh. Uh, it, assuming it, it, I'm assuming it was good since you ate your weight in it. It was it was it was the tastiest. Let's go give this blind man some porn. It's called knock knock. Check it out! I found you a braille magazine. Holy shit, kid! This is the latest issue of Busty Braille. Bands. Yeah, we were. Uh, yeah, great. I'm glad you're happy. Happy? I'm more than happy. Here, feel this page. I really don't want to. I said feel it. Okay, fine. I did it. You happy? Congrats, kid. You just got to second base. Really? I didn't know second base felt so sticky. Blech. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got some reading to do with both hands. Suck it, mailman. Wait, what is that? Oh, a stamp. Not to focus on so wait, so I could put the stamp on the letter. Combining the stamp with a letter? Genius! Oh. I patiently await my honorary Mensa scholarship. Nice. Then we can take letter, bam. Well, I mailed her letter. I don't feel good about it, but I did it. Guess I better go tell Gertie the uh, good news. I don't know that I really feel like going back in there with Gertie. But I do. I'm going to go tell her. I need to know. At least I can go in the front door. Because they're just not going to kick me out. That dude is still dead. Just chilling. Gertie, give me something give, give me something cool for mailing your death threat. Hi. Um, I mailed your letter out. Excellent. Run into any trouble? 
Trouble? Uh, nope. It was just a matter of finding a stamp and mailing out a letter. How hard could that possibly be? Right? Nobody could possibly get hurt doing such a simple task. Oh, I could think of lots of ways to hurt people. Fucking Gertie. I'm sure you could. Look, are we done here? Almost. First, I need to give you your reward for doing me that favor. Uh, it's okay. I just want to... I insist. Come over here, Sonny. Aw. Ow! Your kisses feel like Velcro. Oh. Uh, this isn't exactly the reward I expected. You're welcome. Be sure to tell everyone that you got it from sweet old Gertie. Gee, uh, thanks. I will. Bye now. <sighs> My reward for all that was a smooch from some psychotic old lady? Oh, but see, I want I still want to wear the dick on my face. Whoops. Where's the Is it under my costumes? Oh, it's here, here. There we go. Draw the dick. There we go. With we're going to put the condom back on. <laughs> Suck it. Feels like Velcro, it's nastiness. At least we could just like walk out the front door now. I think. Wait, did I go the wrong way? Can I pick this up? Touching a dirty. Oh. Did did I go out the wrong door? Was it this way? Am I lost? Oh no! I forgot which way I came from. I need out of this old place. Oh, it's this way. Front door's okay. It's it's there. Okay, we got the we got the smooch face thing. All right. So now we got to figure out a way to build a contraption. Wait, what is this? Oh, the I never got the anchovy chips. Okay, to get past the bullies. The hint being, bullying sucks, but it's time to get get over it. Huffing gas isn't the only way to get high. So I need I need to find a way to basically get that stupid trash bag. If I can find a way to get that trash bag, I'm golden. And that's it. That's all I gotta do. So maybe there is something in there I can snatch to, to do that with. Which is saying a lot, because, I don't know, I like the word snatch. Um, okay. Can't really use that for anything. I don't think there was anything in here I can grab. Wait, what? Well, I'd love to be tough like John Grizzly and over the top. I'm not gonna drink gas from a can. That is a that that is that is a full blown condom. It is a condom. Can I throw tampons <laughs> at it? <laughs> no. Maybe it's worth a try. Maybe there's something not here that I'm gonna have to. Blowers. Cool. These are great for propelling things. Maybe you? Hey, bird. Really want a tetanus shot? Really? Don't point at me. Heh. <laughs> okay, I need to go find a way to get that that plastic bag. I'm gonna need either a ladder or something to hook that with. No thanks, I already ate. Ew. Hey you. Howdy, partner. I'm beat it, kid. You can go fuck yourself too. You didn't have anything in here, did you? I can't just like snatch up this propane tank, Why? can I? I'm not having a barbecue. With a shot. Okay, how do I go about this? Can I just walk up here and get my ass beat? I'm not walking over there. Okay, no. <laughs> waiting to kick my ass into next week. Okay, we gotta find a way over that wall. But how? It sure does look like it'd come in handy, but it's empty. Maybe a log? Ow! Quit giving me goddamn splinters, wooden objects! My bad! What about you? You got you got anything I could- Hey Jimmy, those condoms thick enough for you? They're plenty thick, but they're ice cold. Sorry still? about that. Only way I can get them to you. They should thaw out before prom, and they'll probably still taste like uranium punch. Sounds great. Hey Coop, here's a little tip. Women love the taste of flavored condoms. They actually eat bowls of them for breakfast. I'll put that tip in the maybe pile. Okay. No. I don't need any gasoline. Where am I missing something? Hmm. 
kind of feel like that would have been the thing to, to get, but I wish I still had that cane. If I still had that cane, I would be, wait. While they look great, I don't think these are a match for my bike. The dumb part is I could literally put that right there if I was strong enough. Wait, if you want to have a good time, call balls and leave a message. Okay, gas is expensive. Yeah, maybe home is the place to look because I didn't really do much exploring around home after. Can I just steal a flamingo? Nah, they may be lawn ornaments, oh. but they still might try to bite me. What? <laughs> hey, Airfly, how are you doing today? Okay, let's see here. That's some long. Oh, that's some long, smooth wood. Also, don't forget. Boom. That's the thing. Maybe there's something in the attic. Well, alive is better than not in most cases. So at least you got that going for you. <laughs> it's tucked away up here for a reason. That reason? Somebody was too lazy to throw it in the trash. I feel like with it saying something about sucking, it... Can I, can I turn on the light? Oh, sure. I'll just turn out the lights in this attic. Maybe then I can break my neck a little easier. Just a thought. I feel like... Okay, I'm not really seeing anything up here. The ladder. Those are some well hung rungs. Nope. Damn it. Hmm. But where? Does not appear to be anything in here. Was there something in my room I could take? Crusty socks, perhaps? change my underwear in the morning or after I've been punched in the gut hard enough to soil them. Fair. Crusty socks? No. Okay. We're going to figure this out. No, you can promote just about anything you want to as long as it's not porn. And I wouldn't be opposed to porn, but it might get me in trouble. So that's the only reason we really we, we avoid the porn. Mm. Toast? My hand is burnt. Great. That's fair. I'm sorry. Those cookies are older than I am. I couldn't eat them if I tried. Gross. Is there anything new in the fridge? Nope. Is there anything in the backyard? Perhaps. Can I steal this ladder? I cannot. Grandma makes me touch enough gross things without adding her. Oh, those are hers. Tempting, but it's not my size. Also, Grandma has sex in this thing. Gross. There was nothing else up here other than... I do sometimes push it and pretend a friend is on the swing. Aww. Okay, is... Can I reach that? Can't reach it? Don't want it? Forget about it. Okay. You got it, pal. Watch, it's gonna end up being something super simple and I'm just fucking being dumb. That's, that's how 90% of these things work usually. I could totally climb this pole, but I left my climb. Oh, that's right. We already did that one. Oh, wait. I forgot. Kitchen's one room. Hmm. How often do you touch your... Oh, yeah. I keep forgetting. I don't want to touch her. Uh-huh. You're Sounds about right. IRS? Oh, no. That sounds bad. But I get my taxes done at the Ichinar block. The Ichinar? Uh huh. Oh, I see. Let me write you a check. Do I make it out to the IRS or to you, Mark? You only take iTunes cards. I've never put seven thousand dollars into gift cards before. If you say so. Uh huh. And the IRS only takes gift cards because. Right. When you say it like that, it makes perfect sense. I know one store where I can get iTunes cards, but it's 20 minutes from here. Mm-hmm. Oh, but I don't really like to drive. Well, I suppose I could call for a ride from Beatrice. Uh-huh. Old Kip Boga and messes with I people like this. Stick the police on me. Hold on. Let's start from the beginning. God damn it, Grandma. Okay, let's see. I'm not allowed to drive it. Besides, oh. I wouldn't want to mess up that vintage. I want that car. I, I freaking love uh, wood panel station wagons. 
just to conserve energy. Okay, I'm not seeing anything at home. So we're, we're missing something somewhere that's very obvious, and I'm not, like, I don't know. They said something about sucking, so I'm wondering if I need a vacuum. Or something to that measure. Oh, whoops. Because this, okay, there's nothing in, in here. Fun fact, every time you turn a light on in a video video game, technically, it is being actually, like, it's actually Maybe using electricity. But Maybe that's not a bad thing in this case. Can I shut this door? No? Okay, hold on. Maybe this can blow me over the wall somehow. And that's not a fellatio joke. Okay, it can. I just need to get that. Hmm. Let's see. Wait. Can I go to any of these places? What about you? You're weird. Do you have something I can use? Fuck no. After that ridiculous talk we just had, the last thing I want to do is strike up another conversation with that wacko. You know what? That's fair. That's fair. I understand. He kind of sucks. Okay, we can't go that way. Wait, can I just climb sure over the just car? Set off the car lock. Oh, damn. I. He is. He's still eating that chicken. It's been over a day. It's always nice to stop and smear my hands on all the car windows. Where was that? I, I, I remember seeing that. The one out in front of his house, right? Buns. Oh yeah, I purposefully left I purposely left the dick on his face. I heard that flypaper causes autism, so I'm just gonna take it away for you. Good work! I'm not not vaccinated for nothing. Good call, Buns! Whoops. <laughs> I wish that would work, but alas. That's still not gonna work though. Oh, there it goes. I just hit the wrong thing. Whoosh. Well, hello there, Music Ryan. How are you doing, friend? You beautiful floating plastic bag, you. Someday I'll return you to the wild so you can dance freely once again. Oh. Okay. Now we should be able to power these things on and fly over, right? Fly, Mary Poppins, fly. We got it. Look, there he is. Oh no! He's using ingenuity! That's right, jerks! Up here I'm untouchable, and there's nothing you can do about- Oh, got him! We're coming to kick your ass, you little queef! Shit, 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 shit! Ah, time for my favorite part. What delightful little joke do you have for me this time, Mr. Popsicle Stick? Why is the Cyclops such an effective teacher? Hmm, well, I can only assume it's his passion for education, but let's see. Because he only has one pupil! <laughs> it's the eye! It's the one eye! Because he's a Cyclops! Yes! Jesus Christ! Oh, shit, why does it keep doing that, my boy? Whoops. Uh, uh, did you get it? He's over there, next to the Cyclops. Aw, the joke's funnier when it's not about you. Ah! Uh, uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You're dead, you fucking reject. <sighs> okay, I should be safe in here. In this terrifying laboratory. Oh. Get the eyeball, there's gonna be a retinal scanner somewhere. about this I think you're I think you're good if I touch this I might get dumber I'll mess with these weird science speakers later why though the weird science speakers mess with them now he has I'll Ow, fuck. lasers in the doorway I forget how do they reveal security laser beams in all those spy movies spraying stuff do I have anything I could spray in here is there anything in here They're locked the name Locker. Uh -huh, uh -huh. It's uh, a little too late for CPR. Nah. 
I don't see anything of use here on these shelves. Hmm. It has no pulse. Shit. It's a fucking. Can I just leap over? This window doesn't even. I can't just walk no out, can I? I don't want to open the door. It's the aggro crag from Guts. I'm too short. Thanks for the reminder. Sorry. Wait, what if I pull this book? Boom. I got a Bible. Uh, I meant to do that. That's only gonna keep them out for so long. I better find another way out of here. You're doing great. There's gotta be a there, there's a vent right here. Can I get into that vent and climb through? I think I've done enough damage here already. Wait, hold on. No, no, no. There's gotta be a way up here, right? Or did, oh, chalk dust. How can erasers get me out of this? Oh, I got you, dude. I got you. We can take these and go here with them. Boom. Big thonks. Oh. Oh, there you go. Go. Run through. Look at me. I'm like a super spy. Dodging laser beams. Okay. Back to trying not to die. Yes. If Kent gets in here, I'm sure that's one of the first spots he'd look for me. I don't think Kent's going to get in here, my guy. And if he does, is that syrup? I wouldn't be able to do anything with these lab notes. Is this... Is this Canada land? A Canadian vial containing a secret formula or something to pour on waffles. Only time will tell. Canadian. Oh, sure. I'll just go mess with the screen that says danger in huge letters. Really? Well, I mean, it's not a horrible idea. Is there a retinal scanner there? Aha. the most ominous thing I've ever seen. It's all good. Just go. Oh, look at all these chemicals. Can we fucks with them? Jesus! B -b what the hell is all of this? There's nowhere for you oh, to shit. Run. Here we go. We've got you now, bitch nips. We're gonna make you eat your own face. Wait, how's that even possible? Shut up, tits for balls! You are so dead! The insults! Uh, guys, I think you're taking this bullying thing a little too far. Oh, here we go. Come on, get him! Fuck him up, kid! Motherfucker. Interesting. Okay. Hey, uh, DM me that link too. DM that link to me somewhere. You can find me just about anywhere here. We'll take a look at it. saw that too, huh? And that is part one of Side Night and Happiness's Freak Apocalypse. Oh, it is a trilogy. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. I, I wasn't sure how many parts that comes in. Interesting. Well, needless to say, if you kind of stuck around this long, thank you so much for watching. I know it's a lengthy boy, but 
I appreciate you being here. Um, so that was part one of three. The other two parts will be coming somewhere down the road. We don't know when yet, but we hope to see you then and hope you have a good night.